I've never seen that little film before. Isn't it fantastic? Hello, my name's John Scott. I've got laryngitis, but I'll be fine. Um, I, if you don't know who I am, I work next door on our sister channel, but I am G-I-H-A, just so you know. I know. I used to work at Rocks and Co years and years ago. Anyway, I'm here with you this lovely Saturday morning. We've got such a fantastic show. Debbie Kershaw's here. She'll be waving. Oh, there she is. Give us a wave. Hello. Aww. And we've only got Dave Troth on as well later. I know, it's gorgeous. We've got so many gorgeous things. And at half past eight, oh, listen to my voice already. I do apologize. Half past eight. Now, do you want to see these like this or do you want to see the film? These, <gasps> oh, look. That's treasure, John, right? Isn't there? that beautiful? Half past eight. Half past eight. Perido. You don't buy them individually. They come like that. They cut, you buy all of those, and I'm not going to tell you the price, but it is phenomenal. How much do you think you'd pay for that many peridots? Text in, how much? They're guessing in the gallery there. Would you know they've got the bit of paper there? <laughs> anyway, 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 anyway. Uh, uh, what are you doing today? What are you making today? Can't nothing, I can't be bothered. <laughs> oh, <sorry. laughs> Okay, that's nice. No, I'm only joking. <laughs> I'm making, um, I've got leather and hematite. I'm going to do a wrap bracelet demo. Um, and we've also got some gorgeous new settings. So I'm going to be setting some stones. I'll be showing you how to use the pin vise in more detail to help you set stones. So loads of fun stuff today. Gorgeous, can't wait. Can't, I'll be sitting over there with her when we come to it as well. I've also got, look at these. I've never heard of these before. Papaya, these are. Look at, look at the colour. Look at the gorgeous colour. Fresh water pearls. And Mother Nature makes them that colour. In my microphone. I, 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 we'll see what happens. Are some of these microphones going, is it yours? Is it your necklace? Some of these microphones going crazy in there. Anyway, I've got, oh, I've just got so much gorgeousness, but should we start? Should we start? Let's do it, says Ben Tom. I've got Ben Tom, I've got Ollie, I've got lovely Mike, and we've got gorgeous Kinga there. Oh, there's Ben. Hang on, Kinga, not you yet. Oh. That's Ben, Tom and Ollie there. This is Kinga. Now, Kinga. Kinga and Mike. <laughs> oh. Is who said that? Excuse my hair. Oh, Ben, Tom said excuse his hair. He got out of bed, he got out of bed the wrong side this morning. Anyway, I'll just explain. I've had laryngitis for two weeks. Uh, it's, it's much, 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 much better. I'm not in any pain. I'm not contagious. I've not got COVID. Um, I've got my hot lemon. I've got my water. I've got my strawberries. I'm ready to go. I'm just a bit gravelly this morning. Some people are finding it quite sexy. Um, talking about quite sexy, Dave Trotter's up later. I oh, know. Right, where am I going to start? These. These are gorgeous. Good morning. Get your messages in, by the way. Get your message in. You're watching Jewelry Maker with John Scott. Oh, GIA trained, it's supposed to say. <clears throat> right, here we go. These are spinel. They're fasted. They're two millimetres. 38 centimetre. You've got seven carrots here. Mm. Oh, look at them. Oh, look at them. Trees. Now, isn't red spinel, am I wrong here, but isn't red spinel the one of the rarest ones there are? Mm -hmm. Isn't red spinel the one that's in that crown in the crown jewels that they think is a ruby. They thought of the Prince of Wales ruby, but actually a red spinel. Isn't spinel what they call the, um, uh, when it pretends to be something else, the masquerader? Yeah. Anyway, 12 99 that's good. Oh, it's not my price. Oh, I'm not used to this falling auction malarkey, am I? 12 99 it's not your price. What's he going on about in there? <laughs> It's a very, $6.99, $6.99. You're getting all of these, look, there's 38, millim, 38 centimetres. Look at them, aren't they gorgeous? Two millimetre, what are you gonna do with them? Where are you gonna put them? Are you gonna use spacers? Oh, are you gonna make a stretchy bracelet? Morning, John, love seeing you back this morning. So Josephine, Josephine, thank you. It's my only shift, they only give, Wayne only uses me when there's absolutely nobody else available. So just so you know. <coughs> it's true. It's true, though. Thank you. They're all excited to see me in the gallery, apparently. Okay, moving on. Right, now I've had instructions from Kinga, right? <laughs> when I've used something, I have to put it here because it's very easy for her then to collect it. So let's put it there. <laughs> Number two. 
I'm only joking, Kinga. I'm only joking. <laughs> there we go. She's gorgeous, Kinga. You love her. Oh, yes, dear. Thank you. Uh, natural multicolored saf sapphires in the round. Oh, that's very interesting, isn't it? Lovely and subtle, isn't it? Beautiful colours in there. Can you see? If you, when you look at it close to you, you can see all the different colours. 110 carats, look. Beautiful. Keep going through for everything. <coughs> remember that member? The, I couldn't hear you, Ben Tom, at all. Oh, yeah, you haven't got me switched on, that's why. Ben Tom's been talking to me and I couldn't hear him. At 9.99. I thought it was, I thought it was his lovely and quiet. 9.99. 110 carats. He's ever so loud. Now. Oh, look at that red one at the back there. Now, they're all, obviously all going to be random. They will be random. But look at the lovely... T oh, moving on. Finally. We're not taking any prisoners this morning, are we? And they want five in a little box. Yeah. White Ratnakiri Zircon. White Ratnakiri Zircon. Now, Ratnakiri Zircon is normally blue, isn't it? Uh... They cushion cut. Oh, look at those. Beautiful, aren't they? Ratnakiri Zircon. Uh, it comes out one mind, doesn't it? I've got to remember this now. Where's it from? Ratnakiri. Um, aren't they beauty in Cambodia? Just beautiful. Look at that. 9 99 straight down for five gemstones. How big are they? Three millimetres, pack of five. What does the H stand for? Is that the colour? Heat treated. Oh, heat treated, sorry. I didn't know that. Nine, nine, nine to bring that clarity out. What would you make with these, Debs? I think I'd channel set them. Oh, would you? Or you could claw set them. I think they're beautiful because of the sparkle that comes off and you can yeah. pretend they're diamonds. <laughs> it's beautiful, isn't it? What's the matter? Moving on. It's very busy this morning. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Pardon? Oh, it's a clasp. He's saying clasp, clasp. And I'm like, what on earth is a clasp? Clasp. Got hematite rings coming up later. And they do them in my size, but we haven't got one in the studio. I know. I can't steal it now. I've even tried them all on. They won't fit. This is a clasp, look. Oh, you've got a close-up of my ridge. Look. Clasp. Is that Sleeping Beauty? It is. Turquoise. 925 sterling silver, class with Sleeping Beauty, round, lovely, isn't it? Hello, Margaret, my love, how are you? Keep your messages coming in. Do we not do a menu or how to get in touch or anything like that on this channel? Oh, that's nice. There you go. You have to write the word JM Studio 278070, otherwise it goes next door. We can, because Sewing Street's uh, there. Yeah. It's there, isn't it? Sewing Street's just there. And we often get your messages. We got lots the other day. Didn't we, Ben, Tom? Keep going through for this. Lovely. <clears throat> now, these are rather theatrical, if you don't mind me saying. Look at these. Yeah. Look. Dark grey, baroque drop shell. Pearls. 16 by 25. 38 centimetre strand. Aren't they lovely? How much? What? For Baroque pearls, shell pearls. Watch. I know. I know, I know, I know, I know. <coughs> oh! Oh no, Ben Tom, Ben Tom, Ben Tom. That's like, we're not doing clearance, but that's like a clearance price, isn't it? Eight ninety nine. I don't know. Are we singing now? What a feeling. It's very happy to be here is our Ben Tom. Make sure you go through, make sure you go through 38 centimetres. They're 16 by 25. Those peridots are coming up at half past 20 minutes away. You're not, tell your friends, tell your friends because you're not, have I got lots of them? Oh, apparently they've called it John Scott's early bird, but they spelt bird wrong. That's Wayne. Wayne. Oh, you wait, wait. Look at that. That's not what you're buying now. That's not your eight ninety nine. Obviously, obviously. Well, more than like eighty nine ninety nine, I'd say. 
Okay, oh, hello, Ayrshire, London. Oh, I'm moving on. I love this. Love, 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 love this. Crates of cola, this. 10 millimetre round. Look at them. They're like little earths, aren't they? 120 carats of Crates of cola. Plain rounds, 10 millimetre. What's the matter? It was Earth Day recently, yeah? Not today, though. It was also Drink a Cup of Tea Day the other day, wasn't it? It was yesterday, was it? What's that price all about, Ben Tom? Oh, uh, yeah, people know you. Get, look how many people are coming in. People know you're giving that away. Well done, Jacqueline. Of, oh, that's a nice name. Philippus. That's a lovely name, isn't it? Uh, Maker in Midlothian, Greater Manchester, Lisa. Jacqueline. They're gorgeous, aren't they? Let me hold them out for you. How beautiful, each and every one of those. £8.77. Oh, there's only eight left, seven left. Seven left of these now. Quick as you can, quick as you can. People on the web, check out, check out, check out. Four left, four left, four left. I'm not allowed to shout, Ben Tom. <laughs> I'm not allowed to shout or whisper or drink coffee. Three left. It's a set of laryngitis. I'm having a week off next, so I could be fine. Three left, two left. Oh, I love it when it's busy like this. Last, right. There are six people got that in their basket, right? Oh, now, now, what was I watching? Oh, no, I wasn't watching anything else. Something there. I had um, a guest on Sewing Street, Jules it was. She had a Labradorite ring on. These are gorgeous. What, what cut are these then? Oh, there's so many of you in for the last one. 90 carats of Labradorite. I love, look at the, oh, look at the Labradorescence. That's not what it's called, is it? The Schiller. Schiller. Is it called Schiller? Labradorescence. Oh, it is Labradorescence. Yeah, 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 oh, you yeah, see, yeah. she always go with your gut instinct. Yeah. yeah. Anyway, 90 carats, oval. <gasps> nine, nine. Look at, look at the blue. Look at that Schiller in there. It's beautiful. <laughs> right, okay. Unbelievable. 4.99. 4.99. That doesn't make any sense at all. Hello, Gabrielle. Hello, Sally Ann. Hello, Mandy. 4.99. Do you remember you only pay one p p for the whole day? You only pay one p p for the whole day. So check out as many times as you like. It's one p p That's it. We're doing what? Am I going like this then? Hang on a minute. We're going to do... Are you ready to do it now? Start by. She should be called Ninja Kinga, shouldn't she? You put a piece of jewellery down and it's, it's my, gone. Like... My friends call me Ninja. Oh, do they? Oh, there you go. Her friends call her Ninja. Right. Uh, star by, star by, star by. This is rose gold plated. This is yellow gold plated. Oh, now, how beautiful are they? Think how much these would cost you on the high street. Oh, now, Labradorite. Keep going through for your Labradorite. Loads of that. Right. Thirty-three pounds and nine. I think that's. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Stop, 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 stop. That's wrong. To under ten pounds each. They'll be under ten pounds each. So like twenty pounds for the two, surely. Rose gold and ro gold. Nine. They're ninety-five sterling. Get it's cable. No, ninety-five sterling silver. And um, look at them. So you're buying both of them. 33.99 would have been a fact. How long are they? 18 inches. 18 inches on 925 sterling silver. Here we go. Uh, oh no, a clock. Clock, 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 clock. Come on, Ollie. Where is it? Come on, Ollie, where's your clock? There it is. I'm glad they've got rid of that. When I first started working, you make that like an old oven timer thing, you know. It's a bit posher now. So what that clock means, if you've not watched this before, we will be dropping the price in 48 seconds. So it gives you time to come in, because you don't want to miss out. Because now I've already got people there already. Got people there on the phone line, people on the app. Yeah, on the high street, Ollie, how much did you pay for these?
Well, for the two of them, at least forty pounds. Sure. It's really expensive on the high street yeah. for chains. Yeah. Yeah. I was really surprised when I went, just because I hadn't looked for a few years, at how much silver. Yeah. Just silver. And it, this is 95 sterling silver underneath. It's not even base metal. It's 95 wow. sterling Wow. So silver. you need these, don't you? You need them for your pendants, for anything yeah. you've made. You need these in your stash. <coughs> of course you do. Four, three, two, one. This is going to be interesting. Watch this. 1998, 1998, 10 pounds each. What, five pounds, sorry, five pounds each? Yeah. I oh. thought they should be 9.99 each. Get but four. Not five there we go, yeah, get four. Stock up. You get both of them, don't forget, you don't choose, you get both of them. Elizabeth, Lee, Mandy, Carolyn, people multi-buying, people multi-buying, Christine's in, Elizabeth's in, <coughs> excuse me, Mandy's there, Maker's there, Maker's there. Because when you if do, that's the, sorry, I was just going to say, when you do your craft fairs, yeah, you know, sometimes you need to offer people go, oh, have you got that on an 18 inch chain or 16? So yeah. it's really useful to have different chains like behind the counter. Exactly. So that you can go, oh, I put it on this one for you. Yeah. But surely if you bought these two, they're five pounds each, you could sell them on for, oh, yeah. you know what I mean? I think people got Lynn's there. Hello, Lynn. Elizabeth's there. Christine's there. Carolyn's there. No, Ollie. Ollie, Ollie says if you, if you gift them, no one's going to think you spent five pounds on them. Cable chains is one of the most durable chains. Uh, jeans there. Uh, Ollie's friends, he's not <laughs> generous. He buys them here and then, you know. Hello, Audrey. Now, Audrey's multi bought as well. Look, jeans there. Keep going through. Lots of you there. $9.99. $9.99. Carol's there. Doreen's there. Jan's there. Uh, you could layer them up if you want to, but they'll be the same length. Oh, you mean layer it up with other chains you've got, other gold chains, other rose gold chains you've got. Another Jan's in. Well, yeah, but you could buy, like, two sets and then get the two gold ones. Put them and together. Put them together. So that's how 36. You could, yeah, that's how you could layer. Because I do a, like a long one. Eh? Like a long chain. Longer chain. With a nice, you know, pendant or a pearl, like one of the Baroque pearls. Yeah. I might have some Brock Pearls later. Uh, Barbara's, Jan, Carol. Keep going through. Hang on, hang on. Keep coming. This low. Come on. I, need, I want more of these to go. Uh, eight. Are you not up yet? Are you not up yet? Keep going through. Keep going through. Keep going through. Yeah, okay. Let me put that there. Don't forget, I've got the Peridot coming up in 11 and a half minutes' time. Can't wait, can't wait, can't wait. Look at it, look, 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 look. Come on, Ollie, show it. <laughs> good morning, everyone. I hope you had a good day. Hope you feel better soon, John. Take care. Lots of love from Debbie in Hampshire. Thank you, Debbie. How many people came in for that gold those gold chains? Look at all those people. Oh, look, have we shown the Peridot? Yeah, yeah, there they go. I want these. Have we got lots of these? You're not allowed to buy when you're on air. You remember that? I never buy when I'm on air. No. Never once ever. No, no last I just... time I was on with you, you were over there on your phone, <laughs> tapping it. She says, oh, I never buy when yeah, I'm on yeah, air. I... She left her seat and went round the corner. I'm not, I'm not on air if I crawl under the desk, am I? <laughs> <laughs> right, fluorite, fluorite, plain rounds, eight millimetres. They're nice, aren't they? Beautiful colours. Gorgeous colour. I love fluorite because it's really good for people who are studying or learning, like if you're into the, the myth and legend of gemstones. So if you've got someone that's, you know, studying for their exams or you want to give them a little present, then you uh, could even make a bookmark out of these. Oh, wow. 180 carats of fluorite, though. Eight millimetre rounds. 12.99. Beautiful. 12.99 for 180 carats. Beautiful. Let me hold it out for you. Look, 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 look. You see, I think just a lot, if you were to restrand those or re, I don't know what you call it, re thread, thread, strand, yeah. Re strand them. Just a really simple, yeah. gorgeous colour. Very spiritual purple as well, isn't it? Yeah. Lovely for stretchies as well. For what? Stretchy bracelets. Oh, stretchy bracelets, yeah. $12.99. Keep going through for that. Uh, yeah, blue diamonds. Is it this one or that one? Okay. 
I said in prep earlier, when we look at the pictures, I said to Ben Tom, are they the ones who come in the box? He went, no. Nah. I said, you sure? No, no, they don't come in the box. These diamonds are in the box. Oh, of course you did. Wow. Look at these now. Are they bo <gasps> box faceted diamonds in blue? Love. I love these. They're from two millimetre to four millimetre, graduated in size. I'm sorry, I think there's a hair in there. Oh, no, it's, it's a strand from the cushion. There you go. 1.8 carats of blue diamonds. Beautiful. How much? How much is this going to? Why, is, why do we not have start prices anymore? We just have question marks. Oh, guessing game. Guessing game. <gasps> okay. Wonderful to see you on Jewelry Maker. What a joy. Leslie, so are you, my love. Thank you. Oh, split pay. Split pay. Split pay. Four-way split pay. $69.99 for... Look at it. Four-way split pay. Look at them, aren't they gorgeous? Look at the colour, they're like a tea. I uh, know. And also, normally, when your gemstones go smaller, you lose colour, don't you? Yeah, These are packed with colour. Whoa, I love those. At $69.99. Oh, lots of you there. Lots of you there. Remember, if you use the split pay, you don't have to put, wait till you paid the $69.99. You, you get them sent out to you as soon as you paid your first payment. I know. Gorgeous. I think a they? diamond bracelet would be. Oh, yeah. I'd want a little, I think I'd like a little, can you make a stretchy ring? Would you dare put diamonds on a stretchy? No, you could probably have a diamond bracelet, darling, and a ring. Oh, gorgeous. Oh, yes, please. Lovely. Wouldn't aren't that be they? lovely? Oh, oh, I'm ever so sorry. There's only one left. And someone's brand to buy two. Disaster. Morning, John. Love to see this morning. Love, Jill. Hello, Jill in Midlothian. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right, okay, I've got several people trying to buy two. I've only got one left. Normally puts the thingy, oh, there you go. There's only one left, so you can't buy two. I've got white ones coming up in a minute, but have I also not got blue diamonds coming up later as well? I think I've got blue diamonds coming up later as well. Look, not yet, look. Drops. Buy them both. Well, you can't buy them both now because they've gone. But if you bought those, why not? White, white diamonds are sold out. White diamonds sold out. Sorry about that. Remember, I've got uh, papaya pearls coming up later. I've got peridot in six and a half or six minutes. And I've got blue diamonds coming up later. Oh, well. Oh, ta tan that's not tanzanite. No, one after it is, tens and eight. Oi, oi, oi. What's that, what, did, what was that thing you just said? What a lovely, giggly, fun morning we're going to have <laughs> from Margot in five. I hope so, if my voice laughs out, Margot. Lots of Scottish buyers. Lots of Scottish. See, Scottish people get up earlier than English people, obviously. <laughs> 70 carats of tens night. Plain rondelles. Margot, I should say, I called her Margaret, she's called Margot to her friends. Oh, look at those, Margot. You like Margot from um, The Good Life? Oh, I used to, <laughs> I life. loved her, I loved her so much. At 16.44. 16.44. Another strange price, isn't it? Tanzanite for Tanzania. Oh, Ben Tommy waffles on, doesn't he? <laughs> doesn't he? <it? laughs> oh, Kinga! Come on, Ninja, let's have a look at the Perido again. We're going to do this after. He kept saying we're going to do the waff next. And I'm like, what's that? What's that? What gemstones are waff? What gemstones? Wall of Fame coming up next. Thank you. In your own time, girl, come on. Thank you. Right, while we're doing this, while we're doing this, right? All right, hang on. Oh, there's quite a few. I've got what? Oh, I've got an intro.
this is what... Um, oh, Hazel says, lovely to hear your sexy voice this morning, John. Thank you. Thank you, Hazel. It's not that I'm not sexy. Look at me. I'm old. And I look around and there's all these young, bright... Well, not bent on, but all the others, young and bright, sparkly people around me. So, you've got a boiler. You've, oh, his boiler's broken down. I wonder what was that. So how's... Anyway, have you not got a gym to go to on your way in? Jim, he says, what's that? Woff. Right, while, while it's doing it, right, um, we'll leave that in because there's loads you want to see those um, chains again. Right, do we start then? Thank you for this. 397, Elizabeth McPeak. A simple spring make. Amethyst, rose quartz, jadeite and aquamarine, all 10 millimetre beads with peridot spacers. All from jewellery maker. Love to all, Liz. Liz, I love those. Oh, let's take the picture. I was looking at them. They were lovely. Right, Una. Oh, Una. <laughs> What's that? It's fabulous. Good morning, studio crew and fellow waffers. Oh, you see, everybody knows it's a waff, do they? My entry for this week's wall is a wire rose for St. George's. Is that today? It is. Is it? It's the 23rd today, isn't it? Yeah. 23rd St. George, happy St. George's Day. Also, happy birthday to Charlie, who works next door. He's on holiday in Athens, and he said he was going to tune in. Uh, set into, go back, go back. Set into a poly, look, watch out, the message will come through. Set into a polymer, now I don't know what this means. Polymer clay base with rose quartz chips. I hope you like it, love, Una. Una, I love it. I didn't know, uh, how do you make one of those? A wire rose. French beading. Pardon? French beading. Gorgeous. Every day is called. Oh, move on. Every day is called. Sean Kerr. Oh, <gasps> look. Oh, my Lord. Now, is that Sean Boy or Sean Girl? Oh. Do we reckon? I made this pendant from a kit I just bought from Jewelry Maker. I nearly said Jeremy Kyle then. I don't know why I said that. Jewelry Maker with the most fantastic selections of cabochon. Oh, my word. Wonderful kit. Also included gold plated wire. So I used the. Si Selenite, 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 selenite cabochon and a peridot, very big on peridots, don't we, from my JM stash, to make this pendant inspired by Nadia Shields. Thank you so much for your outstanding products and inspiration. Love, Sean. Do you know, you're so clever, all of you out there, aren't you? 400. Oh, now Stephanie's written loads. Oh, Stephanie, hang on, let's have a look at that then. I'm only going to say Stephanie. Hi, all at Joy Maker. I bought these Charlie Barron parcel of 12. Oh, he's nice, isn't he, Charlie Barron? 12 Baroque South Sea pearls and a mix of colours, gold, lemon, uh, silver and white. They are stunning and I want to keep them all together so that I can see them, enjoy them whilst wearing them. I've rosary linked them, I know what that means, on sterling silver wire and toggle clasp, all from Jewelry Maker. The safety chain, listen to this now, the safety chain I've made from an old broken silver necklace, which I just cleaned up in silver cleaner. That's upcycling, isn't it? Never discard broken chains, they'll always be useful. I photographed it on a conch, pronounced conch, Shell. The colours match beautifully. It's one of the many shells I collect off the beaches of Antigua and St Lucia, where once the, uh, once the meat and pearls were removed and the shell was just discarded. Good luck to all from Stephanie. <gasps> Stephanie, that's beautiful. 401, Josephine. Oh, I like this. Fellow jewellery makers, here is a necklace nearing set I made with smoky agate. Beautiful gems that need no more than a simple gold-based metal finding. Simple, elegant, all from JM. Always humble being part of the talented JM makers. Josephine, you deserve to be there, my love. Uh, 402. Sue Rogers. Held, uh, hi, all at JM. This is my latest entry for the WAF. I love Tiger's Eye. A Tiger's Eye necklace with central, fl central flower pendant. All items from Joy Maker. Good luck to all in the draw. Oh, what? Is there a competition then? For and when do we do the tombola? Oh, Wednesdays. Won't be me then. 403. Last one of today. Oh, I love those pink gemstones. What are they? Pink tiger's eye. I didn't even know there was such a thing. Maggie Allen. Here, hi, all at JM. Here's my entry for the WAF. It's a pink tiger's eye stretchy bracelets with... 11 slash zero gold beads. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, love this colour. It's so vibrant. I'm filling up my bracelet bar with stretches for an upcoming craft events. Sorry about the state of my cork mat. <laughs> I've drawn on necklace lengths. Oh, clever. No, that's what it's for. Good luck to all this week from Maggie. Oh, you're all winners in my eyes. You're all winners in my eyes. Right. Do what? 
Oh, only one person will win. Others oh, runner-up as well. I, I obviously don't. I obviously don't watch on a Wednesday. I don't watch on a Wednesday. Do we have a sting? Is it just me or are they really loud? <laughs> they are loud, aren't they? They nearly fell over. They're singing to us. I like that in the morning. Uh, they have loads of stings here, don't they? We have, we have one early bird that Elliot made us, which is like these things. Anyway. <laughs> is this. that your bird impression? <laughs> that was it. If that's what you watch at 8 o'clock tomorrow morning. Anyway, this is already a good price. That's nowhere near your price. Nowhere near your price. Look, John Scott, John Scott's early burden. 19 carats peridot, mix, shape and size. Right, it's a what? Oh, this is going to be a closeout deal, apparently. Look at them all. Look at them all. Right, now, I know when we look at those little films, you always go, yeah, but they've got lights, they've got a background and everything like that. They look like that. They look like that. Look. Oh. Right, how much do you think all of these? You get all of them. Text in. Text in, how many do you get? Oh, look at them. <gasps> oh, this is like, this is like when, when uh, Dave Troth comes back from um, when he's been out shopping at the gen fairs and he goes, I've got this little parcel. Beautiful, aren't they? Oh, what's the other man called? Jake. Jake, he goes shopping for them as well, doesn't he? Or Toby. Well, that, that's what they're gone for, isn't they? Like mining, to go to the mine shops. Right, how much do you think they're going to be? How many do you think you're going to get? Loads of people on the phone line already. Beautiful, aren't they? You are going to be shocked. I'm going to tell you now, you are going to be shocked. Remember, it's August birthday. Now, 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 before I say anything else, what is it you're doing in the 12 o'clock hour? What's it called, that round thing? It, yeah, I'm bezel setting. Bezel setting, four millimetre settings. Look how many four millimetre round sets you get in there. So you could definitely use these oh. to go into any of the earrings because we've got studs and drops. Oh. And you could also use them to go into the pendant. Look, oh, there you go. So, yes. Imagine a pair of earrings like that. I just think these are stunning. Do we work out how many there were? One, two. I could be a while. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. 21, 22, 23. Keep coming through. 24, 25, 26, 28, 29, 30. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 38, 9, 41, 2, 3. There's 45 in mine, but I suppose it goes by the carrot weight, doesn't it? Look at, the, look at these here. Right, hang on. I'm going to try and be Carol now. Or do you watch our sister channel in the evenings? Um, what's that one that's on in the evening? And um, um, Amelia goes like this. She puts her hand into the shot like that, Mike, doesn't she? She goes like that. And then she gets a gemstone and she goes like that. Oh, darling. She says, darling, look, darling, on my finger. And there's a boy that does it with her, a tall, skinny boy. I think he's called Alex. Mm. Do you know what I'm talking Gem collector. Is it called gem collector? Oh, gem collector, yeah, yeah. In the evenings. It's not lifestyle. It's not lifestyle. It's Amelia. And she goes like that in front of the camera. She puts her, just a, her hand in front of the camera, picks up a gemstone. She goes, darling. Oh, darling. Foxy, she's... Look at those, aren't they gorgeous? Right. <laughs> Chang'e Perido. 45 stones. Pound a stone at the moment, that's not your price. Pound a stone at the moment, not your price. Look at them, they're just stunning, aren't they? <gasps> oh, I feel like one of those, you know when they show you the picture of the, uh, the outside the mine and the mine owner's going, oh, look at these. And they, they, they kind of, look at them. That's like, that's like unbelievable, isn't it? Look at the clarity, look at the sparkle, and every single one of them fa faceted. Just look at the, oh, they're just beautiful, look. Look, look, look. Right, I need more of you on the phone lines. Let's do a minute clock. I've already been on it five minutes, come on. I love them. Green is beautiful, like spring, like new beginnings. August birthstone. They look like what, Kinga? Oh, she's... That's proper treasure. Isn't it, Just? Mm. Loads of you there. We are not stopping anywhere near that price, just so you know. Make sure you're there, because I don't want anyone to miss out. Don't want anyone to miss out. Ring your friends now. Wake them up. 
Tell them about this early bird. I oh, know. Oh, look, I could just play with these for ages. Right, 20 seconds. Look, 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 look. Right. We're already under 50 pounds. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. 19 pounds and 99 pence. Now's the time to check out, check out, check out. At 19 99 I'm not allowed to shout. Look, oh my word, look at the phone. Right, Sharon, Iris, Joyce, Lee, Judith, Samantha, Maker, Maker, Paula. There's loads of there. People multi-buying. Somebody's bought four of them. I don't blame you. I do not blame you at all. Key going through. Heather's there. Lee's there. Denise is there. Doreen's there. Maureen's there. Joyce is there. Loads of there at 19 99 Hello, Paula. Hello, another Iris. Hello, Olga. Beatrice. Oh, well, now, how do I say that name there on the app? Faluk. Faluk. Faluke. Denise, Maureen, Dorothy. Hello, Dot. How are you, my love? These, I could just do this. For, I can understand now why when people go gem hunting, just the joy of being able to do that. You don't normally get this many gemstones all together, all of the same clarity. Right, come on, more of you on the phone line, please. I need more of you there. Oh. Oh, you could have told me. He said to me in prep, he said to me in prep, they're going to 20 pounds, John, right? The 19.99, he's already put a clock in now. Alison's there now. Uh, Anna Maria. Right, we, it's a closeout deal. We want them all to go. And remember, if you, if you checked out at 49.99, you don't pay 49.99, you pay the final low price. Keep going through, make sure you confirm. Make, sh make sure you confirm. You're doing what, Benton? Right, we're gonna go to a price, he says, where they're all gonna sell today. Tracy's there now. Merthyr Tidfield's there. Tracy's there, close that deal. We can't have any left. Well, I know somebody who wants them. 20 seconds left. Yeah, can't you think of something for me to do with them? Yeah, I'll bring one <laughs> over and you can put it in there. Yeah, I'll put it in amount. Yeah. Uh, 1999. <laughs> 1999. Keep going through. Right. Uh, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Pound off. 14.99. Not a pound off. Five pounds off. Five pounds off. So 40, everyone who's checked out, you now pay 14.99. That's amazing. It's that a closeout deal. That is brilliant, isn't it? They're just beautiful. Look at the size of those. They make a lovely pair of earrings, wouldn't they, those two? Gorgeous. Oh, hang on. There's a ring there as well. Oh, what? Ben, Tom, what are you doing now? It's a closeout deal. It's John Scott's early burden, 19. <laughs> Bought it. Look at everyone, look at everyone that's bought it so far. Please be careful. Claire, hello Claire. Claire's shouting her name, look. Debbie's there, Trees is there. Oh, two Trees at the same time. Tyne and Weir and Devon at the same time, look. Noreen, 14 99 for all these peridots. I'm getting a little bit overexcited. How many have gone? Over 100 have gone already. Over 100 have gone already. And we're, there's 20 seconds, we're going again. Everybody pays the final price. Hello, Jan. Hello, Lindy. Hello, another Iris. Hello, Denise. Keep going through. Everybody pays the same. And it's going to be lower than 14 99 That is ridiculous. For all those peridots, beautiful. Remember, they're all being fasted by hand. Here we go. Three, two, I've no idea. <sighs> What's that beeping noise? Oh, is that the end of the clock? 12 99 12.99, I know, beautiful. Right, that's it, now you need to check out. There's Marco, there's Marco. Well done, Marco, Judith's there. Uh, I've, got, I've got three, you know, you know, I'm not gonna show you, but you know on the screen, you have the lines with the phone calls, right? I've got three whole lines. I've got like, oh, hey, Michael, are you all right doing that? You be careful now. Well, you know, he's got to look after himself because he has another job as well, Mike. He's in a pop band, a boy band. I think, oh, boys. Oh, and he crashes cameras into things. Look, <laughs> look, 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 look. There are, there are people who've got it in the baskets. You haven't checked out yet. What do you need to do to check out? Press one. Don't you press one to check out? 
What's he saying to me? Press one. Look, 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 look. Yeah, Doreen's got four, Liz has got Judith, Wendy, Jan, Tracy, Cheryl. He's gone off the bottom of the screen now. Let's go to the other column now, look. Thank you, Michael. No, no I'm not allowed to shout, Ben Tom. <laughs> how, how, how? Do you know what? I think people who've bought one, can they come in and buy another one now? Right. No, 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 no. People have bought four, but if, you, if people have bought one at like 19 99 you can buy more. Come back in and buy more. Susan's there, Lynn's there, Janet's there, Wendy's there, Alison. You want what? He's shutting rubbish, he really is. I think they're beautiful, aren't they? Natural. Did I not say that? They're natural. Chang, Chang. Chang Bai Peridot's August birthstone. If Mary France, my friend Mary France, watch now, she loves Peridot. Right, I don't know where you're gonna go. There's, oh look, there's Sean. Do you reckon that was Sean? Do, do you think that was Sean? Do you think that was Sean who made that one a minute ago? Close out deal, close out deal. Right, this is it, you will not go again. We will not go again. Ben Tom says, buy him, you'll be his friend forever. He'll get into so much trouble for doing this anyway. Ten pounds. Ten pounds. Well, that, I don't know how, Ben Tom, you're in charge. That, that one there, is 19.99 on, on its own, is it really? Just go and look at any of our competitors at how much loose... Where there are, nobody can compete with us. How... What, you know, loose stones yeah. are each. Yeah. And you've got all of those for yeah. 9 99 Imagine if you bought that and then went to a craft fair and just had them out on a cushion and said, oh. each one's a five or each one's, you know. There's 45 gemstones here. We don't know how many you're going to get, but you will get mixed sizes. They will be this quality. 22 pence a stone, that is. Tw that one, that bundle there, if you get this bundle here, well, you won't because it's the one that Debbie's having. But... <laughs> Nine ninety nine. Well, if I drop one on the floor, we can't sell it. Oh. Hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. <laughs> right. <laughs> this one's incomplete now. I love anyway, you, John. Nine ninety nine. <laughs> Jennifer, Trisha, Patsy. I'll pay you the twenty two p. Don't you worry. <laughs> nine ninety nine. Keep going through. Beatrice is there. Oh. Michelle's there. Kathy's there. <laughs> quick as you can. Quick as you can. These are stunning. <laughs> oh, imagine. Nine ninety nine. Look at you all. Look at you all there. Oh, do you know what? They're so... It did, I didn't really drop one. <laughs> I didn't really drop a gemstone. You did not hear it bounce. <laughs> ben Tom saying he could have bought a coffee in the, in the green room for that almost. Maya's there, Beatrice there. Try out all... Yeah, Ollie saying at 22 p stone you could try it all. Oh. I think that's a really good point. But also, just... try buying plastic beads. Try buying plastic beads. Morning, John. Love to see you on JM today. You're as funny as ever and looking well. Dorothy, you're very kind. Thank you. I don't feel bad. It's just the voice is broken. Maybe... Right, come on, come on, come on. Right, how many people have I got not checked out yet then? 80 people still need to check out. It's not going any lower. That's your price. But having said that, how many have I got left? Yeah? Right. 80 people. Right, 80 people have yet to check out. If you don't check out now, I can't guarantee you're going to get it. I cannot guarantee you're going to get this. Beautiful. Look at that. We had hundreds of these. Hundreds and hundreds. It was a John Scott early bird. Okay. Rightio. Very quickly, while you're checking out on that. When did I take my ring off? When, right, keep going through. I'll come back and check on you in a minute. I will come back because I don't want anyone to miss out. I don't want anyone to miss out, right? The, the two gold chains that I had. King R. King R. You get two chains here. Can I have another one of those? Have you got another board? So I can put it here, thanks. Uh, don't want to move the disturb the peridots. Look. Look at these. 9 99 You get two chains. It's 925 sterling silver. Right? Gold plated. Thank you ever so much. Gold plated. I know. 9 99 9 99 Now, buy those. Make yourself a couple of pendants. 
gorgeous. Pamela's there, Patricia's there, Julia's there. <clears throat> $9.99. Flying in for this, Keturah, Patricia. Oh, honestly, Ben Tom, you're making me work hard this morning. Right, is it a... Sorry I'm rushing you all, but it's Saturday morning, we've got lots to do. I'm trying to get through everything, what time is it? Yeah, handsome Dave Trotter's in soon. Um, start by. Papaya pearls. Have you ever, ever heard the like? Have you ever heard the like? Hello, Ted. I could just see Ted coming in for the chains there as well. Right. These are papaya freshwater cultured Baroque, Baroque pearls. Seven by 10, but to eight by 12, 38 centimeters. Now the color is natural, isn't it? Color is natural. Not been, they've not been dipped in anything. The color is natural. How beautiful are they? What's the matter? Okay, right, I'm gonna give you, I'm not, I'm not gonna do this yet. They had some papaya pearls on yesterday. 399, did you say? Th 399 pounds. Right, so I'm just telling you that. Uh, we've got exactly the same color here. Fresh water cultured pearl from China. Peach, lovely shapes. Let me just move my ring out of the way so you can see. Lovely shapes, aren't they? Beautiful shapes. Got. Nothing too well. Actually, look. No, but look against skin tone. Yours, you obviously won't have a hairy chest, unless you're Debs. <laughs> eh? Oh, she's waxed today. She? <laughs> How beautiful is that colour? The thing is, sometimes if you put too, too bright white against your flesh, does that, mm. whereas those are just going to yeah. look so expensive and exquisite. So the ones yesterday were £399, <gasps> right? People on the phone line already. Oh, OK, we're not doing loads. We're, in 60 seconds, we're going to do one crash. Right, it's not £399, though, is it? Not. I can... Oh, right. He's just telling me I don't believe him, right? It's not £399. Am I allowed to say? No, I'll wait. I'll wait. I'll wait. It is a surprise. I'm going to wait. Papaya freshwater cultured Baroque pearls. Now, Debbie, what would you do with these? Oh, she's already made one. She's got one hanging there. Are you wearing it at home? Are you wearing it? Wearing it? I wear this almost every day. So depending on the size of pearl, you can have a larger one and then a little one. I've got, obviously got one on a very long chain. Yeah. But if it's smaller, I have a single one sort of sitting on my decolletage and then I just layer them if I'm what, feeling a bit bougie. Bougie? I love my pearls. Three, two, one, here you go. <gasps> can you see how much it is? No, I just think they're beautiful. <laughs> 89 99 and it's on split pay. That's it's true. on split pay as well. Now, one yesterday with £399. We've done, that's it. That's your price. That's your price. That's your price. Well done, everyone. Keep going through locks. You've got it in your basket. You need to check out. You do need to check out. I know. Brilliant, aren't they? What's the matter? <laughs> Uh, uh, put it up, you can put it up, it's fine, it's not rude. <laughs> yeah. Who wants to know what times to, there you go. Do we get a hint what Chippendale Dave is selling us today? <laughs> from, oh, it's Philippus, it's Philippus. Is he going to be dancing then when he comes on? No, he'll be dancing with the gorgeousness. Look at these, this is what he's bringing you today. Ah, Ooh. it's white jade, That's but lovely. look at the colour. It's duck blue, dove blue. Doves are grey. <laughs> that beautiful soft blue. <laughs> Back to the pearls. Right, ten left. There are ten left. Right, well, I've got one, two, three, four, five, six people within their basket. Here you go. Check out, check out, check out. Who's going to get them? 
Who's going to get these? There's only eight left at 89, 99. Remember, oh, Arthur, I'll bring you back those in a minute. What time is it? Where's the clock gone? Oh, there it is. Nice, says Philippus. 89.99. Seven left. Welcome back, John. You always make me smile. And Deb is awesome too. I love Jewelry Maker from Mandy in Somerset. Thank you, Mandy. She's waving. All right, five left. Five left. And it's on split pay. We will send them out once you've paid. The four left, four left, four left. Right, hang on. One, two, three, four, five. The six people got it in their baskets. S right, too many people want this now. I'm just waiting. I'm just waiting. Just waiting. Oh, more people coming on the phone lines. Another one goes. Another one bites the dust. Oh. You pay 29 99 today. They'll be sent out to you. I know. And then you pay two more and that's it done. Right. There goes another one. I've got two left now. Two left. But one, two, three, four, five people got it in their basket. Oh, I'd hate leaving it hanging like that. Oh. Blue diamonds next. Blue diamonds. Look at these. Now, these aren't square. These are drops. Look. Oh, oh, what's that one doing? Lo oh, oh, last of stock. Last of stock. 1.8 carats of blue diamonds, fasted drops, 2.2 2 and 4 by 3, and on a 4 centimetre strand with. What does the with mean? With. Will it change in a minute? Okay. Spacers, they are. Aren't they beautiful? Look at the depth of colour. Look at the faceting. You know you don't put a gemstone in a machine. It comes out fast at the end. It all has to be done by hand. Load. Yeah. Yeah. Can I a facet a diamond with another diamond? £199. Hundred. Now, these were, these were, they had these the other day. They were very popular. This is the last of stock. Last of stock now. What's the matter? Yeah. Oh, Ben Tom loves this, doesn't he? 199.99. I watched Wayne the other day. He was on air, wasn't he? All he kept just shouting, shouting with Vix. <laughs> right, oh! Six left. Six left. And that's it. We didn't tell you what time Dave was on. Dave's on at um, 11, 10, 8, no, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10. In five minutes, we're going to take kits with Debbie. No. <laughs> kits with <laughs> Debbie. Then Dave will be here at 10. Then what have we got? 11, we have an hour off at 11, I think. Masterclass at 12. I'll have an hour off. That's nice. Oh, God, God. oh, yeah, I've got lovely things, that display boxes. Anyway, here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. There's only five left. There's only five left. <laughs> diamonds, they're blue diamonds. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, did you see Shirley Bassey at the BAFTA Awards? Wasn't she amazing? Diamonds are forever. What does it mean when their names come up in a different colour on my screen? Oh, OK. Because Elizabeth's in purple, but Liz is in white. Christina's in white, but Maker's in purple. Anyway, 99, 99, keep going through. There's only three left. Only three left. What? On what? Oh, pfft. You know, Ben Tom, I see the costumes for the James Bond films. You know that, don't you? Yeah. I did Golden Eye, The World Is Not Enough and Tomorrow Never Dies. Golden Eye, The World Is Not Enough and Tomorrow Never Dies. Did you? Wow. My name's at the front of the film. Get a front credit. $24.99. Of, right, I hate it when people do that. $24.99. That's your split pay. Four split pays of well, £25, isn't it? And there are £100 for the whole thing. But look, that makes each diamond £20. That's not right. One left. Right, there's one left, but there's four people got it in their baskets. 
Go to Ann. So, I, I, oh, this is nice. What's this? I love the way she's just delivered it. Oh, it's, hang on. Yeah, Naughty McNaughty, that one. Have you got a picture? Show a picture. Oh, lovely. Kinga. Kinga. <laughs> Thank you. Could you unknot it? So it looks like the one on the picture. <laughs> <laughs> so let me tell you what it is. Let me tell you what it is. It's a rose gold, <laughs> 925 sterling silver, rose gold plated entwined rings on a necklace with a two inch extender. Oh, she's back, she's back, she's back. Oh, look, I've put her on the spot now. No pressure, waiting for you now, Kinga. No pressure. For, oh, 14 99 That's brilliant. And they all move around. I could show you if I got an untangled one. <laughs> it's What's very the chain? Designer. What's the chain? Let me see the chain. Box chain. Is it a box chain? She's almost there, she says. Uh, you have to be quick, Kinga, they might sell out. It's 95 sterling silver. Rose gold plating. 2.65 grams. Oh, I'm tired. My lemon and my ginger is just at the right temperature now. Mm. Don't look at me. Don't look at me. Anyway, Merthyr Tidville's in. South Yorkshire's in. <laughs> right, moving on. <laughs> Sorry that you didn't get to see that. Who's the other floor manager here? <laughs> Dan, where's he then? Oh, he's off today. Day off today. 9 99 Now, these, I've shown you these quite a bit this morning, but I really need to get... Oh, hold these. They're not 9 99 each. You get both. For 9 99 They're 18 inch. They're 95 sterling silver. One is gold plated with gold. And the other one is gold, but it's rose gold. Got. Keep going through. Oh, well, he's moved on. He's, he's moving on, isn't he? Paint on. Right. How many of these have I got left? What's the matter? Look at the price of this, right? Oh, she's done it now. She's done the chain now. Look at those, right? 9 99 There's 45 of them in my bundle here. They're all faceted. Look at the size of them. They'd make you a nice pair of earrings. That'd make you a lovely ring. Too late now. Too late now, King, of putting that chain on a stand. 9 99 Oh, there's another big one there. Oh, look, I thought there were three big ones. There's four big ones. Right, this is John Scott's early bird. Where are you all? It's 9 99 19 carats of peridot. Oh, how many of those have got left, Ben, Tom? Yeah. Oh, but how many in baskets? Right, we started with hundreds of these. Loads have gone. Ella, have you just woken up? Hang on, don't go. Don't go anywhere yet. Don't go anywhere. Not, oh, hang on, it's a break, it's a break. But look. They're just coming in. Can we leave that up during the break? We'll leave that up during the break and we'll see you. I'll be over there with Debs. And what are we making in this next hour? We're doing a um, leather wrap bracelet. Leather wrap bracelet. And we've got he hematite this bracelet. Oh, it's beautiful. Yeah. Beautiful hematite. And they've got rings that don't fit me. I'll see you <laughs> in four minutes from now. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call centre with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. 
This coming Monday looks absolutely incredible. Why? Because it's Nugget Day. Join Monica for her nine o'clock kits where it's buy three, get one free. And your deal of the day, oh my word, a strand of Moldavite nuggets. And another huge thing that's happening that day, we are going to be giving away a thousand inches. That's right, a thousand inches of nuggets. You need to head to our Facebook page from eight o'clock on Monday to find out how to enter. But take a look at these. We've got turquoise, we've got carnelian. Oh, so many inches. Look at all of these. There's some Larimar in here. Literally inches for miles. It's gonna be absolutely superb. Nuggets, nuggets, nuggets. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street, and Yarn Lane. Don't they have some fantastic adverts in here? Like, I'm going to have to have a word so we can get them next door. And how dramatic was the music for Dave Troth, handsome Dave Troth coming up at 10 o'clock? Looking forward to that, aren't we? I, I've only met him in passing in the corridor, just gone, hello, hello, like that at all. Never met him before. So I'm really looking forward to that. Right. Hello, gorgeous. Hello. What are you going to do for us today? I'm going to do some kits in a minute, but I'll just ask me. I'm going to be doing, because we've got these amazing hematite kits, which frankly you can do loads with. Right. But I thought I'd just show you how to do a wrap bracelet with the leather and the hematite sort of wound in Ooh, between. Ooh, lovely. Right, so what do you want me to do first? I've got so much gorgeousness to show you. What would you like to do first, Ben Tom? Yeah, which one? Okay, I'll do the one with the blue... Um, is that leather thonging? In the, what's that there? Yeah, leather cord. Leather That's cord. the one I'm demoing. Oh, okay. Right, so in this kit, I shall hold it up for Mike. Can you see, Mike? Oh! Everything slid off. Look, there you go. There you go. They're gorgeous. So these are all hematite, right? Mm -hmm. What are these called here? These like, 
Ones that like tessellate together like arrowheads, they're gorgeous. Aren't they beautiful? I oh, there they all are, there I they all are. I couldn't get over how many strands you got in one kit. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven strands. You've got like the arrowheads in a dull gold. Mm -hmm. You've got the arrow, oh wait. One, two, three, four, five. Hang on, so we've got arrow, gold, dull. Mm -hmm. No, not dull, that's the wrong word. Um, matte. 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 Right? Then I've got arrow, gold, sparkly. Oh, look at that. Then I've got arrow, gorgeous, like a peacock blue. Mm -hmm. Then I've got this one here, which is like a, oh, look at that one. And then I've got the silver colored one. So they're all your arrowheads, right? You get five of those. Then you get silver beads and you get gold beads. Ben Tom's saying there should be eight, but there's not. There's, then there's the, your leather thonging. Is that your eighth, Ben Tom, then? Is that what you're saying? Eh? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, there's seven in the next one as well. There's definitely eight. Do we have a breakdown? Let's have a look at the picture. Hang on. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. There's only seven in there's the picture seven in as well. The picture. No, there's six. Oh, yeah. There should be six hematite arrow strands. Anyway, you will get six arrowheads, two round rondelles, plus your turquoise blue. I call that thonging, but you call it... Uh, just cord. Cord. Leather cord. Yeah, but you could call it that. Anyway, you will get one more. You will get, we're just looking at it now. Oh, look, that's nice. Hang on. What? Oh. So what do I say? This is one, two, three, four, five. There's only seven there in that picture, but the graphics say... Okay, we're gonna say we're gonna go safe. If you get an extra one, did you get another colour or did you just get the same? I've got have you got this one? Isn't that that one? Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna say you get seven, and if there is an eighth one, it's an added bonus, isn't it? Tom Tom will do Ben Tom will do the price. A good good do a good price. Loads you there already, look. This is called hematite winner. Forty nine ninety nine. Forty-nine pounds. Oh, look at that! They're like little tulips, those. They're really cute. Yeah, just cute, depending which way. Obviously, they sit like you could just restrand them and have like a Cleopatra style yes, kind of yeah, necklace. That yeah. would be beautiful. Or sort of like the wrap bracelet. Or I just use them sparingly as charms. On that on that stand, they look like the ladies from the end of Belly Village. You know, the ladies who put the rings around their necks. Oh in yes, Africa. yes. That's what that. It's got a very African yeah, feel. Yes, beautiful. That, hasn't it? Beautiful. Forty-nine ninety-nine. Well, we're just sending an email to find out. Helen, Susan, Diane, Maker, Maker, Linda. Look at them, you could do so much with it, can't you? $49.99. You've got to do what? Ben Tom is not a happy boy now. Oh, that, what do you mean? That's not your price. Okay, come on in, come on in. What Ben Thompson? Oh, look, it's sexy. <laughs> sexy 68. Well, it's definitely not me, it must be you. <laughs> oh, I knew Dave Troth's on the way. It's Dave. Dave Troth, yeah. Anyway, 49.99 in 49 seconds, we'll be dropping down. Uh, how beautiful are these? Are they easy to work with? Yeah. Because you've got a really decent sized drill hole in there as well. And then you've got lots of different shapes to work with. So you can turn the arrows all the same way like that. So they sit in that kind of Cleopatra-esque way. Yeah. Or you can turn them the other way. Or you could have them facing each other and then maybe put seed beads in the gaps. So there's loads of design possibilities when you've got strands like this. Yeah, back to back, point to point. They, they, when you put them all the same way, they've got that lovely like snake-like snake -like, like, yeah. feel to it. Very even more Cleopatra, don't they? How gorgeous are they? Imagine if you made a choker out of those for evening, you got one of those gorgeous bugle beaded dresses, and then you just made yourself a choker out of all the air. Oh no, I do a row going one way, then a row going yeah. the other way, then a row going that way, because you've got one, two, three, four, five rows, haven't you? Right, how much is it going to? Forty-nine 
Right, okay, it's $29.99. We sell these on their own at five ninety nine. So that's one, two, three, four. That that would seven six is a forty two that's forty two pounds. So that if you bought those these individually, they now work out at four pounds twenty eight instead of five ninety five. And then how much are these? The beads? Do we do the beads on their own? They're the same? Honestly, what a oh loads of you there. Look, I've got another, I've got another uh, colour range in a minute. I have got another colour range too, which I'm sure you've seen on the website. They're just gorgeous, aren't they? Well done, Pauline, Susan, Diane, Linda, Patricia, Jeanette, Kathy, Kathleen, Ruth, Helen, Susan, makers up and down the country. Well, did you not put a gemstone on that one? No, because, you know, you can just... Uh Use the leather. That's very... Um, um, boho. Yes, boho. Very was, festival. I, 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 festival. I, I was also going to say, and I, I get confused with what we can and can't say politically correctness, right. but Native American. Yes. And the blue yes. also adds very. that, doesn't it? Yeah. What's the matter, Ben, Tom? What? We're going again. He's got a real thing, hasn't he, this morning? Does he do this all the time? Yeah. Oh, OK. And then when you think he's done the price, then you see a clock up here again. Yeah, yeah. I like that, though. It's a surprise. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Hematite from China. Very Blue. popular gemstone, hematite. Is yeah, I'm very unisex as well, I think. Oh, yeah, totally. Totally, utterly. Beautiful. Eight, seven. <clears throat> right. Wow, that's really good. You get so much in this kit. Set what seven into twenty-five. Oh, don't ask me. Oh no, and that. How much would that be? How much that do you get, by the way? Uh, two. You get two meters. Two meters of that you get. Plus this, 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 all for twenty-four ninety-nine. And if you didn't want to work the leather cord in with the hematite, then use it for your macrame or your kumihimo, and then use these. Oh, you are size. kumihimo. Oh, kumihimo. I don't know what that is. Japanese braiding. Oh, lovely. Yeah. Twenty-four ninety-nine. Lots of you there. Lots of you there. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. How is everybody? Keep going through, you must, you must confirm, you must confirm they're not yours until you check out. Egyptian, two people said Egyptian. Josephine and Julie, it but well, we said as well, didn't we? We did, we very yeah. Cleopatra. Cleopatra, we said, then I said, then I said, end the belly village, didn't I? Right, okay, that's the first one. That's the first colour. Oh, oh, look at these, look at these, just when you get them, look at you, just go, oh, look at that. I just think like you could make a fringing out of that, couldn't you? Yeah, you could. It'd be gorgeous. What's a necklace called when you have the chain come around and you have lots of? You can buy. You can buy like um. Like a tassel. Yeah, but it's like a long bit, and then you attach your beads to it. So oh, it looks, I know what you mean. It's like yeah. a fringing. Yeah, it's lovely, lovely. that. So you anyway. have like a bit of metal at the top of yeah, wire. Yeah, yeah, and then they yeah, all hang beautiful. down. Yeah, beautiful. Right, this colourway is also totally gorgeous. Purple. So in this one, look at those. You get the purple one. I swear. There you go, you get the purple. Oh, it's more than purple though, isn't it? Look. Then you get the goldy one. Or oh, is it gold or is it bronze? Yeah, it's more of a bronze, bronze antique or, gold. Yeah. It? Then what colour would you call this? Oh, it's beautiful. It's just a green. Well, Fresh. different greens and then there's some turquoise in there as well, whichever way you look at it. Yeah. Really stunning. Then you've got like a rose gold. And then... You've got what I think of as hematite colour, like the blacky, shiny mm -hmm. colour. Then, there you, there you have arrowheads, and then you get your beads in the gold, the rose gold, and then look at those. That's beautiful. And in this one, you get um, bronze leather cord. Bronze leather cord in that one. Ready? Yep. Where are we going? Same price. Uh, oh, look at that. Is that the cord around the outside of the, the hematite? Yeah, they're, they're wrap bracelets. So and that one, has that got cord on it? Well? That's got cord wrapped around it. Um, and there's another necklace, the bigger necklace that I've used this kit for as well on this bust. 
So what I've done with this one is I've actually used the cord as a spacer. Oh, wow. So, you know, just trying to do something a little bit differently. But I think, you know, this, this was my favourite kit. Cause oh, the, this one. The more neutral, warm, earthy tones. Yeah. So I really loved this. I thought that this <coughs> could be, I don't know, that, that green and, and purple combination yeah, is so beautiful. Yeah, beautiful. Really beautiful. Um, I'd buy both and then mix all, mix oh, you'd have all of them. So have many strands. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Five strands. The, the graphic says six. We think it's five. We just think somebody's typed in wrongly. We are double checking though. But every, we priced it for five, not for six. Well, yeah, yeah. In reality, we priced it for like one or two, haven't we? But in our price, we priced five. Right, okay, I'm going to sit back now. Okie dokie. And I'm going to watch you make it something. What are you going to make me? I'm going to make the wrap bracelet, sort of okay. like the two there. So right, you need do you to... want to measure of me for the size? First? Oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> So depending on whether, with these wrap bracelets, um, you can decide whether you want them to go round twice, three times, or whether you just want your legs <coughs> to go a bit further and have them go round once. Um, so the one you're looking at there actually goes round twice, if I turn it round, and then the other one, the brown version that we looked at with the different bees, with just the little, what would these be called, like little saucers? Going to move that to shop, mate. Um, that. Oh, yeah. that's gorgeous. Don't they sit beautifully together? They sit, I'll put it back, I'll put it back, but they, they sit so flat. I'm so that one is this. made to go round once with like an um, interchangeable clasp at yeah. the end so that you can make it bigger or smaller. Mm -hmm. So I thought I'd show you quickly how we would go about doing that. So take your leather cord and is it two metres of this we've yeah. got? We've got two metres of this, so you've got loads to be going around. So bearing in mind you need two equal lengths. Um, so you need to decide when you start off whether you're going to go round once or whether you're going to go round twice or even three times. It's completely up to you. I've got one at home and it goes around my wrist three times and it's really, really pretty and I get comments. So you can actually on the end put a loop and a button if you've got a decorative button or an upcycle button that you've got at home you can clasp it with a button yeah. um, I use just a normal jewelry clasp okay so for this I'm just going to make a smaller one just for demonstration purposes so you're going to need two lengths of exactly the same now bear in mind you're going to do a couple of knots in this as well that are going to take up some of the cords so you're going to want to make it a bit larger than you need so I've taken one long length and I folded it in half and then I'm going to go to the end there let me move it across there we go and I'm going to add a knot now this little loop is either if you're going to be putting that over a button then make sure that that can go over the top of your button or if you're going to just be attaching a clasp to this uh, then it doesn't matter how large your loop is and I'm just going to do an overhand knot and pull it up just until my loop is the size that I want it to be. Now, I'm using a macrame board for this that we do here at Jewelry Maker, but you can use a clipboard or you can even pin it down to a cushion. So if you don't have a macrame board, that's not the end of the world. So in this case, I'm just going to use a T-pin and just pin it to my macrame board here and pop it down so that I've got it Hold on. You haven't got that one down at all? I haven't got it down. I need to move it, sorry. No, you move it. I'm too low on this chair, that's what it is. Do you want me to raise you up? I, the last time I did that, I went down. Oh, did you? Right. Yeah. Stand up. Okay, stand up. <laughs> Here we go. Ooh. There you go. <laughs> I feel like that's I'm at the bar one. now. <laughs> Glass of Prosecco, please. Yeah, two Proseccos, <laughs> both for her. Can you manage? <laughs> oh, crumbs, yeah. There you go. Oh, talk amongst better? yourselves. Oh, that's better. I can see what I'm doing now. Yeah. I'm still in shot, sorry. Right. Right, now. Okay, so what I'm going to do is take my T-pin. Let's just start again, shall we? Now I can see what I'm doing. And pop my T-pin in here so that it traps my cord like that. That's better. And then I need to have a gap so that I can work. So I'm going to trap it at the other end of my board into these little... Oh. <laughs> it's not happening today, is it? Here. I'll just do this for demonstration purposes. There we go. And I'm going to trap it into the other end. And then what I use to actually sew the beads in between the two cords 
is a needle and thread. Now I've got some thread that matches my cord here. You could use wildfire, you could use fireline. Um, I think this is some KO thread that I've pre-waxed. Now the first thing that we need to do is just attach this to one of our cords. Now all I'm going to do for this is pop on an overhand knot. So taking it on, doesn't matter which side, leave a little bit of a tail because we're gonna glue this before we actually trim the tail and you want it to be able to be sort of very secure when you're wearing your jewelry. So, so just doing like a granny knot? Just though. a granny knot, yeah. I'm gonna go over, let's just do three, say. One, <laughs> two, and now bearing in mind that right at the beginning because your cords are coming together to a point it might be nice to just do a couple of weaves and then as your cords open a little bit you're going to start to add your beads so how we do that is we go over the top of the first cord and under the second one right so you're like weaving weaving so it's like a figure of eight essentially yeah, yeah, yeah. and then i'm going to go over the top of the second cord and back under the first one now your cord does want to get stuck on everything so of just course. be mindful of that so that we've got this sort of little weaving and then when we get to the point um, that we're going to start adding our beads i think i added two so i'm going to add on one of each color so here i've got one of the gold together like little saucer beads uh -huh. um, and one of the silver ones as well so that's what i've added to my needle and then i'm going to drop them down in between the threads so the first couple are the most fiddly and then you get into a rhythm right so i'm going to drop those two down and do exactly the same again i'm going to come underneath my second thread right like so it's lifted up a little bit because once you get these first couple on it becomes really easy but you're just going to have to sort of coax them is the word I'd use into place and then instead of going back you go through the beads so I'm going to hold my cord there so you can see what I'm doing uh -huh. and I'm going to go through oh. the two beads again and they will start to sit as I go along so I'm pulling that making sure not to get caught on anything it's getting caught on the corner there so just let me there we go and give it a pull and you'll find that they will sit in between your cord there. Right. And then just to finish that off, I'm going to go underneath the first cord again with my needle. And for the first few, you just want to hold your finger on it to keep them where you want them to be. And then after that, they just kind of slip into yeah. place. So there we go. We've got the first two in there and I've gone under the first cord and then we just keep doing that so what I'm going to do is add two again so it's up to you if you want to do the same color you want to do one bead you want to do two beads completely up to you I just did two because I thought it looked pretty uh -huh. so I'm going to take two beads again come here little bead the graphics are at the moment of the bronze one Drop whereas it you're down. using the turquoise I'm one using the turquoise yeah. one and then I'm going to go under the second can you see that yeah yep, yep. under the second thread Give it a pull and they will sit in the middle there and then you just want to take that needle and go back through your beads and what I like to do at this point is hold my finger on the beads and then just give the needle a pull the other side. Mm -hmm. Nearly knocked my water on the floor then. Oh no. So can you see how it gets easier as you go yeah. Up, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. up the thread yeah. and then you go back underneath. So I'm essentially just doing a figure of eight here to get those beads to sit in between the cords. So I'm going to pick those up again. I'm going for a gold and then I'm going for a silver. Drop it down in between my cord. So it's quite repetitive at this point quite meditative so it's one of those that you can do on your lap you know if you're watching the telly you're not following a pattern you're not having to think too much I do like things where you don't have to think too much well I think I'd need it you're on a tray on your lap yeah you I've got one of those um I sound well I am a nan but I sound like a right nan I've got um 
one of those trays, you know, those breakfast trays. Oh, yeah, that they advertise you know the ones on with one the one legs. Yeah, 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 yeah. I love those. And I sit there on my lap because I do have to do some really complicated jewellery. And when I get to do something like this, I want to enjoy it. Yeah. So I sit with my, with my breakfast tray. I think it's supposed to be for breakfast yeah. on my lap with the macrame ball, just like this. And I'll sit and kind of have one eye on the telly or oh. whatever I'm doing. And then I just, um, I just keep going. So can you see that as I'm going along, it's starting to become far, far easier. So I'm going to go under here. I'll do a few more, then I'll show you how to finish okay. it off because it's really repetitive. And then you'll find that it's really satisfying because they start to just sit into place. So you need to fiddle about with the first couple of rows just because you're getting sort of that rhythm started. And then after that, it's really quite simple. Uh -huh. And just be careful that you don't get your thread caught on anything. Pull it through, give it a nice tug so that till it sits really satisfying when they just kind of go into, into place there and back under the first one. So I'll just do a couple more. Yeah, yeah, if you, if, if you do off. that, I'm just going to tell everyone that we're going to cover these rings on pre-order. Oh, look, Daddy Adam's in. He's had his hair cut. Well, he's had half his hair cut. He's had half um, of his hair cut. <laughs> right, uh, Ben, Tom. They're all on pre-order now. So they'll be later on in the hour, right? And then we've also got these coming up as well. So those are on pre-order. Are these on pre-order yet? And these are on pre-order too. Now, last time they had these on, you went crazy for them. They're gorgeous. I've never seen anything like that. Bundled and individual. <coughs> Right, so I didn't want to take away from your demo. That's all right. So imagine that I've done the whole length of my bracelet, as long as I want it to be. We'll just do a baby bracelet. And you're going to finish off the last one. So I'm going under in my figure of eight here. I'm going to go back through my beads. Mm -hmm. And you'll find that your thread takes on a nice, neat pattern as you go along. And you're wanting to finish off. So once you go through the other side... You're just going to finish off your thread as you go down. <coughs> so you just want to go under your first leather cord. And then I'm just going to do a knot because we're going to glue this anyway. Oh, okay. So I'm going to knot that there. So you don't do that till you've finished your whole, your whole no, bracelet? No, so you've finished your whole bracelet and then you're going to knot. Then you're going to take, so that's what we're making. You're going to take it off the pin or the board. And it's really simple to finish off. So take hold of your two cords and the cord that you've been sewing with and keep your finger where you want the knot to be so that you've got an indication there and just tie it into an overhand knot. Uh -huh. Now you don't want to cut any cords until you've glued this because that just gives you extra security in your piece. Now just let me cut that off the needle. There we go. So that you're knotting through here and taking that down to where you want it to be. So there we go. Now, a way of actually doing, if you have got a button closure, a way of doing sort of an adjustable bracelet is to just come up a little bit and do another knot. Can I have the finished bracelet, the brown one, please? Jeff? Yeah. So that if you have got a button closure, you can still have it adjustable if you don't know the person's bracelet size or you're making to sell. So let me move this out of the way and show you here. Right. So what I've done is I've made a couple of knots so that you could put your button in this one or you could put your button in this one and it becomes adjustable. Oh, I see. What I've done is, because I know not everyone will have buttons that they want to use, you can just use a lobster clasp and a jump ring to finish off. But if you were going to wrap this around a few times and use a button, if you've got a couple of different loops that your button can fit into, then you can make it bigger or yeah, smaller. Yeah, yeah. So and you attach the button the same way as you've attached the yeah, beads. You would just either sew the button on, or if you can get your cord through the button, bring your cords through the button and tie and trim. Just make sure that you add a little bit <coughs> of glue to the knot before you trim off the final What sort of glue do you use? I would usually use um, anything that dries um, clear and is uh, movable. So E6000, yeah, yeah. you know, um, hypo cement, anything, any jewellery glue like that. Um, and then you just keep going till your bracelet's as long as you want it to be. Um, and that's it, basically. It's just a figure of eight. And you just um, 
not it. So you don't need to know any really difficult techniques. And it no, makes I was going to say, because I, I was surprised at how you did that. I didn't, wasn't expect, I was thinking you were going to... Just the figure yeah. of eight. So just the figure of eight could be an anklet. You could yeah. have it around your ankle or, yeah, so nice and easy make. What happens to that leather thong if it gets wet? I don't think it would matter. It doesn't matter. Does because, it? you know, some people wear leather bracelets and they just leave them on. Leave them on, they? yeah, exactly, yeah. exactly. Yeah, yeah. So I think, like, the benefit of, of it being leather yeah. is that you could just put it on your ankle and go in the sea. That, or, that, isn't that funny? That's yeah. exactly what I was thinking. Being yeah. on holiday and you think, oh, I've got to take my ankle no. off to run into the sea. No. I think it, it will be fine. It yeah. tends to wear leather, doesn't it? It wears yeah, to and you. Yeah, it goes. Yeah, I, yeah, I love soft. it when it's... I like, do. like when you have a satchel. When you first get it, it's really pristine. Yeah. And then when they'll leather... And, or a leather jacket and things. And it sort of moulds to you. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. Yeah, and then obviously there's loads you can do with these hematites. Absolutely tons of designs. Loads in these kits. Gorgeous. Thank you very much indeed. Right, we're going to do the rings now. Oh, we're going to do the rings now. Right, I like the multicoloured faceted one. Oh, so do I. So let me just explain what the difference is, right? Let me hold it. We've got multicolored faceted and we've got multicolored flat. Now, I've got a friend whose wedding ring is exactly like that. Their wedding ring is identical to that. So I was going to do the faceted one first, if that's all right. Look at it, it's beautiful. Now, let me take my ring off. These are way too small for me. I've got big fat sausage fingers, but I'll put it to there. Look. Oh, well, it's I been love years that. since I've done this. Yeah, you can wear like if you're um, this whole stacking ring, so you can wear them actually where you've got that ring. Yeah. So you can have. Oh like, yeah, yeah. Yeah. The lady who sang um, "Never Enough" on Britain's Got Talent last week, she had the rings at that. But Wasn't then, she amazing? Wasn't she amazing? Anyway, here you go. Now look at the sizes on here. How do they choose their sizes then, Ben Tom? When they when they, it's how much? Ben Tom, if they've never bought before, is it, if you're on the web, does it give you a choice ch chance of this? Okay, T to you is limited. That's what that pink, pink, the minute, uh, 4 .99. Hang on, I'm just having a look on the web so I can see. Oh, yeah, 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 look, it tells you the ring size. So if you're on the website, click on ring size to choose the one that you want. But T to you is, uh, is um, limited. Four ninety nine. Yeah. Can I try it on, please? You can. <laughs> I, I, there's a clock. Ooh. What size? We're going again. Uh, oh, um, yeah. TTU is very, very limited. About to sell out. TTU. Oh, look. Do you want to see that on? Hold your hand still. The oh. mic can find you. Look. Isn't that lovely? Like you could even put other rings on with it. Look. It's quite trendy, isn't it? That's gorgeous, isn't it? That is so pretty. I've always wondered because when I've oh thank you, I've always well, the friend that's got one. I've always wondered someone to say to him, "Have you had it electro?" Because because you can buy scissors that look have that effect and yeah. they electro what's it? Yeah. They? Anyway, look, fifteen seconds. We're going again. Oh. I know. Cheaper than four ninety nine. Yeah. Are these hematite? Yeah. Okay. I think it's saying, um, I don't know where it's going to actually. What? So, well, I think TTU might be about to sell out. It's about to sell out TTU. Do you know it'd be a lovely thumb ring? Oh, TTU's thumb gone. Ring. TTU's gone. Thumb ring. Gorgeous mm. on your thumb. Oh, we won't go anywhere near my thumb. <laughs> <laughs> uh, loads of there. Carolyn, Helen, Jacqueline, Patricia, people buying two. Now, the thing is, even if you didn't, I was going to say, if you didn't want to wear it there, put it on the chain we had earlier. Oh, yeah. Have it sitting around you. I won't show you, Mike. Or on the leather. Oh, yes. That would be cool. Or, uh, that's a good one. If, hang on, let me do this one first. Oh, look at that. I like that. That's nice, isn't it? Look. Or, or if you've got a silk scarf on, and you pull the end of the silk, silk scarf. I, was, I can't take that. Oh, that was Ollie's idea. Ollie, the fashion expert. <laughs> oh, he's going to be on Sales Street in a few weeks doing making your own silk scarves. He's not. He's not. <laughs> right, moving that one on. I've also got a multicolored flat one. Oh, I like that. Oh, look. Oh, it's like a rainbow one. Isn't I love it? that one. Right, 
Rainbow hematite ring. This is not fasted. There's your sizes again. P to Q, R to S, L to N, N to O. Oh, this one only goes to the NTO. The other sizes have sold out. Here you go. You know where it's going. People on pre-order going crazy. Yeah, T to U is gone. Loads of you there. Look at all the people on pre-order getting it. Now, what Ollie's saying is gifting it, if you gifted that, right, no one's going to know it's for £2.49, are they? So it's hematite. I know. My daughter would love that. What size is she? She, yeah, well, she'd wear it on any finger. Oh, I see. Yeah, she would. <coughs> mm. £2.49, loads there. Chantal, Carolyn, Mary and Jerry, uh, Helen... Anthony, Kay, Sharon, Linda, Debbie, Clayville, Sue, loads of you there. Keep going through for that. Oh, Tom, and Tom's <laughs> moving on. Right, now I've got the next three are hematite as you imagine, right? I've got hematite faceted, I've got hematite curved edge, and I've got hematite flat edge. That's nice. I'll do I like that one that first. One. Yeah, I love that one. You see, I think, uh, I think, oh, <laughs> let's see what sizes this one comes in, first of all. Look. Yeah, that's lovely, isn't it? That one's just gender fluid, that one, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Right, R to S, L to M, N to O, J to K, P to Q. Oh, not my size. Straight down, you know where it's going. You know where it's going in price. Chicka chicka, boom, boom, there it is. 249. Can I have my screen, Ben, Tom? I've just got a big black screen. There we go. Uh, right, now, uh, TTU sold out. Be careful if you're J to K, because that's very limited as well. <coughs> I bought this ring the first time when they were on. Had to get some more. Love Chantal. Oh, I just saw you, Chantal. just saw your name up there. Chantal at £2.49. One pin pin. My hematite rings arrived yesterday. Mine is the plain grey, but they are simply lovely. Very, very happy with these, says Alison in Greater London. What's the matter? Well done. Well done. Ooh. I'll leave that one there for a minute. Now I've got the one... There we go. Now I've got the rounded edge one. This one's even smaller on me, this one. Look. Oh, that's lovely, isn't Aren't it? Aren't they gorgeous? Mm. <laughs> you know where it's going. You know where it's going. Right, TT all the TTUs have sold out on this one as well. And J to K is quite limited. <laughs> well, no, I think this one is... Try that on. That one is a very small one, isn't it? It's going to go on us straight away now. Oh, no. That's a little finger one. Yeah. Not my little finger. Which I think, I like a ring on your little finger yeah. and your thumb. Um, and it just goes, like, especially if you're wearing your wedding rings that tend to have gems in. This is just something a bit different to kind of make you look a bit trendy. Or if you're somebody who doesn't like a ring with a gem in it. Yes. You know what I mean? Perfect. He, well, hematite is one of those um, gemstones that a lot of healers use. Oh, they, is it? Yeah, a lot of healers use, use the hematite. So um, you talk about having a gemstone next to your skin. Wearing it as a ring, it's right next to your skin. Yeah, it? definitely. This one's a little bit bigger. Faceted. That looks like snake skin, doesn't it? I bet that's lovely out in the sun. Oh, yes. Look at it, in the, just the lights here. Mm. You know where it's going? Now that you can wear that one there. I think yeah, you could. that one there. Oh, now I've only got three sizes in this one: R to S, N to O, and P to Q. They're the only three sizes I've got left now. You can't alter them, obviously. Hmm. Oh well, yeah, Ollie, you've got slim fingers. This will fit. This will fit you. Loads of you there. People are multi-buying. 
Oh, Ollie's going to buy one of these. Oh, he's, oh, he's going to get the multicolored one. Moving on. Let's do the strands now, then. I love these. Aren't they lovely? So unusual. What, well, what do you call them? They're like pastels. Uh, right, this, well, this one first. Yeah. Keep going. Oh, that way. Right to left. Oh, yeah, right to left. I had to think. No, 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 I'm going to go this way. Right, so I'll turn it around that way then. Right. Here you go. Now, we've only ever done these in bundles. If you look, they're, they're just held together with like um, filament at the moment, but they are complete oval. There you go. You could do this very That's designer. That's a different colour to the one I've got, isn't it? There's a real designer feel to these colours. Like you, imagine putting pearls in the middle of those. The what? Pearls. Putting pearls in the middle of pearls. Oh, wow. Oh, lovely. So these are called hollow oval rings, 12 by 16. Hematite from China. Rose gold. The picture, does, the, the, the film doesn't look particularly rose gold, but it is the rose gold colour look. Now, oh, 9.99. How many did you get? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. There's 25 on mine. 25. I know for a tenner. Oh. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Get on the line, get on the line, get on the line. You're loving it. You're loving it. Keep going through. Yeah, that's what we just said. Pearls in the middle or tiny gemstones in the middle. You'd have to have ones that were had a hole running right the way through them, wouldn't yes. you? Yes. Yeah. Um, you could just have one and have them going that way as an earring or a pendant. Oh, yeah. You could hang a pearl off of the bottom. Nice. You could use coloured cord so that you can see it. Ooh, I yeah. mean, you know, so pretty. What are the size of the drill holes like as far as, are they generous? Well, you have to tell me. Let's have a look. Um, yes, they are generous. You'd get yeah. a few strands through there. So you could do maybe three strands of a coloured cord and you could have colours going through the middle. Can't try it, can I? Because I've got the wire through mm. there. But that would get. Oh, hang on, we're going again. Does the leather go through? I'd be rubbish at it. Yeah, the leather would go through if I didn't have yeah, that the cord, cord in there. Yeah. So you could get it, you know, put yeah. it through your cords. Five ninety nine for the, all of those. Wow. All of those for five ninety nine. That's a super price. I know. Keep going through. Lo loads of you there. Janice, Dorothy, uh, Dawn, Gillian, pa uh, Frederick, Irene, Kathleen, Gillian, oh, another Gillian. Keep going through, keep going through, keep going through. <coughs> They're flying out, absolutely flying out. Look at you all there. These are the rose gold coloured one. These Lovely. look expensive, like they could pass for rose gold. Oh, yeah, definitely. Definitely. You know, you'd have to really have a close look and you wouldn't be sure. What's that shouting? I don't know. It's that side. Is it Gems TV? Is it Toby Cavill on there? Oh, it's Toby. You can hear on Gems. Don't be turning over. Do not be turning over. Keep going through. There's only 12 of these left. Sorry, I would have warned you if I'd known. I now know. 11. <laughs> ben Tom took that as a personal insult. <laughs> 10 left. Keep going through. Oh, actually, it's 10, but one, two, three, four, five. Eight people on their baskets. Oh, eight, eight left and eight people on the baskets. See, there you go. There you go. There they go. There they go. There they go. They're going to sell out. Bright gold next. Oh, this is rich. You know where it's going. Ooh. You know where it's going. Golden. Same size, same everything, just different colour. Oh, you know what you could do? If you got the um, peridots earlier, like yeah. those peridots, get some milliput, which is like a clay, yeah. put it in the middle, and you could set some of the peridots. Oh, wow. 
That would be pretty. So, yes, yeah, you're frame, making it yeah. into a frame. Five ninety nine. Keep going through. Keep going through. These are the yellow gold version. Color. Yellow gold color. Christ. Five ninety nine. How many of those peridots are left from earlier? Are there any left? Keep going through, keep going through. Lots of you there. No. Now, are you waiting for a different colour? These aren't as popular as the rose gold ones. Which one will be most popular, Colin? Silver colour next. Oh, they're going to say... All oh, right, go on the phone. Oh, now, for some reason, this one feels heavier. That's weird, isn't it? Might be just my brain. Oh, aren't they lovely? I mean, spacers. You could do so many things with Couldn't these. You? Like at one each ear for an earring and a pearl on the bottom. That would yeah. be so designer. Um, people are asking about whether they're magnetised, right? Hematite is naturally... Ollie's just reminded me of this. I learned this when I was at TJC. Um, naturally magnetised, but they take the magnetisation out of them to make jewellery out of them. Anyway... What? Oh, my word. Yeah, we've got to do the same price. Look how many people. There are... <laughs> there are so many people for the silver ones. 5 99 these are going to sell out. Look at you all. Look at all the people in for these. Beautiful. They are going to sell out, these. They are going to sell out. Got everyone that's come in so quickly to get them. Half the stock has gone. Now, people are buying, uh, people are buying the different colours. I've seen the same name comes in for a couple of these. 14 left. F 14. Is that what you said? Drop the thingy. Let's have a look. Eight left. Have one as a connector. Thank you, Ollie. Ollie, Ollie's full of ideas, isn't he? He's very good, yeah. He does come up so I didn't say up. that. I just said, you know. They've gone, they've gone, they've gone. Right now, <gasps> teal green. Oh, I love this one. Look. What's the matter? What? <laughs> we thought some disaster had happened. Yeah, talk about drama queen. Honestly, you'd think he'd... Anyway, ready? Thought something, oh, gorgeous. Oh, I love that colour. Here's the colour. Teal, I just love it. Now, look at, is it my eyes? Look at that one there coming round now. They've got the holes in a slightly different place, or is it just the way it's filmed? Oh, no, 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 look there, there. Some of them have got the holes going on a slight, di look, on a slight, or has it? Is it my eyes? Am I being stupid? Hang on. No, that one's there. That's quite good, actually, because you could use that as a spacer and put yeah. it on the other side. I like that. Love it. Five ninety nine. Oh, look at all the people in. What's the matter, Ben Tom? There's way, uh, way too many people on the phone lines and the web line and the app for these. Five ninety nine. Oh. Yeah, yeah, we're just staying with you. Not everyone's going to get one. Not everybody will be successful in this auction. Okay, moving on. Oh, there's a couple left. Oh, okay, there's teens. There's in the teens, right? Oh, okay, right. Purple. <gasps> now, these are more than just purple, aren't they? Look oh, at they're these. Stunning. It's like very spiritual and mystical, isn't it, this? You've got like rose golds coming through as well. Yeah. Haven't you? you can't see it so much on the camera as you can in real life. Let's have a look if we see it on there. Just a bit on there, but look. Look, can you see? Yeah, there's some real sort of rose gold, a bit like oil on water. Yeah, kind of yeah, yeah. Stunning. Oh, I love the purple. Gorgeous. Purple and green together. Oh, John, look at that. Look. Oh, that's stunning. 
Beautiful, 5.99. You could, you could put these into um, your long line necklaces, into your Marla necklaces. Um, oh. Add some chain in between them and just make a long line necklace. Yeah. You still have loads left over for a bracelet and earrings, so they could go really far, actually, once Well, look how much you get loads you on get the You get loads, yeah. Loads of multi-buyers there. Same, again, same names coming in as well. Keep going through, though, keep going through. I've only got three colours left. Three colours left. Yeah, I've got three left, that's what I was just saying. Oh, right, 20 of the purple left. Having said that... People are buying threes, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Also, we don't know if those people are coming through for this or for, you're on the phone with... Oh, chaos. <laughs> Peacock. Oh, yeah, I love that. You see, again, look at those two together. <gasps> look at those two together. They all need them all, really. Don't, oh, I picked the wrong one up. Then. You need them all, really, don't you? Look. You can make a belt out of those, couldn't you? A what? A belt. You could. You'd need a couple of strands. Yeah. But it depends on your waistline, I suppose. You'd only need one. No, I'd need like 20. <laughs> <laughs> uh, blue hematite, this one. 5 99 I can imagine my daughter wearing this as a, like a jean chain. You know, oh, the nice. youngsters are into the hanging Yucks. the things off of yeah. it. Well, she's only 15 and I'm 52, so she's definitely a youngster. Oh. But she wears all these sort of things as belts, so yeah, I think yeah, they'd yeah. be good accessories. Mm, totally. Mm. Loads of lots of people agreeing as well. Hello, Hazel, Judith, Lynette, John, Janice, Joe, Sarah. Loads of you there. People multi-buying as well. They've just called it blue. You'd think they'd be more... Petrol Adventurous, blue. petrol blue, peacock blue, peacock blue, kingfisher yeah, blue. Gorgeous. Moving on, two more left. Now, is this one? Copper, they've called this. I would have called it bronze. So would I. Called it copper. Did well, they, she's, yeah. Yeah. This is quite a vintage colour, isn't it? Like, if you put this with rose quartz and or rose quartz and green, oh, you've got that whole nice, vintage yeah. feel. That kind of muted, aged look. Beautiful. You know where it's, where it's gone? Five ninety nine. Five ninety nine. They've called it copper, but we're we're calling it bronze. It's, yeah, it's not copper really. No. Beautiful. Keep going through. I know it's a queue on the phone lines. I do apologise. The call centre will be with you very shortly. Oh, now. Ooh. Yes, they would. Yeah, if you bought the kit, yeah, look. you could put the arrowheads inside or one arrow. So, you know, you could do that whole storytelling thing with your jewellery. So you might want to point the arrow to a pendant that you had with a oh, name yes. on. Oh, yes. You know, have it tell a story. I love that. Beautiful. 5 99 Five ninety nine. Look at loads of that now. There's an awful lot of people just hanging on for that one. Oh, they're on the telephone one. That's why. Right now, what can we call this one? I think it's called biscuit. Yes. Oh, antique gold. But it's like a mat, isn't yeah, it? Yeah. It does yeah. look like a biscuit. <laughs> it looks like jam in the middle there. You get a very famous biscuit. No, not like a rich tip. I like this because it's a bit like almost a brushed effect that you get on metal when yeah, you use yeah, a wire yeah, yeah, brush. Yeah. You get this effect. I'm thinking Jammy Dodger. <laughs> <laughs> well, no, you have to put a ruby in the middle. Oh, that's a posh Jammy Dodger. Yeah. <laughs> ben Tom thinks that, that. I've known Ben Tom laugh like that for ages. Oh, party rings. Oh, they're horrible party rings. Oh, I they? love party rings. Oh, that no. sugar coating. No, I don't like those. Oh, they're chocolate uh, biscuit for me. 
No chocolate on these. Chocolate biscuit and a cup of tea. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, this is rather unusual. Right, look at, look at the length of this, right? Look at the length of this. That's all one strand. Is that one strand? That's all one strand. Right, but look, 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 look. You've got hearts in gold. Then you go to stars wow. in silver. Then you go to stars in gold. Then you go to hearts in silver. Then you go to more stars in gold. More stars in silver. Hearts in gold. How long is this then? That's a genius strand. Meet and a half. I've never seen anything like that before. 330 cats. What, what? <gasps> charms. Oh. These are charms any day of the week. Yeah. But look, even, even if you just made a simple look. That would be a talking point. Wouldn't, wouldn't it? Yeah. Oh, I love that. Isn't it lovely? The stars yeah. and the hearts in the different colours. Is that Ooh. new? It's amazing. Wow. Is it new, Ben Tom? Oh. I love it. <coughs> That's not the price? No. Okay. <gasps> Whoa. Is well done, everyone who's checked out already, because watch, we didn't even do a clock on that one. One and a half metres? Yep. <coughs> 14.99. Wow. Dave will be waiting to come on now. I wonder what he's wearing. $14.99. Loads of you coming in now. Loads of you coming in for this. No, I think that price might be wrong, Benton. But there you go. That's like a whole kit in itself. But yeah. on one strand. Huge queue on the phone lines. Imagine how many pairs of ear star earrings or star Oh, charms. well, I can't even start Wish counting. bracelets, heart. Like, hearts and stars are the most popular charms when I was selling my jewellery. That's amazing. I've got this strand. It's gorgeous. Loving the show from Gillian and Frederick. Hello. Is that Gillian or Frederick that sent the message in? Maybe they Both. did a word each. Yeah, maybe. Keep going through for this. Loads of you there. That's epic. Epic, epic. Epic is the word. Would they fit inside? I've only got one. Oh, of imagine there. getting a heart or a star in the middle of in one. In the those. middle of it. So if you've bought oh, one yes. of the, um, what were these called? The ovals with the middles cut out. You've got some of those. You could put those inside. That's lovely, isn't it? Gorgeous. Keep oh, going through it. Loads of you there. Very, very popular, these. 14 99 after the break, we've got handsome Dave Troth and we've got the most incredible. Oh, it's here, it's here, it's here. I'll show you. I'll show you. Oh, wow. It's white. Look at this, look at this. But dove blue. Dove blue. It's the colour within the gemstone. That's what you can buy. And then that one there, oh, sorry, is one that's been made up by one of our designers. Oh, that's beautiful. That's obviously not $14.99. <laughs> We will see you in four minutes from now. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call center with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. This coming Monday looks absolutely incredible. Why? Because it's Nugget Day. Join Monica for her nine o'clock kits where it's buy three, get one free. And your deal of the day, oh my word, a strand of Moldavite nuggets. And another huge thing that's happening that day, we are going to be giving away a thousand inches. That's right, a thousand inches of nuggets. You need to head to our Facebook page from eight o'clock on Monday to find out how to enter. But take a look at these. We've got turquoise, we've got carnelian. Oh, so many inches. Look at all of these. There's some Larimar in here. Literally inches for miles. It's gonna be absolutely superb. Nuggets, nuggets, 
Nuggets. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Stay interactive with Jewelry Maker by texting the studio during our live hours of 8 till 5. Start your message with JM Studio and send it to 78070. Jewelry Maker, create, wear, share. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street, and Yarn Lane. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Now, I'm joined by a guest now. Now, I've been watching this man on telly for ages, right? Now, you know I'm GIA trained and I worked in jewellery before. What this man doesn't know about jewellery isn't worth knowing at all. And apart from that, he's very pleasing on the eye. So, Dave Choth, I didn't I think I'd ever get to work with you. I didn't think you. I'd get to work with you because I'm terrible at sewing. Uh, but it's it's thrilling to be working with you. Oh, no, it's, I love it. I've been it. watching you for years. Yeah, well, I've, I've been, been around you. a lot longer than you. You've just been a child when you're watching me to start. Uh, no, no, no. But um, the, the reason that I'm actually really excited when, when I was told that I was working with you today is because you've got such a long, illustrious career in, in you know, being, behind the, being in front of the camera and working with some of the most incredible jewellery. You know, we all know your history, mm -hmm. and we've seen some of the, the most incredible pieces that you've sold. And I'm not talking here, I'm not even talking at Gempora, you guys know. Yeah. And it's a real badge of honour for me to be able to do a piece of jewellery like this with someone who's experienced in the world of high jewellery. Oh, that's brilliant. But also, you also know that if I don't like something, it's obvious, right? I'm, I'm not, I'm the worst salesman in the world, really, because if I don't like something, but I saw this this morning and I was like, this has got such an, I'm not going to talk about it, obviously that's what Dave's here for, but it has such an ethereal quality. And I know, the one thing I will say about this, whatever skin tone 
you have, whether you be, you know, porcelain or whatever skin tone you are, this is going to look amazing next to any, isn't it? It's going to oh, look gorgeous next to any skin tone. I'm not the expert. I'm here to learn. I've got my chair and everything. I'm going to sit but, down. But when I was talking to John just a moment ago, whilst you guys were watching the adverts, the break, I said to John, I said, do you have your phone on you? And John, being the professional that you are, he said, no, I don't have my phone. I said, look, I've got mine. I put my flashlight on like I do and I took the strand and I threaded it over the, 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 the single beam of light and they were glowing from, from within. John said, yeah, but it looks absolutely, you did, you said yeah, it looks incredible without the light. Yeah, well, I, can't, I, can't, I can't tell films, that's no, the problem, no. see. But yes, you showed me with the light from your phone coming through yeah. and it looked gorgeous. But I like it without the light coming through it because it's just got this, I love, you know me, I love mystical, I love mystery and things like that. You said the perfect and, word. You said that ghost-like quality. Yes, yeah, ghost-like. And, and to me, it's not a term that I'd usually use, but for me, completely encapsulates what we are looking at right here. Yeah. So yeah. What, what is it? I'm going to sit back oh, and listen. No problem. So no what problem. is it? So uh, we are, of course, talking about type A jade, right? Um, over the 18 years that we've been a group, you know, I'm going back to Gems TV days, we never had the opportunity to work with jade. Right? Now, we brought you, you know, nephrite jade. We brought you jade that is dyed. But this material never leaves Asia, never leaves China, because obviously of the, the cultural significance, because of the cultural history of this stone. It's the most expensive gemstone in the world because it's so highly prized in the Far East. So the, the, the dynamic is such that it is mined in one place in the world, which, as we know, is in Kachin State in Myanmar. And 100% of that material, not 80%, not 60%, 100% of that material then goes to China. Now, that's where it's cut, that's where it's polished, and that's where it's sold. The material that we have experienced in the industry, whether we're buying it in Jaipur, whether we're buying it in Tucson, or indeed even in Hong Kong, the material that we've, and I'll be really honest, the material that we have been able to bring you, which is still rare, still beautiful, is the material they don't want. You know, and that's, the, that's the, the, the fact of the matter. They do not value pink diamonds above this. They don't uh, value red diamonds above this, Colombian emeralds, Paraiba tourmaline. This is the most expensive gemstone in the world. And when we talk about jade or jadeite, and I'm sure when you... Uh, you know, looked at the, the schedule today, John, you know, it says jade. We think of one colour, we think of green. Yeah, you know, that, that's, what, that's what, yeah, I immediately think of green. Yeah. Absolutely, and, and as you've trained with the GIA, you know, what they talk about is green jade. That mm. is the, the iconic colour, and the reason it's the iconic colour is, it, you know, as valuable as it is, it is the most common colour. That is the same to be said for diamonds. You know, when we think of diamonds, we think of white diamonds. Mm. And they can be extremely valuable, but they're, they're not as rare as pink diamonds or red diamonds or green diamonds. So the colour is green. Now, of course, it's extremely valuable when it becomes imperial green, which is something that we'd never be able to bring you here because it is so valuable in the Far East. No matter how um, you know, much of it you can find, it can be consumed in China. What we have for you today is actually the rarest colour. We have for you, and I'm not to say that's the most valuable, not to say it's the most expensive. What you're looking at is the material that is from the skin of the gold. So it's very fortunate. Uh, This rumbling noise in the background, couldn't quite figure out what it was. So okay. just gonna have a look at Dave's mic to make sure it's all right. Can I just show you this then? This is a strand here, oh, that they gave me to look at this morning. Oh, you can see it on the stand there. Look at the, it's heavenly, isn't it? And look at the tone. It's got that beautiful, ethereal, do you know what? They, do you know what they say? They say, if you ever meet an angel, an angel's wings are blue are tinged with blue. So I would almost want to call this angel wing color because even though you've got you've got the, the whiteness behind it, you've got this exquisite, and then when you get close to it, you can't see it on that one there. When you get close to it, it's got this kind of, I don't want to say marble effect, but it's got a, an undulating color effect within it. So I'm that's why I'm thinking it. Just it like what? Well, yes, it's kind of like I don't, I don't know what it is because I don't know enough about jade or jadeite or anything like that. But there's something about, and each one is totally different. Each one has got the most exquisite. Uh, it is the personality of the gemstone, like an emerald has the jardin, doesn't it? Which is the the personality of the gemstone. These have the most gorgeous, but every single one of those. Is slightly different. No two are the same. And I just think, keep it simple. If you're going to buy beads, I, I can't call them beads, can I? Gemstones like this, then keep it simple. Keep your designs beautiful and simple because the, 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 they talk, they speak for themselves, don't they? They absolutely speak for themselves. This is coming up during the show today. I'm not going to do any graphics or anything yet. And then this is what one of our team have made from it. Our in-house designer team. They put it with a pink 
Now you see that's really clever, isn't it? But the beautiful, the, the softness of the pink going with the softness of that bluey, I want to call it blue, but it is a blue tone. It's the most beautiful, soft, soft grey tone. Are we sorted? Right. I hope so. Back to you. Back to uh, you. I was saying uh, thank you for doing that, John. Uh, I got the chance to go to Magot. Now, many people have been to uh, Myanmar, Burma, uh, been to Mandalay. Magok is like its own sovereign entity within uh, the, the country of Myanmar. And that is where the rarest and most expensive colored gemstones come from. Burmese rubies, Burmese spinel, and of course the, the, the legendary jadeite. When I was there, I got to, to go to the jadeite market. And I saw you know, wholesalers, dealers, spending you know, 10 million US dollars on boulders. Some boulders can be as big as uh, you know, a garden shed, some can be much smaller, and they buy them blind. Okay, to you and I, it would be blind. But what they have is they have these instruments, and they're like metal rods. What they do is they go to these boulders, and they've got thick, like, thick black skin on them, right? They've come from millions of years of, of forming. They've come from meters and meters into the ground. And they bang the boulder with this stick, and they say that they can tell by the vibrations if it's got crystallized jade in there. Now, they don't know what color that is. The reason that these colors, these fancy colors, the whites that we have for you today, are so valuable. And if we went to Secrets of the Gem Trade by Richard W. Wise, he even makes the statement when he's talking about jadeite. He says, in modern connoisseurship, a jadeite jade cabochon of a pure white hue with a fine texture and even just a moderate translucency would be considered the finest of its type. That, that's what we're talking about. And the reason for that, uh, and in a moment we're going to hear from the lady that provided us with this opportunity, but just for those of you that maybe aren't, uh, you know, uh, well-versed in the world of jadeite, and I wasn't three years ago, because I don't believe there is a jadeite expert in the Western world. Jadeite experts exist solely in the Far East, because that's where the gemstones are. But if you think of a jadeite boulder forming, say, like an apple, so they, they form in a boulder, and that boulder is, uh, you know, the analogy we're using is an apple. Everything that you eat, you know, if we don't eat the skin, is kind of green jadeite. There'll be different color variations, imperial, kingfisher, apple green, maybe even moss and snow. But the outer skin, this is how you know, thin comparatively it is, is where you may find the fancy colors. And that's the material that's oxidized. So that's where you get your lavender jadeites. If you're lucky, that's where you get your red jadeites, your russet tones, the, the, the honey jadeite. So only on the outer skin? Only on the, the outer skin. And that's where you find the white colors, or, or indeed the blue. That's why it can never be stockpiled. That's why it's extremely rare. And that's why Richard W. Wise says this would be considered the finest of its type. And the reason earlier, John, that I dragged it over the phone line is because in that quote, he's saying moderate translucency. Yeah. You saw them glow. No, when, no, no. when the light hit them, they are actually transparent. Yeah. This is not opaque material. This is why we're extremely excited for you guys to get this opportunity. Now, later on this evening at 8 p.m. on Gemporia, we are celebrating a day. Um, it's called the Sally Hewer Day. And I'm actually glad that I get to speak to you, John, because you may not have heard her name before. Yeah. I've, I've only heard it because I've watched, I only watched oh, Okay, yeah. amazing. So Sally Hewer is the go-to lady. So that we, we used to deal, and we still deal with a guy called Bernard. Bernard Hugh is based in China. He's a jadeite wholesaler. So he's very much like Gemporia. We buy huge <coughs> volumes of gemstones, which brings the price down. And, you know, we, we'll have high end in there, we'll have low end, and we have different channels or different avenues to, to then sell that material. And that's who we've been bringing you jade out from throughout the, the COVID pandemic. Sally Hewer only deals in the top 1%. She works, for instance, with uh, the company, uh, the jewelry house, Chai Tao, uh, Chao Tai Fu, who is the, the biggest jewelry house in the world, you know, bigger in terms of revenue than Tiffany & Co. Wow. And she helped provide the jade for the most expensive necklace in the world. It's valued at $200 million. Can I, can I just ask you, because I yeah. know when you did it the last time, people, or one time when I was like, people mentioned going, oh, I can't find a website. It's because she's, she's beyond that, isn't exactly. she? Exactly. If I was to say to you, um, John, and to you guys at home, who supplies Tiffany with their turquoise? We don't know. No. You know, if I was to say, you know, who supplies uh, Harry Winston with their diamonds? We don't know. No, in no, fact, no, no. I was in the Caribbean in January. And I was with a gentleman who's actually working for the LVMH group, who now own Tiffany & Co. and many yeah. other jewellery houses. And he was buying conch pearls. I knew his name when I spoke to him. And he yeah, gave me his we business card. Doing. I didn't know him before. He was no? just a normal guy. And we got talking because we're both in the industry and we're both looking at the same pearls. And he, he literally went there and he bought one pearl. And he, <gasps> dro he dropped about $40,000. And I was like, hey. I said to him, it's crazy. And he said, yeah, but I'll sell that in New York next week. Literally on his plane trip for $160,000 for a conch pearl. And this is what Sally Hewer is. Now, she did try and launch a brand, 
uh, in the COVID pandemic. She wanted to open a gallery in Paris, and that was, that's how we've got this material. But as it stands, because of the COVID pandemic, she's had to consolidate her business, and now she only deals with the, the, the Far Eastern clientele, like Chow Thai Fu. Now, I couldn't say that if it wasn't true. Yeah. That is one of her clients, and they only work with a handful, literally five jadeite dealers in the world, because they only want the finest grade. Sally Hewer felt compelled to, to film a clip of film for this incredible necklace. Now, you'll see some bits of jewelry in this, this parcel that I received, it's got my name on it, that will be for sale later on tonight as finished jewelry at 8 p.m. And there is a strand as well that I'll be bringing later on at 8 p.m. tonight. You can tune in for it, but the largest carat weight strand is here right now. And that's the, the real coup. No pressure then. Well, there, you guys have the largest carat weight strand of this material. This was acquired in 2017. And this colour has never, ever existed. Can I ask then why, why she, she could have chosen anybody in the whole world yep. to have collaborated Absolutely. with? Absolutely. And I'm not, don't mean this. No, 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 please do. But why, I want you to ask you? the questions. Why did she choose you? Well, the, the, the reason that she chose us is for what I said before. We can do one huge deal. So this lady, for the last uh, five years, say, has been putting pieces aside from what she's you know, uh, getting from Myanmar selling to Chao Thai Food, selling to stores in, in uh, you know, Shanghai, wherever it may be, Beijing, Hong Kong. And, you know, she, she was putting pieces aside for this gallery that she was going to open in Paris, that she hoped to open in uh, 2020. And essentially, the COVID pandemic stopped that. Everything shut down. Tiffany shut down. Fabergé shut down. We're unique that we can still, you know, yeah. pr provide our services. Yeah. We were still wanting to buy jewellery because we were busier than ever. And so we reached out to Sally Hewer who we've seen in Hong Kong many times at a wonderful booth. And she had this material. And we said, look, we'll take it all. Well, you know, you don't have to worry. It'd take her 10 years to sell it on her own. Um, and without a store, it's impossible. So we did this incredible deal. Now, she also told us that going forward, as in this year, 2022, the market was going to resume. Yeah, Hong Kong was going to open again. And she said, just so you understand, I won't be able to do these deals for you anymore. We said, absolutely fine. You've done more than enough. It's incredible that our, de our collectors, you guys, everyone that watches Jampori has got the chance to own this material. We said, thank, yeah, thank you very much, and that's fine. Hong Kong was cancelled again this year in March. Oh. For, it's 2022, yeah. which is crazy. Munich's open, Tucson's open. I'm going to JCK in June. But still in the Far East, in Hong Kong, they've closed the show again. These people have shipment, shipping containers full of jewellery in that port ready to, to provide to the world. You know, 90,000 people are going to descend on that three-day event. And so she reached out to us and she said, I've got one last deal if you're interested. And she sent this to me and I was blown away. And you, know, you can hear it from me or you can hear it from the lady herself. And this is Sally Hewer talking about the most unique Jada opportunity we'll ever be able to bring to you. Take a listen to this. This Lan 呃，是一批白翡翠和我们称之为蓝水的设计，在不同的光线下，它真的会发出蓝色的光芒。There you go. So you know, this is what she is calling dove blue material. Now the skin of that boulder, it's very unique boulder, was had this beautiful white color with unbelievable translucency. But just like you picked up on, uh, John, it's that smoky blue. That's what she calls it. But but now this is going to be me being controversial. Now. Please, normally. When you see somebody going, oh, we've got it from this big, big, this big suppliers, big supplier, they get, they're not us, but they would say, yes, you can have the second rate stuff, but I'm keeping that. What she unraveled yeah, there yeah. is this. Yeah, well, actually, it's not, it's this not is like finer. Lesser, this is not a lesser. No, in fact, this is the, the, the most unbelievable opportunity, I believe, for, for me as a collector. Uh, and this is the one that I've myself acquired because the one that, that was actually unraveled there is one size. This is graduated. So this material is graduated. The one that, that was unwrapped there will be on sale tonight at 8 p.m. on Gemporia, but it's all one size. To have the full graduation, yes. and you saw when we put it over the light, that those larger stones, some of them were purple. Yeah. Some of them were this beautiful smoky blue. 
But you don't, I'm sorry to keep you no, please do. excited about it. You don't even have to put it over the light no. to see those hues. When you put it on your hand, you can see those slight... Absolutely. Like the purples, all the moments. Blues. Yeah, beautiful, yeah. beautiful colours. So for, for every single one of you that's tuning in right now, I want to be completely upfront. We have 300 of these. Okay, it sounds like a lot. It is a lot. But if, if you have the chance, no one go above their budget, whatever it is. We, we together right now with what we've made, managed to accomplish here at uh, Jewelry Maker and Gems TV, we're going to save thousands. We're actually going to say if, if the Hong Kong gem show had been on, and th that strand that I'm unraveling there, if, if you just go back, sorry, Ollie, uh, um, and I know it's difficult, but that, that strand that is unraveled out of that beautiful envelope there. I mean, how the one much? that says only to be given to death, yeah, drop yeah, that yeah, one. Yeah. But can you imagine the, the, the price that you'd have to pay? I know. There's yeah. a reason we haven't bought you Jade Eye. Um, for, for 15 years. It's far too valuable. We haven't had to compete with the Chinese market on this material for the first time ever. And, and this material that you are getting the chance to acquire right now is quite possibly, and it's not my words, I'm not a Jada expert, Sally Dewar's words, who is, you know, it goes back generations, is saying this is quite possibly rarer than the Olmec blue. And it's because you don't see this material. She said all of the material, the material you see at 8 p.m. tonight, the strand that you're going to see today is from one single boulder that only she acquired in 2017. But also, also um, if we've got what should have been going there, yep. when they eventually open, they're going to be saying to her, where's the jade light? Oh, Dave's got it. Dave's yeah, no, absolutely. It. Of course, um, she, she'll still have imperial green no, there. of course. But, but, but you're right, this material, and I never, I never said, look, this is the most valuable, it's the most expensive, but I'm saying to you right now, it's categorically the rarest. You know, there, there are, every boulder quite possibly might provide Imperial green is extremely valuable, but there is one boulder, literally one boulder, not a few. Or they've it's not like they've collated this over 20 years. They got lucky with one incredible boulder, and the skin of that boulder had this beautiful white material that is, you know, if it was just white, that's incredible. Look, that's what Richard W. Wise says. Yeah, that's the, in modern connoisseurship, is uh, pure white with a hue and fine texture and moderate translucency. It's the finest of its type. But to then go one step further and saying, look, when the light hits this, it glows blue. It's the impossible strand that we're bringing you today. And usually I'd say to you, you're jewelry makers, create a pair of earrings, uh, create a ring, do whatever you want. I'd keep this as a strand. And I'd put a, an 18 karat gold clasp on it, or a platinum clasp. I think platinum would actually work really well. And I would pass this down through the generations. But the one promise you have to make uh, to me today is to go and get this valued. And you don't have to send them to me. Usually I say, send your valuations in, isn't it incredible? I'm saying just do it for yourself because there is zero chance of me being able to replace this today for 10 times the price you're about to pay. Zero. Zero chance. This is not available in the market. That is a smoky blue, or what she calls dove blue, type A, which means it is 100% natural. You can, no see, treatment. you can yeah. see just from that. And, and in fact, I'll, usually go back, that's sorry, the go worst back, shot. Go back to, the, yeah, go back to the strand. You can see it. And on telly, oh, it's it the takes worst. out colour. It takes oh. out colour. But you can see it just sitting there on my yeah, monitor. Look, and, and before we are, we are going to open the graphics in a minute, yeah, yeah. I know a lot of you are waiting. And oh, I get sorry. That. I'm too busy in learning here. But, you know, what, I, I quite frequently go to Bond Street. We have vendors there. We deal with people there. You know, Charlie Barron is based there. And, and when I go to Bond Street, I'll look at some of the most incredible jewelry I've ever seen in my life. Honestly, jewelry that we couldn't dream of even bringing here. And you've been as well, I know, and I see that jewelry. And the sad thing is, if I went in there and I, I was fortunate enough to spend <coughs> $40,000 on something incredible, or 40,000 uh, pounds, the best it will ever look is the moment I buy it. Because they spend more on their lighting mm -hmm. in the jewelry stores than I'm, I'm gonna spend on my car. And that's the reality, because that is their shop window. It's literally what the term means. What we have here are the worst lights for jewellery, amazing lights for me and John, make us look great. Um, and that's what TV is well, about. This is the best I can look. No, no, that, no. I, I just mean, look, what, what me and John are, are fawning over is showing it live in the studio, not even the special video where we've got no, the daylight. No, no, no. That that's right it. there, you can see John's shirt in the background. It's a live, live picture. And what I'm saying is, the most incredible thing is, me and John are going, that is incredible. And I'm saying to you, that's the worst it will ever look. Yes. Because yes. we, we can't replicate Yes, so what you're saying is if you go to a bond yeah. store, whether, you're going to... When you Unless you're spending case, 60 grand. You're go, yeah. that's the best it looks, that's the worst. Yes. So I always used to say, if you love this on the telly, yeah. you're going to totally and utterly adore it. Now, I've got two quick questions. Please do. The things. Yeah. No, love it. Does that mean if we've got it from her that... It's very rare. Can, any, can, they, can they go to Harrods? Can they go to Selfridges? Yeah, I'd love to. Yeah. I'd, I'd love to actually 
uh, usually I would love to bring you uh, price comparisons. Yeah, yeah, we yeah. love to do that. Yeah, yeah. You know, I'd love to go to the, the biggest jewelers, Van Cleef, yeah. uh, Chow Tai Fuki even, anywhere, uh, and bring you some price comparisons. I know it'd be amazing. But I'm going to tell you something now, and you can record this. There is no one on earth that can provide that color of jade. You know, and the reason is it's, it's actually come from one boulder. It, it's not even, there's not, uh, if you see the jade color wheel, you know, that the GIA put out, yeah, yeah, yeah. that uh, Mason and Kay put out, that jade color wheel, it's not on there. It doesn't exist. And just before we get into it, I'm going to go to the GIT, okay, which is the, 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 the Thai equivalent of the GIA. And being in the Far East, they're, they have a lot more jade come their way. And, and this is what they say. Blue jade, a, a rare jadeite jade. And they literally say, one of the most sought after stones, it goes on, it talks about the structure of this stone. And then if we go one, two, three, four lines down towards the end, they say the stone can be found in various colors, ranging from white, green, lavender, purple or violet, brown, blue and black. And then they say, among those, the green and lavender are the most famous hues, while the blue is considered the rarest variety of this jade. And what's so fantastic about it, it is the most beautiful, it's Ethereal. not blue in your face. No, it's not it's ostentatious. Not turquoise. And no. I'm not presenting the wrong with turquoise, but no. it's like... You're so right. It's not that kind of crass, yeah. harsh colour that you might find with irradiated topaz. This is that, that beautiful... Like, I think you actually nailed it when you said it's that ghost mm. uh, kind of light colour. It's that ethereal colour. It's that smoky blue. And it's what uh, Sally Hugh is calling dove blue yeah. jadeite. And I'm absolutely in love with it. And on top of that, just quickly, it's the transparency that blows me away. The transparency of this, these goods is second to none. Right, I've got one last question. Please do. If you make yourself a necklace out of it, it's going yeah. to be your heirloom necklace. We're saving for best and everything like that. You know when you have pearls, you have to be careful with, with your moisturiser yeah, and your yeah. perfume. Is there anything we need to do to look after our jade? Uh, absolutely not. It's one of the most durable stones out there. Of course, I'd always be careful, yes. with, like with pearls. You know, just out of caution, I'd say that about a ruby or an emerald. I'd say, look, make sure it's the, the last thing you put on, it's the first yeah. thing you take off. But this, you know, unlike many other gemstones, kunzite being one of the most notorious, even in exposure to daylight over 100, 200 years, the colour won't change. This is, you know, and, and we know that because this material goes back to the Neolithic era. You know, they've, they've, they've valued jadeite since before the Christ. You know, we're talking 3,000, 4,000 mm. years, talking about every single iteration of their empires in China that have valued jade eye. Oh, there you go. Look, this is the most angelic strand of gems I've ever seen, just stunning from yeah. Catch and Avon. Well, thank okay, you very much. so if it's durable, because yeah. there are some gemstones out there that you'd say, put this in a pendant because you don't want to knock it. Or anything yes. Like that. Could you put that one of those in a ring? If Absolutely. You in fact, you know, in, in, in Asia, one of the, the most incredible things they make is some of the most delicate jewellery they've been, because it's so durable. Think about a bangle. Yeah. I mean, a solid bangle as well, made out of just jade, or a ring, a saddle ring, just made out of completely jade. That, you know, not, no gold. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah, how just, durable it is. You know, well, it's not, so, like, so it's it's not like, like porcelain or something. Exactly, because there are some gemstones, aren't there, you'd say, oh, uh, yeah. buy it, but don't put it in a ring, because it would knock it or anything yeah. like that. But this is hard wearing. Yeah, it, it, it's, it's, and the, the difference is we're dealing with crystallized jade out right now. And you know that because it's transparent. So opaque material can, can sometimes be a little bit more brittle. When you have crystallized goods like this, it's the top, the top. There's nothing better. And that's, if, if these were larger, for sure they'd have made a bangle out of it. Yes. But you have the unbelievable, impossible strength. Can I just say, and I know we're going to do it, and I, I'm so glad yeah, yeah, sorry, we questions. have been waffling on. I, I'm just going to say, I cannot believe myself that I own that. Every time I look at that, on that bust, in the studio. I'm not even saying, oh, Ollie, show us your shot in the Dela record. I'm saying, I'm looking at that right now, and I cannot believe that that is Jadeite. It's unbelievable. It's unheard of. This is why I love Bane. Unparalleled. You're so passionate. Yeah. You say, I always say this, when you watch me on Sewing Street, don't you? Somebody who's passionate yeah. about their, what they do, like I'm passionate about what I do, yeah. you're so passionate. He's not going to come on here and give you a load of old baloney. No. He is proud so to proud. have been able to bring this to you. Now, he's saying he's got one. He hasn't bought one yet. I haven't seen his name come up on the thing yet. Well, so he hasn't bought one yet. Come on, Tom. Don't leave me like this. <laughs> um, but but, but uh, that's all I want to say is you're truly and utterly so passionate about what you bring Let, let me that's... just tell you one last thing yeah, before yeah, I yeah, get yeah, into this, do. if that's okay. And we've, got, yeah. we've, got, we've, got, we've got as much time as we need to, to get through this. The, the price is going to be unbelievable. But this is how much I love Jade, okay? And it's because it's rare. I love rarity. It's not even so much about the beauty for me. This is beautiful, but yeah. rarity to me. Having something that no one else can have. Now, I have a daughter, she's nine years old. But when I went to Magog, 
She was what, four years younger, so she was five. And she's, she's into jewellery, but I mean, she's not into jade. She's wearing sparkly things, whatever, Claire's accessories, you know. <laughs> but obviously, when I'm buying jewellery, I'm thinking of, of, of her in the future. And I got the chance to go to Magok, and it was like a last minute trip. It's like the, the, the border had opened, our visas were this thick. It was incredible. It was an adventure, right? It was a real voyage. And we get to go to Magok, and the only references to Magok, to actually being in Magok, were from the GIA from 1957, because it had been closed for that long, and it hadn't changed. And yeah, we yeah. went in there, and I, and I thought to myself, look, I've been to Hong Kong. We, we've never been able to afford jade eye. This is my only chance. It's my only chance. And I went to the jade eye markets. I was, I was with uh, Roshan Garwali, who's, who's obviously uh, a Magok native, um, and he was saying, we, we can try and find you something, try and find you something. I found this bangle. And I've got a video of it, but we're not going to bore you with it. And this bangle, I deliberately picked up a low-grade bangle because I'd never seen Taipei Jade. I'd, never, well, I'd seen it at Hong Kong and never been able to own it. I was like, this is jade. I picked it up, no treatment, and it was opaque. It was like mottled. It wasn't one consistent color. It was like a dull green, but I was just so enamored with it. And I said, Roshan, can you, can you ask? And it's always the ladies that do the business in Burma. It's so different to anywhere else in the world. The men mind, the ladies sell. I said, we, we ask her how much. And uh, I thought to myself, look, if it's a thousand pounds, I'll buy it. You know, I'm not wealthy or anything, but I thought, what, what an investment. That's what I thought. I thought, I'm going to get jade eye. No one in the world can get jade eye. I'm going to get this bangle, and I'll put it in my daughter's collection. I'll get the certificate. It'll be incredible. It was $20,000. Oh. Yeah, at source. You know, because we think, we see it in Hong Kong, we think, oh, it's gone through, what, five, six? Yeah, 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 yeah. Hands. It's, it's in the Chinese marketplace where they value it so much. Literally, it'd probably come out the ground days before, been fashioned into this bangle in the old uh, uh, antique way, the way that's never changed, when they polish it on wet bamboo. And it was there, it was, and it was fifteen or twenty thousand dollars. And I was like, I cannot believe so it's not so, and, I, and I walked away a bit dejected. We bought Spinel, we bought Ruby, and I was like, that's it then, we'll never buy Jade. Yeah. Can't afford it anywhere in the world, and we got to get a Magot, and we can't afford it there either. And then to think, here we are, three years on, four years on. And not only are we bringing you Taipei Jade, we're bringing you the most immaculate version of it. So good luck to anyone who wants to own this for their own future uh, generations to pass down. OK, so is it time to... It um, is time, of course, yeah. You're not going anywhere, are you? Because I'm sure... I'm here, question. I'm here. Don't you worry. Right. OK. There's the, uh, yeah. Right, everyone has the same opportunity. The, the graphics will come in in a minute's time. So just repeat. Well, it's, it's this trend, isn't it, that I'm doing? The yes. graduated trend, yeah. Just... Oh, you see now, looking at it from here, mm -hmm. I've got the blues. Now I can see a tinge of purple and yes. a tinge of pink in there. I don't know if you can see it at home. Look, it's just got a. I yeah. only own Jay Dyke because of you, Dave. I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart. Oh, from Hazel, in there. thank you very much, Hazel. Oh, That's hang on. So kind. You've got thirty seconds. You've got time to bring your phone over here. Yeah, I am. I'm going to make. We're going to make time. Right, okay. Show them what, what I showed you. Now, earlier. will you be able to see this? Because this is unheard of, right? This is. They talk about this. You know, look at that. And remember what Richard Weiss says, you know, moderate translucency. Yep. Here's that, you're going to come on to that purple one soon. There it it's is. Just unbelievable. Um, and and I th there you go, you can see it. Because the light's a little bit bright. Yeah, 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 yeah. But you can really see those colors. But they're like, they're like um, planets. Yeah, you know, yeah. It's not stars, but you know what I mean? It, it, Absolutely, they have a life to them. Right, I'll give you your phone back. Thank you. Thank you very much. Right. I'm so excited that I'm in today because I didn't know I was going to be doing any of this. Yeah, I mean, John's just come on. You know, we've, we've had uh, all of the hosts here have had their chance to bring Jade. John comes in, what one show, and he's got the, the most, the rarest Jade. He's like, <laughs> you just nailed it. Right. Now, we've got a price there of £1,598.99. In the open market, that's a... That it wouldn't be, it, that's you, a silly price. It'd be way more than that, wouldn't it? Way yeah, more, I mean, way more I, 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 it's, it's extremely hard to price this, and it'd be misleading if I was to, because I've never seen anything like it. But my only experience with something similar to this carat weight was that 15,000, I mean, like, before the market changed, before COVID, let's be honest, yeah, yeah. Um, was a $15,000 bangle. And this is, I, I, I'm the only person in this room that saw both, I held both. Held the bangle, saw the bangle, held this, saw this. This is far more valuable. It's a far better grade. It's what they call fine stone. That's what the, the, the Chinese refer to it as. It has amazing water content, which is what we're seeing here. Is that what makes yeah, it? Yeah, so, so they talk about the water. I love the, I actually, I prefer the way that they talk about gemstones. In the yeah, forest. yeah, yeah. Here we're so concerned with like our gemological terms, diaphanity, yeah. fire, dispersion. Then they talk about ruby, they talk about pigeon blood. 
Oh, it's yes. not a sales technique, it's not romantic, no. but it completely encapsulates what we're dealing with. Yes, yeah. and when they talk about white nephrite jade from the Cotan deposit, they call it mutton fat. But for me, that they just... They call it what? Mutton fat jade. Oh. I know, it doesn't sound great, but... But then, you see, mutton fat could be a luxury out there. Yeah, oh, no, it is. It's, it's the most valuable material yeah. um, from, from the Chinese Cotan deposit. Congratulations to, to every single one of you who's already on the phone lines. I cannot replace this at this price. Cannot. But we're nowhere near done. Nowhere near done. We had 300. Oh, okay. Oh, we've got 300 these. We've right. got 300. 300, right. Which is uh, an unbelievable. Object. I thought when you said 300 earlier, you meant 300 beads. Uh, no, of, of absolutely everything. You know no. what I mean? Yeah. So we've got 300. Three, of everything is in this show today. Uh, and, and we're going to give you guys the, the most incredible opportunity. You're going to get first refusal on this, as it were. But whatever remains, I'm going to speak to management and see if we can take. Two gems later on tonight. At 8 there won't be any left. I, well, I, I don't know. I don't know. I'll be tuned. What time is it? Tonight? Eight o'clock. Eight, 8 p.m. tonight. I'll be tuning in. But for me, I want to be able to bring the biggest carat weight, the, the graduated 130 carat Burmese jade graduated strand from the Sally Hewer, the house of Sally Hewer. Yeah. Let's uh, look at that purple there. Let's do a minute clock. Let's do a oh. minute clock and give you guys another deal. Margaret, Sonika, Pamela, Bev. Oh, have you got names, have you? Oh, yeah, I'm going to oh, swing yeah. this round so you can see it. No, 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 no. You can shout them out. It's absolutely fine. Oh, already, people have got no idea where we're going to, and there are so many people on the phone lines. Beautiful. Now, trust this man. Trust this man, because he knows what he's talking about. 40 seconds. We've got 40 seconds till it goes down. Please be careful. Do you know what? Uh, uh, people are actually checking out. People are already checking out now. Uh, I mean, obviously, you're not going to pay that price, but this is how much you trust this man. This man here, right? Absolutely. Look, and uh, what I'm going to say to every single one of you, and of course, do not stretch your budget. To get one is incredible. <coughs> but to, to get two, if you can get two of these, then you have the opportunity to you know, make jewellery out of it. I wouldn't, I, I think it'd be sacrilege to take this apart and create, you know, have one as a strand and then yeah. maybe get another one to create the jewellery out of. Right, here we go then. So it would be, it would be incredible right now if I was to take, I don't know, 500 pounds off this price. Wait, Tom. It would be incredible. And that, maybe we should do that. Maybe we should go pantomime and go, we're going to drop here, we're going to drop yeah, here. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to give you a serious, serious uh, show of intent right now. I can't go to the final price right now uh, because, of course, it would be crazy on the phone lines. But we're at £1,598, which and is incredible. And 99 pence. Pardon? And yeah, and 99 pence. pence. Right now, I'm going to show you how serious we are. If we get a great deal, you get a great deal. And we got a great deal because you know, of Hong Kong being closed. Take this. Yeah, so if I took the 598 off, that would be incredible. How about we take the 1,000 pounds off? And what? 598 pounds 99. So we take a grand off right now. Do you know what? I'm, while we do that, I'm a great believer in being in the right place at the right time. I'm a great believer in fate and people being where they should be. If Hong Kong had happened this year, you wouldn't be seeing, you wouldn't be seeing this, would you? Well, well, ima like, picture it this way. Say we, we are in the Chinese marketplace who revere jade above all else. And their only experience with jade is the greens, the different colors of green, moss and snow, of course, the lavenders. Imagine for the first time ever them seeing dove blue jade. The first time ever. We understand the rarity, but you can imagine how much that rarity would speak to them. And imagine how, in reflection, that would be priced. It'd be priced above the likes of the most uh, you know, famous colors that, that the GIT talks about when they say, you know, the green and the lavender are the most famous hues. Well, the blue is the rarest. It's considered the rarest. And to have that kiss of blue in, in this full strand that transitions <coughs> all the way through this 130 carat impossible strand Look. is unbelievable. Yeah, let me show it all the way through. Dave just said all the way through. I'll show you the whole, the whole strand there over my hand. Look, hang on, if I do it that way around. So you can see, yeah. every, it's not like, oh, the three ones at the bottom are the big ones and they're beautiful. But look, all the way around are fantastic, aren't they? Now, the other thing I need to point out to you, five-way split pay. Oh, I didn't realise that. Yeah, you're good. I, I didn't realise we had five-way split pay. So, you could get this home for £119.99 and then pay that four times after that. So, to, for you to get it home and look at it and fall in love with it. Now, my mum and dad, I say this all the time when I'm on Sewing Street, my mum and dad never, ever, ever, they just go, we don't do tick or we don't do... It's there for a reason. Use it. You do not pay any interest whatsoever. I will say, right, this is what I say. So you put £599.99 pence on your credit card and then you pay £119 off next month. How much more yeah, goes so on? Right. 
With interest. I never thought of it like that. that we, don't, so we, don't, we don't charge you interest. We literally take that £599 and split it five ways. But Dave's already said that's not your final price. Nowhere near. Actually, nowhere near. And the, the, I didn't even know Five Way Split Pay existed. Is that yeah. a jewellery maker thing? Because I've got the show of this material tonight at 8 p.m. And that's not on Five Way Split Pay. That's not on... So, so if, 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 you know, there's 300 of these. I, we know, John, more than 300 people watching, okay? Yeah. We know there's thousands of you watching. If, if 300 people miss out and I say to you, don't worry... We do have other opportunities available at 8 p.m. tonight. Being completely honest, it's not even in my best interest to tell you this, but this is the, the, the biggest strand, okay? And it's the graduation. I've yeah. got a strand later. It's one size of, of uh, the, the beads. That's not on five-way split pay. That doesn't exist at Gems TV or at Gem Boria. Also, the other thing is, I know this is jewellery maker, yes. but some people might want to have this and not make it themselves. They might want to come to you, but you won't get this at 8 o'clock tonight. Who's your, who are you on with? You're on with uh, I'm, I'm with uh, Lynn tonight. Oh, Lynn. Lynn oh, and Dina and I went to the same college. Oh, really? I was there a long time before them, obviously. <laughs> um, anyway, 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 anyway. The one thing I would say is about the strand. Yeah. And you said they might not make it themselves. They might get, yeah. You have to get these individually knotted. Right. 100%. Because if this was to break, you, you don't want the risk of losing all of them. Lose one, okay, it's, it's, well, it's a shame. It's a huge shame. But to ima imagine them all cascading onto yeah. people. Get them individually knotted. If you can't do it, I, I, you can reach out to me. I know uh, pearl stringers in London who can do it. Um, I mean, but you're it, saying get it professionally. So yeah, so get it professionally strung if you're going to make. And, and necklace. I'll give you an inkling of where we're going to go eventually on pricing this, John. It costs you more to get this strung by by my friends in London. Yeah, yeah. Right. Than the final price of this, and we're talking about Type A, Dove Blue Jadeite from the House of Sally Hewer. And Sally Hewer is the lady that Chow Thai Fook go to to acquire their jade. Mm. Uh, ben, Tom, can, I, can you just remind me what the sizes are of the... S six, eight, and ten mils. You see, they're, they're, that, they're not chips, are they? No, they're no. not small, uh, any uh, of them. And, and by the way, when we deal with, with material like this, usually you know, we're dealing with it as a parcel. And to me, when we're talking about jade eye, 130 carats is a parcel. Yeah. It's a parcel oh, of... Oh, yes, yes. You know, that, 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 that's essentially what you're getting. You know... In the 15 years prior to, to the, the moment of us bringing this material, if someone had said to me, look, we've got a jade eye. It's type A, it's certified type A. Um, we've got a uh, translucent material. It's like a white, but it blends into a blue. It's only existed in one boulder in history, as far as we know. It was, the boulder was discovered in 2017. Are you interested? I'd have jumped, I'd have cut my own hand off to get a carrot of that material. You know, and, and for them, if they'd have said, we've got 130 carats of this material, uh, are you interested? We'd, you know, had we not got the price we've got today, we'd probably made... Uh, how, how many beads are in this? Do you know? Yeah. Do you still call it a bead? Uh, I don't know what Even they call though it. it's... You see, I, I called it beads earlier. So, oh, I'm not... I'm disrespecting... No, I, I don't... But... I just like to refer to it as a strand because I don't like yeah. the term rondelles. I don't like the term beads. I don't like any of those terms. I yeah. think rounds is, is, is more appropriate. You're right. Um, here we've got a collector from Monmouthshire said, I bought a jade bangle from Gems over 10 years ago. Had it valued last month at four figures. I'll be passing this on to my son as a legacy piece. I had a collector who bought um, a piece of jade off me, uh, much smaller carrot weight, green material for £99. She had it valued at £2,500. £2,500. This is the reality of what we're doing for every single one of you. And not only are we giving you a piece of the pie, we're giving you the largest piece of the pie. We, we're giving you the, 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 the most impressive piece of that whole parcel that was sent by Sally Hewer. It's 57. 50, 57. We'd have probably made 57 pieces of jewellery. 57 on um, it. Right. It's extremely busy. Let's get another <laughs> clock in. Let's get another <laughs> clock in. We could stop here. I'll take the rest of them to James, but we're not going to. We want, we're doing it here for a reason. We want you guys to own it. We want you guys to, to, to have this material. This is a statement of our intent. How People multi-bidding, look. Oh, I would. Absolutely. If you can get two of these, if you can get three of these, especially with the price that we're going to go to, then I would absolutely recommend doing that. I just think, you, you can listen today about the rarity and everything like that. Buy them because you love them. Yeah. Right? It, it, it's fantastic. 100%. It's an investment, you know, all that sort of thing. But if you just love them, and you can have something, well, you can have something that so few people in the world actually own. No one. Well, no, but no, apart from the 300 people that buy Oh, yeah, oh, 100%, yeah. You're, you're one of 300. You won't walk into the, your local town unless you bump into some of these shops here. You're not going to see somebody else wearing it, are you? Unless you go to a very, very... Is it Raffles Hotel in, oh, in Hong maybe. Kong or something like that? And, and you know, that, that one strand that the, our, our in-house team have created with the, the pink thread, I'm in love with that. Yeah. Like, I'd never have thought to do that. I'm not uh, a jewel maker in many... All right, take oh, £200 pounds off the price. Pardon? Take £200 pounds off the price and then... 
Um, I'm going to tell you, the next crash will be our final. No, 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 crash. hang on. No, no, you mean 399's the final crash? No, no. I mean, I mean look, if we, get, we could do that. So many of you are already interested. We've got multi buyers, as you said, John, but yeah. I want to do the, the best deal. I want, you to, I want you to get your valuations, like our collector did, who had hers valued at four figures. And we're telling you this is rarer. That's not your final price. Look at the panels. Look how many people. No, right. everyone pays the final eight price. Eight people check out at the first price before we decide yeah, the yeah, 1,500 yeah. price. Right? So many people checked out at 599 because they really thought that was going to be it, right? Look at the split pay. Look oh, how God. much you Five can get ways split pay. For. So, I mean, you can get. I mean, if, I, if I was in Hong Kong and I saw this for the first time ever, worldwide debut, which is what this is. Yeah, yeah. It's debuting here right now, this Dove Blue variety of Taipei Jadeine. And I said to the person that they had a strand in a cabinet with lights all over it. And I said, can they give you £80 for this today and leave the country with it? Mm. Yeah, it would be impossible. Mm. Impossible. Um, what I'd really like to do right now, while it's extremely busy on the phone lines, could we hear from Sally Hewer one more time about, yes. Oh, yes, about please, this piece? Please, because yes, this is do. the lady that put this together. Uh, and, you know, of course, she's talking in Mandarin. She's, she's sent, her team have sent us the subtitles. She wanted to reach out to you guys and talk to you about this unique opportunity, which is only be available for 24 hours, right now and at 8 p.m. tonight, and this being the, the first and, and finest offering of that parcel. Take a listen to Sally Hewer. This kind of material is from a part of the sea. In the sea, we can see a kind of aormeke sand, but this kind of material is more unique and unique. Tabiotonyohadaiquai 在不同的光线下，它真的会发出蓝色的光芒。Fascinates me. Oh, I think she's incredible. I don't know. First of all, I thought she's a lot younger than I thought she was going to be. Yeah, yeah. Because when you said all this lady who does all this, I was thinking, oh yeah, yeah. Family goes back generations. Oh yes, I'm sure. So she she's been involved in it since she was a child. You know, sorting through jade eye with her father, with her siblings, and before that, her grandfather. It's in the blood, basically. Yeah, hundred percent. And that that's what jade eye is about. You know, Jadai, the people that work with Jadai, they don't have credentials. They don't have letters after the name. They're people that have lived it. And there is no substitute for that. There is, no. I mean, look, can I... There's one stone there. Uh, Which one? Right. Go up. Up. Oh, sorry, keep going. Again, again. And then across. Across. That one. Above. That one. Look at that. That's that single piece of Jadai. It's ice Jadai. And you're probably thinking, well, Dave, what is ice Jadai? Uh, Tom, can I just have the um, clicker one second, please? Ice jade eye is this material. Okay. That's a crystal. Oh! I mean, that is the, 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 the translucency, that is the texture of that one single round in this strand. Is it not? Yeah. It is. But there's a few like that, I yes. think, aren't there? When you, get, get to, when you get it home, you're going to spend hours and hours just pouring over it, looking over a strong light, but look, just look at it in the sunlight, look at it in the moonlight. I bet you any money, it's one of those things that looks completely different as well in different lights. 100%. So if you go to a ball with chandeliers, it's going to look one way. If you're just wearing it in the garden, and, and you say, it, yeah. sunlight and everything doesn't affect it whatsoever. S Sally Hewitt literally says, you know, it's a translucent white material, but in the light, it glows blue. Yeah. And I think that's the best way, the best uh, uh, representation of this material. It is white material. As we know, that's the material that the emperors valued above all other yeah. varieties of jade. Yeah. Uh, if you find jade, Chinese jade carvings from private collections, this was offered in 2018. I just want to show you how rare white jade is. That has nowhere near the translucency of what you have in here. Granted, they're much larger carat weights. And they have the, the, the historical significance. But as you go through it, you know, they, they, sell, they say that the, the sale total was $8.5 million, all jade. And, and look, this is the prices they're paying. You know, the, the Phoenix on the left sold for $116,000. The centerpiece there, $68,000. The piece on the right, um, $37,500. And then you know, the one on the left there, because it's translucent, because it's pure white with not much of the black and gray in it, yeah. sold for $170,000. It's the price of a house. Yeah. And then, and then you get the gray and white, you get um, the, the other material, that because it, cause it's the skin, it blends into these different colors. Oh. But to have the purity, that's where the value is. Yeah. That's where the value is. You can see it here again, $86,000. That one in the center there, 
You can see the translucency. $2 million. You're reading that fine. Oh. $2 million. Can I have a minute clock, guys? I think oh. possibly a third of the stock is already gone. I, I can't tell. We I, can't I don't wear any of these. But we've it. got a lot of multi buyers. Yeah. And, and this is our final price now that I'm going to give you. Okay, because I know you want it. All you guys along the bottom, successful. Remember, everyone pays the final low price. So if you got in at 1,500 pounds, if you got in when there was no price on screen, you're only going to be charged the final low price. And I'm, I'm with you. Take advantage of the, the interest free split payment. Yeah, no, Why exactly. wouldn't you spread it? Why, why wouldn't you? I mean, yeah, exactly. It and it's no interest charge whatsoever. What I would th what's going through my mind is I'd like to buy these in memory of somebody that I've lost. Oh, and man. I don't mean to be more no, no, anything please. like that. But because I said they're like the colour of an angel's wings, they say that an angel's wing is this colour, right? Well, kiss of blue. It's that blue. It's yeah. that. It's the angels that have white wings. They have that soft, soft. And it's called, she calls it dove blue, doesn't it she? Dove blue. And dove is like the, feathers. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. And I just think it'd be a lovely, lovely. I'm yeah. concerned because uh, I agreed this price with a uh, management team, but I didn't know you guys were going to have five-way split pay, so no. I might get in trouble. But even, I'm going to do it. Even with the, sorry, I keep no, going. please, I love Even it. with the five-way split pay, you, we have been given this opportunity because of him going to see her, yep. right? If it wasn't for Dave and his passion, you wouldn't be seeing this now. This is an opportunity for you to get something that you may never, ever, ever see ever again in your lifetime. Right. I don't think our call centre are going to experience the volume of calls that they're going to get right now. 130 carats, the rarest jade in existence. Not, I'm not saying the most expensive, but I'm saying for sure the rarest. Yeah. It came from one boulder in 2017. And I'm going to do it for you guys for £199. That's what we're going to do. And the, and the split pay is going to remain. You're going to get five-way split pay, which is going to be insane. But every single one of you right now has got the best deal we've ever done as a business. As, as, as a, a company that's been going you know, in, in different iterations for nearly 20 years, we've never done a deal like this. Okay, I hate it when you watch a shopping telly and the presenter goes, oh, feign shock, right? Yeah. That was genuine shock. <laughs> I saw it. I wasn't even told that in, my, in, in the prep this morning. Look at the split pay. In prep this morning, we were not told that it was going to go to that price. Look at the split pay. You could get a gemstone that you might never, ever, 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 ever see again in your whole lifetime for £199. There's 130 carats in there. As yep. Dave said, get it strung professionally and keep it as a necklace. hundred percent. And, and I, like I did mention earlier, I said, look, to have this strung professionally will cost you more than the jade yeah, itself. But it's worth it. It, it. You have to do it. It's security reasons is what we're talking about. And, and I just want to go back to that quote that we read at the start together <clears throat> that Richard W. Y. said. You know, in modern connoisseurship, a jadeite jade cabochon of a pure white hue with a fine texture and moderate translucency would be the finest of its type. And then you go back even further. This has always been the case. It was the, the, of all the colors, the imperial green has made its way to the top because it's more consistently found. Mm. But the emperors, if you go back through 1,000 years or more, if you go back to 1388, Wang Sao here says, on examining jades, one should regard those with white in color as the best. That's from 1388. Oh, my word. Yeah, so from 1388 to 2008, which is when the Secrets of the Gem Trade second edition was released. You're talking... This has always been, and, and then to have not just the white, not just the translucency, that would be heaven within itself, but to have a new variety, an exciting variety, a variety that is so unique it possibly never will be found again no. due to the conditions that it must have formed under with the oxidization, with its exposure to heat and pressure for one boulder. And remember, you know, I'm not going to tell you jadeite's running out. I'm saying we can't afford it, but it's always there. It's just consumed by the Chinese market. Thousands, tens of thousands of boulders are found each year, millions of carrots, and one boulder carried this colour. And also, if you're thinking it looks like, I see that th this is me, right? I'm sitting here and I'm looking at this on my screen there, that was what you're seeing at home, but I'm also looking here. If you love it on that television screen, if you're sitting at home now in your kitchen or your lounge or wherever, or your office or your sewing room, wherever, your jewelry making room, and you're thinking they look beautiful. Wait till you get them home because the inner, it's got like an inner glow. You know when you meet a good person and they have that lovely, it's like an aura, like that inner glow, and you know they're a good person, you know they're a nice person, like him, right? But you know that they're good. You know that they're lovely. And inside here, every single one of those gemstones has got that inner glow 
that is so if you're seeing it on the telly thinking it's lovely but in real life can, can i just say so i actually have to say this because it would be irresponsible of me not to say oh, okay it. i'm gonna say it and it, i might get in trouble for it, i don't care you have to multi buy on this and the reason is when i got this price agreed by our management by our group md um I said, look, I want to go to 199 so more people can get it. Okay, we, of course, we're taking a much lower margin, but it's, just, it's exciting. It's incredible. And at that point, it was a two-way split pay. So to, to get it home on split payment, it would have been £100. Yeah. You can get almost three of these for that price. You can suddenly get two for less than that price today by using the split pay. £40, to get two of them is £80. One of these on split pay would have been £100 today. Yeah. Same, same end price. That's what we agreed, but it was a two-way split pay. You know, uh, manager Wayne has, has got access to do split pays, and I did. I genuinely have never done an auction, whether we've sold something next door for eleven thousand pounds, or here at Jewelry Maker, or anything we've ever sold. I didn't know five-way split pay even existed. It's only so meant thrilled. to use. I only know this because we've used it once next door. Yeah. It's only meant. To, well, it is a special occasion. Yeah, of course. It's only meant to be. But also, Ollie was just saying, right? Maybe you've never watched me. You've never watched Dave. If it's the first time you've watched Jewelry Maker, you're thinking, well, how do I know it's any good, right? We do have, not that you're going to need this, but you can get it home for 39 99 You then have, what's it, was it 30 days? 30 days to look at it. If you don't fall in love with it, send it back because there'll be hundreds of other people who would love it. Do you know what I mean? Uh, and look, I hate using the 30-day yeah, 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 money back there as a thing. But if you've never seen it before, you might think, but I think you'll get it home, pay you 39 99 and can't wait to pay your next you know, one. I'll tell you what, if you want to send this back within 30 days, I'll come and collect it. Yeah, because that, that's how incredible this opportunity is, though. It's absolutely outrageous. And like we said, when you see it on the hand, it's unbelievable. And look, like, like Ollie just mentioned to you, John, in your ear, maybe you've never watched this before. So I'm going to let every single one of you now know uh, how to buy, how to get involved. Uh, Dorothy, thank you very much. It's lovely to hear from you. Um, 45 seconds, girl. Um, this is how you can get involved. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Here at Jewelry Maker, we're always looking ways to make your shopping experience better. That's why on certain items, we've got split pay, where you can spread the cost over two, three or four months at no extra cost to you. So you can buy your way with split pay. How apt that that advert was there because yeah. you can get this for thirty nine ninety nine first payment of your five split pay. I know. Um, I got my blue jade. Thank you. Looking forward to the jade to arrive. Thank you from Sharon in Wiltshire. You've you've got uh, what an incredible acquisition that you've got there. I've got another one um, from oh. Debbie. She says, Dave, another amazing price. Thank you so much. Never thought I'd be able to own something so beautiful. I didn't. No, I mean, did I. Even being in Magot, I didn't think I could own anything. Certainly not this beautiful, but even anything half as good as this for, for any amount of money, you know, and to have the opportunity right now, especially with the split pay, which makes it accessible. Can I take, look, there's a lot of you in a queue, there's a lot of you within baskets. This is our final price. This is the, the, the ultimate deal. I think maybe the best deal I've ever done. Um, I'd like to hear from Sally Hewer one more time. If that's yeah, okay. no, no, you do, This you is do. the lady that has made this possible. You're not, you're not buying from me or John today. You're, you're getting this from this lady. You're acquiring it from this lady, and she provides the finest jadeites in the world to the biggest jewelry houses in the Far East. And you've got the rarest of the lot. This is what she had to say about this piece. <laughs> Zhang 
Now, I don't want to add any undue pressure. You know I don't do that. And you know I'm not a hard face salesman. But all of you who've got it in your basket now, and you're sitting there thinking, shall I confirm, shan't I confirm? Uh, this is me telling you now, I would confirm. I definitely, there's quite a few people got in their baskets, right? I would definitely, definitely confirm. Um, it's a fantastic price. Uh, 39, take advantage of split pay, but there are, so, there are lots in your basket and I'm terrified that you're gonna miss out. Absolutely, look, there's no commitment to, 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 to check out, but we're trying to make you aware that it will be taken out of your basket because now we're getting towards the last, you know, less than 100. And the, the, if they're on the phone and it's in baskets, then they can be removed. Um, you have the opportunity to, to check it out. This is not uh, ASOS. You're not going to get an email saying, did you forget this in your basket? <laughs> it will just be snapped up. It will be gone. It's the only... Many people here have been watching the whole time that we've been broadcasting. You'll have never seen this material. And so to have the opportunity to acquire it is unbelievable. Completely. And like I say, you see that on your telly. If you think you love it on your telly, wait till you get it home, right? They'll, start be, they'll be sending them out from Monday, won't they? They'll be oh, yeah. Going out from the warehouse on Monday, you'll have it by the end of next week. 190. Can, can I just try something actually? Yeah. Can I borrow that, John? Oh, I want to try and do the light even over here. Thank you. Okay. Um, just to show you that you know we're over there. It's lit well. I'm over here. I'm just going to hold it up and just show you um, the translucency that we're talking about. Oh look. Yeah. You know, this is either every single strand, every single. Be, look, that's transparent. Mm. That's actually transparent. It's impossible. That's ice jade. Then we come down. There's the purple. And then, you know, we see these colors. It's unbelievable that you have this. <coughs> this at Christie's, this at Bonham's. You can imagine the prices. But you're watching us at a jewelry maker, uh, myself and John, having this opportunity to bring it to you. And I want to say a massive congratulations to the hundreds of you that are on the lines, the hundreds of you that have already got involved. But that transparency, is, it's actually impossible. We've never had transparency like that. I'm holding that up. It's just my phone light behind it. Yeah. Congratulations, guys. Massive. Imagine it against your skin tone. First of all, it feels yep. beautiful. It's got a lovely weight to it. And if you just wear a simple necklace like that, you're going to know it's there. I imagine when it's cooling as but, well. But it's, it's a very tactile stone. It's extreme. I mean, jade is so valuable. It's the only gemstone in the world that they would prefer. You know, the, the, the jewelers in the Far East would prefer to make everything out of jade. They have a, a, an old proverb. They say, you know, gold is, is valuable. Jade is priceless. That's why they'll make the whole ring out of jade if they can. No gold shank. They make the whole um, uh, bangle out of it. Yeah. Uh, the, the, the strands. I've seen jade sell for an excess of uh, $300,000 on a leather cord. That's, that's just the reality. We are talking about the opportunity. Usually, I think we say, you know, the opportunity of a lifetime, and that's very apt. This is the opportunity of a generation. Because generations before me, you know, my parents, my grandparents, their grandparents, you know, going back... Thousands of years never had the chance to acquire jade. It's never oh. been available in the West. It's never been available. So well done to you guys for seizing the opportunity and it's getting this home. Natural, isn't it? Type A, one hundred percent natural. That's what type A means. And this is grade A type A. It's the best of the best. It's transparent. It's the rarest color. It has that blue kiss, that smoky blue, the dove blue, uh, the ethereal qualities to this. It's large. It's impressive. It's over a hundred carats. And we've got multi-buyers around the world getting involved. Now, you've got, you're on at 8 o'clock tonight. I'm at 8 p.m. tonight with, with uh, you know, a, a selection of pieces from the same... Oh, yeah, not the gems from the same, same skin. With, with, yeah. But you've got more of this in made jewellery. It's obviously made jewellery. In made jewellery. But you haven't got anything. Ha, ha, so we've got one strand that you saw, but it's not graduated. And I love graduation. Love it in pearls. Mm. Love it in any strand. I think it's, it's beautiful, the way that it just you know, graduates towards that, that bottom point where you get the, the, the bigger carat weights. We've got one strand of the same size. It's just beautiful, isn't it? Right, we're going to let Dave go because he's obviously much. got to prep for later. Two questions. Yes. One, when can I come on Gems TV with you? Oh, I'd love at any time. Okay. Any time at all. And two, when can I come gem hunting with you? Oh, I'd love it. Well, no, because I, I to... went in the film industry. I was in Ethiopia. I did. I was... Please, we'd love to take you. Yeah. We, we get a, I think we might be going to Thailand later this year. So we'd love oh, to have I've got a house in you. Thailand. It's fine. Oh, it's let's do it. Let's hear it. <laughs> that, Dave, thank you so it's much. It's been an absolute pleasure. No, to no. I've loved it for a long time. I could just listen to you the whole hour.
Brilliant. And the same, Brilliant. same Thank for you me. very Thank much you. indeed. Right, I need you to check out on this though. I need you to check out. If you definitely want this, please, please, please check out. 199.99, split pay five ways, 39.99. It's, it's just beautiful. It's called Dove Blue. Isn't it fantastic? Right, I can see how many of you got, like Dave said, hundreds have checked out. I'm going to leave it open over the break because, well, I can't see any names because it goes off the bottom of the screen. There's loads of you with it in your basket. People continually are checking out, but please, please, please do check out because I don't want you to miss out. And it's not, it doesn't make any difference to me whatsoever if you buy it or you don't buy it. I'm not on commission. I'm not anything like that. I just want you to get something that's rare and beautiful and something you're going to absolutely fall in love with. Uh, we're going for a break now. I'll see you. Uh, what am I doing? Oh, I've got, I've got boxes. I've nine things. Jewelry boxes. Oh, it'd be lovely to put this in. I'll see you in four. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call centre with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. This coming Monday looks absolutely incredible. Why? Because it's Nugget Day. Join Monica for her nine o'clock kits where it's buy three, get one free. And your deal of the day, oh my word, a strand of Moldavite nuggets. And another huge thing that's happening that day, we are going to be giving away a thousand inches. That's right, a thousand inches of nuggets. You need to head to our Facebook page from eight o'clock on Monday to find out how to enter. But take a look at these. We've got turquoise, we've got carnelian. Oh, so many inches. Look at all of these. There's some Larimar in here. Literally inches for miles. It's gonna be absolutely superb. Nuggets, nuggets, nuggets. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Interactive with Jewelry Maker by texting the studio during our live hours of 8 till 5. Start your message with JM Studio and send it to 78070. Jewelry Maker, create, wear, share. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street, and Yarn Lane. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. 
You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Now, look what I've got there. Uh, make sure, can you move that thing out of the way? This? Oh, your microphone's not on either. Oh, no, can I put that out the, over? Can we see oh, that from upstairs? <laughs> Have we got, is the ups am I in the right place for the upstairs camera? Where am I supposed to be? Let me just put it in shot. There it is. Okay, now, uh, the reason you're seeing that box is I want you to have a look at this. Is that for me, John? No, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thanks, John. Right. I just need to say to you, move your head out of the shop. God, what's she like? Um, there's 15 baskets. You need to check out, not on the box, on the beauty. Oh, look. It's just exquisite, isn't it? You need, that's the stranded one, obviously, with, with the, um, you won't get this and you won't get the pink bits in the middle. But how gorgeous are they? They're gorgeous. Is this what you were just doing? They're, it's amazing. Yeah. yeah. See, they look so different in real life yeah, than they do on the yeah, telly, yeah. don't they? Anyway, I'll leave it with you. I can still see lots of... So many of you bought it. So many of you bought it. But it worries me about how many are in baskets. I'll take that back now, then. Thank you very much. Has she taken away my, my bust? Do you call them a bust? Kinga, where's the bust? Oh, she's a right old feisty one, this one. She's too good to touch. She is. Right. Um, am I doing these now or these later? We're doing them now. You could wear, Kinga, you could wear it and be the model. You could wear it and be the model. Yeah, yeah, yeah she says, yeah, of course I can. <laughs> Love to, thank you. Oh, it's gorgeous. Oh, right. Yeah. Are we doing that one first then? Or are we doing that one first? Hang on, why have I got all these? Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. <gasps> oh, these are lovely. Do you, uh, do you know what? The thing about, um, Sometimes when you buy a jewellery box like this, it's a bit flimsy, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. There's nothing flimsy about these. They remind me of, like, um, Grace Kelly shoes for some reason. Or Audrey Hepburn. Look. I think it makes all the difference having good boxes. Yeah, but it's... Look, it's really, really, really good quality, that. And it's adorable. And what? It was before I started banging it about, apparently. Grow grain ribbon. Done a little bow on the front there, like a brushed gold finish. It's called gold ribbon bracelet box. Oh, I put a necklace in it, but there you go. Bracelet box. Oh, yeah, I suppose you would put an eight-inch bracelet in there, wouldn't you? It's got the two elastics there. This is lovely and luscious, like a velvet inside, all cushioned. Have you got a bracelet? Oh, you haven't got a bracelet. Uh, no, no not on layout. We'll do, we'll do it with one of the others later. Um, anyway, how much are we going to on this? Well. Well, says Ben Tom. <laughs> well, I'll have well. a think about that one. Mike's just had a bit of good news, so he's happy. <laughs> oh, he's decided now. Oh, what? Clock in. Clock in. Oh, I thought he was getting a bracelet. Will you not get me a bracelet, Michael? Never mind. Doesn't matter. Don't. No, no, you're fine. You stay. <laughs> Aren't they? It's just beautiful. It's so well made. Uh, I've got, I've got, I guess it's all about the presentation, but I've got others coming up as well. But that is just stunning, isn't it? A bracelet, look. Thank you, Michael. I've known Michael for many years. We were just trying to work out this morning how many years ago it was we met, weren't we? It was about nine. Nine years ago. Really? You must have been a school leaver. Did you come to Rocks and Coast as a school leaver? You're not. He's 31 now. Look, 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 just put, put, just put, you don't get the bracelet. You don't get the bracelet. Look how elegant that makes that bracelet yeah. and expensive. Beautiful. Imagine if you got a gift shop, a, 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 car, a box like that from a gift shop. I mean, you know. Right, 13 seconds and we'll be going down. It's going to be a ludicrous price, Ben Tom says. I just think they're lovely. These are brands banking new today. Oh, 
Because that takes so long, that four ninety nine. Four ninety nine. Four pounds and ninety nine pence. Loads of you coming in for that. Loads of you coming in. Congratulations, make sure you check out. How long do you know what? If you make jewellery on your stand, wouldn't it look lovely with that on your you know on your stand and everything yeah. like that? I think it gives you kudos if you're there yes that's the and one. you've got you know high-end pearls or you've got diamonds like the blue diamonds you know you present them in a box like that and people are going to take you more seriously totally does that make sense yeah no no totally it's all about the presentation as ollie said 4.99 keep going through lots of you there <clears throat> make sure you confirm make sure you confirm make sure you confirm it's lovely isn't it and Tom's finding something very funny. I don't know what it is, though. Gorgeous. Lovely brushed gold. At 4 99 What more can I tell you? It's beautiful. Can I feel it? What, what? It... Oh, yeah, you... Oh, wait, sorry. No, no, it's, it's hefty. It's that not flimsy. It feels like wood. Is it wood? Oh, yeah, what's it made of then, Tom? What is this... Well, I've looked it up now. No, it does, doesn't it? It's like wood on the bottom. It's yeah. super Down nice. Down the top. Oh, that's super nice. And then you could use it afterwards for keeping your jewellery in. Oh, yeah, oh, definitely. You? Definitely on your dressing table. Look gorgeous. That's really yeah. Lovely. At 4 99 Oops. Moving on. So that's that one. Bangle box. Is that your bangle box? Yep, that's the one. <laughs> Bangle box, long safe. Now, we're not going to spend too long on this. It's got lots of gorgeousness to play for you. Colombian emerald coming up in a minute. Now, oh, I love Morganite. Morganite coming up as well in this hour. Straight down. Right. We just hold on to that. I'm just going to take a slurp of my lemon juice Indeed. just because my throat's going. 2 99 That's good. That's very good. You know, like your stretchies, if you've got a lovely stretchy that's like pearls with a lovely charm on yeah. it, you could Thank put you. it in there, couldn't you? Mm. Oh, no, it'd be lovely. And imagine, well, any uh, those lovely ones you made earlier. Yeah, or something Look. like this. Yep. Yeah. An amethyst. Immediately looks Look, very expensive. immediately. Look, if you gave that as a gift. Not that that was, I mean, it looked gorgeous anyway, but it just finishes it off. Oh, look at it. Imagine like a sterling silver piece or yeah. something that you set gemstones into and then somebody, you know, you know, like when you, you always think when you get an engagement ring, thank you, you, yeah. get, you get it in the engagement ring. Oh, box. yeah. It's, it's yeah. that kind of box, isn't Yeah, it? totally. And at 2 99 uh, like if you're a maker and you have them on, on your stand, they're going to look gorgeous on yeah. your stand, aren't they? Like, at 2 99 Beautiful. Oh, now I've got the same names coming through for this one as came through for the last one. Oh, well done. They're gorgeous. I'd love to know what you're going to do with them. You're just going to have yours at home in them or you're going to set... I mean, you, if you sell, you could automatically add more than... You know what I mean? Oh. Got a pendant. I haven't said that for years, Ben Tom. Pendante box. Well, it's a chain... You put your little mm -hmm. chain in there, wouldn't you? So you've got your little two little, um, what are they called? Slits there to put your chain in. Have your pendant hanging down. So put it on there like that. Pop it in the box. That's a really good way to display. Yeah. So if you're at craft fairs, mm -hmm. rather than taking everything out of the boxes, just put the boxes next to each other because yeah. you can see the pendant. Well, then you could sell it like that. Yeah, you yeah. can. Do you know what I mean? Because you could add, how much are these? Two ninety nine. you see. You could add a fiver on straight away, yeah. couldn't you? Beautiful. Golden ribbon pendant box, two ninety nine. That's what I love about jewelry maker. You can go from like rare, rare, rare gems, and then little gems like this for two ninety nine. Something for everybody, isn't there? Yeah. Multi buyers. <laughs> Ollie, you're very funny. The one thing when I'm gifting, he said, is I never have a gift box. Oh. I know, I know that. I know the <laughs> wife and four girls. He's surrounded by women. <laughs> a lot of jewellery goes through his hands, apparently. At two ninety nine. 
Beautiful. Keep going through for that. Lots of you there. Lots there. Wiltshire. <coughs> People multi-buying. Lanarkshire, Shropshire, Wiltshire. West Yorkshire. Oh, Samantha, I love West Yorkshire. I went to college. One of my colleges was in West Yorkshire. I live in West Yorkshire. Do you? Yeah. Where do you live? Pudsey. Oh, do you? Oh, I went to Bretton Hall College. In, oh, uh, did you? Yeah. Did my first degree there. It's lovely there. It's gorgeous. Right, look at this one. Now, we were just saying, engagement ring box. Imagine <gasps> going down on one knee with oh. a box like that. It's going to be hard to hide in your pocket if you're going to sit having your dinner first hand. But look. Right, look hang on. That. That's beautiful. There you go. Beautiful, isn't it? Shake that. No. Ring box. Watch. You go to a shop and try and buy one of these in this quality for that price. Yeah, you've not seen it before. I'll put it back in. There you go. There's my ring I wear. So That's then so it's, clever. Then I just realised it's a, a needle. Beautiful. Uh, one ninety nine. What was the matter? Oh, loads of you there. Lots of lots of multi buyers. Lots of multi buyers today. You can keep your own rings in these because it keeps them. Oh yes, you know, totally. Safe. Yeah, you've got yeah. your special ring. Well, especially if you've got one like a, a, your diamond engagement yeah. ring or a, an emerald ring or yes. a ruby ring. Keep it in there. Keep and it's it going to keep nice and safe, isn't it? And look gorgeous on your dressing table or in your in the cup, your dressing room, wherever you keep your jewellery. Or just give your partner this box and say, anything you want to put in there for my birthday is fine. Oh, oh <laughs> that's a good one. Yeah, my, my husband would put a wine gum in there. Yeah. Go, you said anything. One ninety nine. Have a quick look at the star buys for the end of the hour. Colombian Emerald. Oh, that's a lovely Look story. at the colour. Now, they say when a gemstone goes smaller, you lose the colour. You're not losing the colour in this, are you? Brand spanking new today. That's obviously not this. That graphic isn't this. And then... <gasps> look. Nigerian morganite, totally natural. Right, apparently, the <laughs> price on this is going to boggle my head, apparently. That's what Ben's son, friend Tom said. They're coming up. Now, when are they coming up? It's 20 past already, look. Colombian emerald at half past. Nigerian morganite at quarter to. <gasps> Ooh. Now, this can be screwed to the wall if you want to. Look. It's an eight drawer little compartment box there. Now, this is good for your findings and for your, is that what you call yeah, them? I have my findings. I also have my little cabochons. So sometimes I'll put a double sided sticky tape onto the back of a business card or a piece of card. Yeah. Put all of my gemstones on there and, and then, then just like put them in like a little file. Oh, wow. And also you can see them then. In order you? of size. Yeah. So that if I want a three mil or a four mil, um, and as you say, these screw to the wall. So if you haven't got a lot of room, you can start utilising the space. They're very organised, don't you? Uh, well, Have you got a dedicated... Yeah, I've got a studio. Studio, darling, studio. Darling, it's a studio. It's actually the spare room. Oh, it's not at the bottom of the garden or anything Oh, it used like to be. Yeah. Yeah, I used to be, but... Um, if I do the really heavy jobs, like the metal, my jeweller's bench is in a garage now, because you know, I've got my big gas bar off. <laughs> oh. But yeah, I kind of like to use all the walls and have all my bits. Yeah. You know, the more organised you are, the quicker oh, you can course. find things and the more efficient you are at making. Straight down. <clears throat> Straight down. What do, you need, what do you need to put in it then, Tom? Pins. And what would you put in that? Po they're very small post it. Fishing notes. hooks. Do you go fishing, Ben Tom? I can't imagine. Uh, well, do you not collect footballer cards? They could go in there. Smarties. Now, you have to be careful because a lot of these companies say don't put food in them unless it's wrapped. I'm eating a lot of Jakeman sweets at the moment. I keep my different coloured Jakemans in mind. They're the ones for sore throat. Oh, yeah. 4 99 I thought. <laughs> It's not a sore throat. I've got no voice, that's all. It's not sore. No, it hasn't been sore at all during the whole time I've had it. Well, 
Well, I didn't even see this appear. <gasps> Ooh, this right. is amazing. I have no idea. Is that a funnel? What this is. I've got stickers. Then I've got a drawer in the bottom here. You're ready for this, Mike? <gasps> Seed beads or findings. Seed beads, findings. You have to put it. What's this for? It's a funnel. It's what? Funnel. I think it is. Oh, to tip your seed beads in. Yeah, so, do, you know, like if you're working and then you pick it up with your scoop and then just pop them in there. How brilliant is that? That's, I've got one of those on my desk. I couldn't live without it. Little funnel. I like it that it's collapsible because it's easier to store. Uh, John Debbie and all the jam crew, I want to say thank you uh, for an uplifting show. I woke up feeling Aww. awful and feel better now. Oh, Janice. Oh, I hope you Always tune better. in, yeah. Oh, it's nothing worse, is there? Uh, Ollie says, thank you very much indeed. It's all because of him that the show is so lovely. Well, how much? Oh, I want this. Do Sorry, you? I can't see, can't see sure. how much it was. Oh, thanks. Bye, go. I'm going then. See you later. <laughs> That's really lovely. I think that's brilliant. I've never seen a funnel look, do that. No, you before. can put your tools in the top. Yeah, I'm more I, interested in the funnel. Look, look, look. That's, I like that. Look, you can put all the tools in and. Oh, yeah. Like, look at that. Okay, take it back. Right. More storage. Oh, now, I've seen these before, I think. Oh, no, I've watched Mark. Mark's presented these, hasn't he? I've seen. I'm doing the pink one first. Look, that's what it looks like from the front. I've not right. seen these. Look! You get lots of stickers, round and oblong. You get the little jars, little like sample little jars. Pack pots. Oh, yeah. Other, other peppermint sweets are available. <laughs> so what would you put in there? Tic Tacs. No, you'd put seed beads, spacer beads, like if you want to separate your three mil or four mil. Yeah, beads. and then you label it That's with what size is in amazing. there. Amazing. Hang on, that would have to go on the side, I think. I wouldn't really it, not the top. like that. Oh, is the other one exactly the same, just turquoise? Oh, go. 24.99, 24.99. I just love things like this. I don't know so what I'd put in it, but I just love things like this. Very good for transporting things, you know, if you go to a craft club or if you yeah. take your, your stuff with you on holiday and then you've got it all there, all organised. How brilliant, they're cute, aren't they? And then you've got your mesh pocket on there and then it all zips up nicely like this with jewellery maker written on it and a, quite a sturdy little handle there. How cute. Oh, it's lovely, isn't it? What do they call it? Oh, they call it a seed bead carry case with pink trim, 70 round and some rectangular boxes. Great for diamond art, says Shirley. Oh, yeah. It's diamond art, that one where you have a picture and you can go, oh, you yeah. don't lick it, but you, you get the little stick. Pen, yeah. yeah. <gasps> oh, I love those. Right, okay, blue, blue version. No, no, Ben Tom. Harpost is the Colombian. <laughs> so it's exactly the same, but with the turquoise. There you go. Oh, oh, it's not oh, the it's same. Different. It's not the same, Ben Tom. Yeah, you know, but they're, it's, they're all square ones. There's no round ones in this one. Yeah, personal preference, still $24.99. It's still a black storage seed bead case, carry trim, blue trim, 80 boxes. Mesh pocket. Twenty-four ninety-nine. Keep going through for that. <clears throat> could you fit your needles in there? You, know, your you could fit short needles yeah. in there. You wouldn't fit a beading needle, I don't mm. think, because they're much longer, aren't they? I bet it looks gorgeous when it's full of all different coloured oh, seed beads. Yes. <laughs> right. Shall we have a star by? Who on earth is next door? I don't know. They're shouting at the top of their voice. Who is it? It's a bit of a Harry Met Sally moment, it sounded well, like, didn't it? I wasn't going to say that. That's what it sounded like. Oh, oh it's because they Someone's can. Someone's getting very right, excited. Um, this is brand new today. 
Who's presenting next door? Go and have a look through the window. <laughs> Go and look through the window. Well, there's, I can see a window, but I can't see who's through there. Who is it, Adam? You don't know her name? Oh, honestly. Anyway. <laughs> Adam's not Sally? very sociable. <laughs> right, come on. This is brand new. Colombian emeralds. Beautiful, aren't they? Look at the colour. Now, with the Colombians, you're going to get that little blue tone coming out of there, aren't they? Oh, are you on Hobby Maker this afternoon? Ah. They have to start setting up now, you see. Anyway, this would be a good price, but it's not your price. Seven carats of Colombian emerald, fasted rondelles, one to three millimetres, 15 centimetre strand. Did she win? Okay. Angelina Joan Lee uh, loves the Colombian Emerald. I work with her on um, Tomb Raider. Did you? Yeah, that was, the, that was the last film I did. Was she nice? Yes. Lovely. She did get me into a bit of trouble, but that was fine. It's because I was doing this morning at the same time and hadn't told the filmmakers that every Monday and Thursday I'd disappear off to do yeah. this morning. And then she, every Monday and Thursday, would stop filming to go to a Winnie Baker. And they go, why do you keep going to Winnie Baker at 11 o'clock? She goes, watching John on the telly. <laughs> they went, John here, and they said, oh, John. Anyway, I got into a lot of trouble. The last one. Right, here we go, under 200 pounds. <laughs> under 200 pounds. 199.99. Beautiful colour. Aren't they? The colours are extraordinary, aren't they? It was my mum's favourite gemstone. Oh, emerald. is it? Yeah. Um, she always loved her emeralds. There's something magical about an emerald. Yeah. It's the colour. <coughs> it's, I don't know, there's, it's something about it that is just so beautiful. And Colombian emeralds are considered by some to be the best, be well, I, to me, they're the best, best, mm. best emeralds mm. you can get. Yeah. Oh, minute on the clock. Look at the green. Well, first of all, they're green, Ben Tom, but then they've got a blue undertone. He's getting very excited <laughs> by the blue. He said, look at the blues, look at the blues. The chromium content. Ooh. He thinks he's at a football match. Today. Come on, the blues. What's the matter? Isn't it Millwall you follow? Uh, one millimetre to three millimetre, graduated up. Seven carats you've got there. Seven carats. Brand spanking new today. Ben Tom uh, brought it out specially for me. It is a long, normally a Colombian emerald strand would be like that, wouldn't it? It wouldn't be anywhere near yeah. this length. What? What? <laughs> Getting half price? Half that price, anyway. I don't know. You've, you've given me that too early, you see, because here we go. Ben Tom likes to get this to go at the set. Have you noticed? He starts that before that gets... Anyway, 70... Oh, more, more than that, 79.99. Okay, there's only 50 of these. And five have gone already. It's a very special strand to have in your stash. Isn't it? Especially if you work and make for commissions, because people will ask you for emerald jewellery. Oh, will they? Yeah, like special But they'd not realise how much an emerald piece of jewellery would cost them. No. But if you could put a few of these in, they'd be Or gorgeous. they'll ask you for green, and if you can offer emerald... Oh, yes. ...within their price range, yeah. then that's lovely. But look. Look. How... Look, look, look. That is stunning, isn't it? How beautiful. It's so simple. That is stunning. Oh, great oh. deal. That's not your price. Oh, what? <laughs> A minute clock. Okay, Ben Tom's going to take it to a price that shouldn't be allowed. Well, at £79.99, I think we're pretty good. £79 is pretty good. I just, I mean, you get more than that. I'm just showing you it as a ring. Yeah. Yeah, look, from there, the green in there. Oh, sorry, Mike. Traditional emerald green, isn't it? Or how about pearls with emerald spaces? And then you could make like a pearl necklace with emeralds and a bracelet to match an earring. Ooh. So you've got like a whole suite. Ollie likes, Ollie likes, um, pearl, you said pearls and emerald together, didn't you? Ollie? I love those together. I think it's really classy. Ooh, very nice. 
Oh, yeah. Oh, he's getting very... Uh, we had the papaya pearls in the 8 o'clock hour. Uh, 49.99. 49.99 for Colombian emeralds. I know. Star deal. What's it called? Star Star Burst. buy. Star buy. <laughs> Star burst. Star burst. <laughs> Opal frames. <laughs> yeah. Made to make your mouth water. Ooh. 49.99. Make sure you go through for this one. Seven carats of Colombian emerald. I bet Angelina didn't pay 49.99 for hers. I don't think she'll have paid full stop. What's good for Angelina is good for me. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Beautiful. Keep going through. Well done, everyone who's got it so far. 49.99. Pardon. I don't know what you're talking about, Ben Tom. No. Oh, ben Tom's getting very excited about something. I'm not going to. Gorgeous. Keep going through. Keep going through. Well done. Morganite coming up at quarter two in ten minutes' time. Oh, I love morganite. Mm. This is Nigerian morganite. Beautiful. Look. It's a pink that even if you're not into pink. Oh, yeah. It's yeah, like yeah, a yeah. dusky pink, mm. isn't it? Like a vintagey yeah, feel to beautiful. it. Beautiful. Very Audrey Hepburn, yeah. Princess Grace, that oh, kind of vibe. Gorgeous. That's coming up at quarter two. I've got something. Uh, what are you going with that? Pearl earrings, yeah. Thank you. Oh, wow. Right, hang on a sec. Have you got a picture of these? Or a film? Look. Oh, aren't they unusual? Aren't they cute? Yeah. Look. Yeah. Little oh, earrings. They're lovely. Don't you worry, Kinga. I heard him call them late. There they are. And then they just open up like this. Oops. They've got that little, you know, you pull it back and then push it back in again. I'll show you on that one again. So there you go, like that. Got like a hinge on them. Then you close it up. I keep saying I've got my glasses on. I've got my glasses on. <laughs> there you go. These are white freshwater pearls in 925 sterling silver. Already made for you. You don't have to make these. You could Always. embellish them, though. Could you? Yeah, you could just hang it like uh, a drop in the middle. So maybe oh, a couple yes. of those emeralds or just to hang down, you know, like in the middle. Just there? Yeah, just there. So you could embellish them. It's hanging down from the bottom. How much would you pay for pearl earrings? Oh, Are they sterling? Yeah. Oh, I hate to think, mate. Oh, it depends. I mean, if you're looking at somewhere like Monica Venedi, you're looking at over £100. Oh. I bought these earrings for my birthday box dash. They are very lovely, says Alison. No. 95 selling silver, white freshwater pearls. I hope you got them at this price, Alison. These are a great buy for gifts. I know so many people that would love these. Yeah. Well, they're simple, aren't they? But very elegant. Elegant, yeah. yeah. Also, um, any age as well. Yes. You think, like, grandma's going to love them, mum's yeah. going to love them, but teenage daughters are going to love them. I think pearls well. are timeless. Yeah. And I think that they never go out of fashion. 38, 37 of these, well done. 21st birthday present, oops. 21st birthday present. Wedding jewellery. Bridesmaids. Bridesmaids gifts, mm. yeah. Well, that'd be good because you've got so much um, um, other expenses so you have to buy exactly. the bridesmaids. And gifts. you could wear them on the day, couldn't yeah. you? And keep them, that would be lovely, yeah. that's what I did. Yeah. 25 left, keep going through. Barbara Lynette, well done. <coughs> Oh dear, my voice is definitely going now. In the next break, could you get me some hot water in there again, please? Uh, not till the next break, though. 14, 99, 22 left. Gorgeous. 20 left, 20 left, 20 left. That says Mirtha Tidville, that says. Yeah. Beautiful. It's in <laughs> Wales. It's not in the Cotswolds. 
We're working. It's in Oxford, isn't it, Midsummer Murders? I think so. Yeah. Mm. Seven left. One more look at the Morganite that's coming up in five minutes' time. I wonder where I put it then. There you go. Beautiful. Are we? A B O oh, bumblebee. Oh, he said funny. it's a B class. I thought I've never heard of a B class before. It's a bumblebee. I love. Right. Is that how you open it and close it then? Mm. Is it a toggle clasp? It looks like it. It's a ninety-five B class bracelet, seven inches. That's lovely. Oh yeah, it's just like a tea bar. Mm. But just for, oh, that's gorgeous. I'll put it back on there because it looks best on there. Look, there it is. There's a lot of silver in that. It's lovely. I've twisted it on the stand, but there you go. You can get the idea. Four point three grams of sterling silver. Ninety-five sterling silver. It's cute, isn't it? Seven inches. Straight down. Straight down. Watch this. This make a lovely present. My friend would love this. Would she? Yeah, she likes all bee things. Oh, it's only 19.99. That's very good. Get one for her birthday. Yeah. Mm. Gorgeous. Key going through for that. Dawn, Carol, Barbara, Heather, Nancy, Olivia, Tracy, Ingrid. 19.99. Beautiful. Look at the link as well. What link is that? Ben, Tom. What's the link? Curb. Is it a curb chain? Is it? Yeah, and there's, it looks like there's room to add as well, so that you could add sort of gemstones around if you wanted to turn it into sort well, of... Well, like a, a charm. Yeah, so like you could add... And I'm going to say pearls again, but yeah. you could add pearls, like emeralds, if you've got the emeralds around. Morganite. Morganite. Oh. Or if you've got that hematite stars and hearts. Oh, yes, that would be beautiful. It's a curb chain. Thank you, Ben Tump. You've got there eventually. I could have been wrong. You could have been, but Ben Tump, we could have blamed Ben Tump. <laughs> I could have been wrong last night. <laughs> Keep going through for that. I'm just going to take a slurp of my drink. Four chances left. I'm not going to get one. I'm no, I don't think so. They're lovely. They're gorgeous. So cute, isn't it? Mm. And again, very youthful or for the young of heart. Three left. Three left. Now, I've got people who want multiples of these. You're going to have to be careful. <clears throat> well done. Three left. Keep going through. Next. Do what? Got a chain deal going on here. Oh, yeah, all three. Three different chains, look. They're separate. They aren't. You've got a box, a cur. Oh, what? Curb and rope. Got all three of those. Lovely if you layer them up or keep them individual, really. That's amazing. So they're 20 inches? Yeah, 20 inches. Wow. Yeah, all them 20 inches. Look, curb, rope, and box. 29.99, 10 pounds a chain, that's, that's good. Very good indeed. And they've also got a lovely clasp at the back. However, it's not your price. Don't you dare put another clock in. Oh, okay, we're gonna add look online. Not a direct, not a direct comparison. Box chain, 20 inches. Where is it, I can't see it. Where's the price? Of oh yeah, they're 25. I was too busy trying to look underneath our graphics, that's what it was. Sorry about that. Uh, hang on, 20, you're getting all three for $29.99. <clears throat> oh, 30 second clock. Yeah, go on. Well, it's a brilliant deal, this, because already at £10 each, that's fantastic, isn't very, it? Very, very good. I don't know any way you could get them for that. Not decent ones. No. Well done, everyone. Lots of people coming through now. So it works out at the moment at £10 a chain, and you are not going to pay £10 a chain. 
And you're always going to need these because, you know, whatever pendants that you're making, you need chains. Yeah. And people like their precious metal chains, especially with allergies or it just... Totally. It gives you sort of more kudos again for as being a designer if you've got that. Yeah, nothing worse than a green neck, is there? Mm -hmm. Right. Wow. <laughs> Excellent. So that's six pounds something each, that's isn't it? That's so good. Six sixty-six, <gasps> is it? Wow. It is. Well done, everyone who's checked out already. Nineteen ninety-nine, but I've only got thirty of these left. That's a proper good deal. Really isn't it? good, yeah. Really, really good price, though. Now I can see people sitting within their baskets. Don't understand why you're leaving it in your basket. Make sure you go through. Irene, Christine, Rowena, Janet, Barbara. Uh, Gabriella, well done, lots of you coming in now. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Slow down now, slow down now. <laughs> <laughs> you get all three chains for 19.99. I know. Curb or open box, you can always need chains, don't you? I used to get to like a week before a craft fair and then think, oh, I haven't got enough chains. Oh, no. And then you're trying, you know, and if you buy quickly, you don't always get the deals. No, so then no, you've just got to buy them. Um, also, just think how much you'd pay for a 20-inch chain. Well, you've seen one, haven't you? How much was it? £25. And that's good. One. That's good. Yeah, and that's a good price, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Six left now. Oh, but there's more than six people on the phone lines. Yeah, buy that one chain for £25 and you've got all these left over. Look. People multi-buying. Not surprised. Five, four. Oh, no. Now, somebody's put three in their basket. If they check out, she'll clear us out. We'll soon see. We'll soon see. Oh, I was waiting to see if Maker... Maker, go through. Oh, there's only three left, Maker. Oh, you won't get them now. You won't get them now. Well done. Right, is this a star buy? Right, Nigerian Morganite, 100% natural, beautiful. I love a Morganite. Oh, so do I. Beautiful gemstone. Right, starting price is £98.99. pence. We're not going to be anywhere near there. 15 carats, rondelle faceted, 2 to 4 millimetres, a 10 centimetre strand. It's beautiful, isn't it? I think it's 100% natural, Mother Nature at her best, isn't it? Yeah, 15 carats in total here. Oh, Kinga, you're a darling. Thank you. Where are you going, Ben Tom? Okay, go on then. Totally and utterly natural. Right, under £50. Pounds. So that's the same price as the uh, Colombian Emerald. Can't unbelievable. And this is Nigerian, 100% natural, beautiful morganite. Where would you use this then? Do you know morganite is one of those rare gemstones that seems to go with anything you put it with. So oh, totally. It's sort of any metal colour. Yeah. So, you know, the copper, the antique gold, the rose gold, the silver freshens it up, or you can even go yellow gold. So yeah. I just think the versatility of it and the subtleness of the pink. I mean, it, as usual, the lights are washing it out, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, yeah, in like, real life. I'm oh, looking yeah. in the monitor and then I'm looking at it in real life. Yeah. If you like it on screen, you'll love it when you get it home. Oh, yeah, it's from the Aquarine family. Oh, here you go. Right, hang on. This is a 95 sterling silver Aquarine fasted rondelle with kunzite. But hang on, there's only about four or five kunzites in there. 12, 61, yeah. 61 pounds, only one available. Not a direct comparison. What? Beautiful, isn't it? Oh no, totem. This goes with every skin tone, this one. Even my old hairy skin. <laughs> <laughs> uh, use five as spacers in the front of a beautiful pearl necklace. Stunning, yeah. says Marco. See, it's not just me with the pearls. Yep. Yeah. 
You know, if you can afford gemstones like this and you can afford pearls, you've got to put them together. Oh, yeah. And you can here. Yeah. Oh, I'll tell you what these would look lovely with. If you got the jade eye earlier, because whoever made this, our in-house designer, made it with pink yeah. threads, didn't they? Mm. I don't know what you call the thread that goes to it. Yeah, it's just like um, silk cord yeah. that's knotted. But imagine those. In <gasps> uh, let me put it in the shot, right? Look, those and those together. Yeah, it'd be stunning. Beautiful, wouldn't they? $24.99. Just I didn't even see the crash happen. $24.99. No. Loads of you there. <clears throat> oh. Now Ollie would put it with Tanzanite. That he would call it the Tiffany collection. Very bougie. Mm. You all use this word bougie. I don't know what it means. What does posh, bougie mean? Like, posh. You know. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah. Is Ollie posh then? Apparently. Oh, Tom used it. That's what I thought was. That was Oh, there's loads of you there. 20 people got it in their baskets. No. Well, Ben Tom, you're the boss. That is a scary thought. <laughs> ben Tom is the boss. While we're waiting. Oh, yeah. Why do you call him Ben Tom? Oh, when we first came to work at Rocks and Co. Yeah. People. <laughs> he said, I thought his name was Ben. Oh. And I kept saying, is Ben in today? Is Ben coming in? They're like, who? I said, you know Ben? They went, his name's Tom. So he became Ben, ben Tom. Tom. And then oh. It's like Munch, like Liam. Yeah, yeah. Munch stage. And of course, now they've moved on to higher ranking roles. And they've been <laughs> Where's Ben Tom? Where's Munch? <laughs> well, oh, 1999. Wow, that's good. Hey, that isn't that good. fantastic? Yeah. Nineteen ninety nine. He used to make me lemon tea all the time, didn't he? In those days, oh, years ago now, wasn't it, Ben Tom? Christina, Wendy, Marilyn, Pauline, Joe, Karen, Stephanie, Beatrice, Marilyn. Well done. Is there someone left the door open? She's. I'll have to have a word with you. <laughs> At nineteen ninety-nine. <laughs> it's Angelina. Oh no ah on the end. Oh. Nineteen oh thanks. Nineteen ninety-nine. Gorgeous, keep going through for that. Next. Have I seen what? Oh, oh I love Larry. Got them in two different colours. Essence of Gucci, these, Ben Tom saying. You could stamp a name on there. You could so personalise those. Oh, yes. Couldn't you? Now, £1,850 available. <laughs> she doesn't look very happy about wearing the it. The thing is, high-end models don't do smiling. Oh, do okay. Sorry, I'll just take that step. Sorry. There you go. Oh, that's. Which one? Still the first. Ninety-five sterling silver. Lar so, what does lariat mean then? It's where you drop one side of the chain through the middle rather than have a clasp. So does that move? It should do, if it's a lariat. Oh, no, I'll tell you what. She... Oh, is this one? Oh, lariat inspired. So this one's actually soldered to look like yeah, a lariat. Yeah, I thought Kinger had made another mistake. So, so it will sit like that. That's yeah. very designer. No, that's better that way, because then it's not swinging it's all not over. It's not swinging place, around. It, that's yeah. very designer. Uh, definitely personalise that. Yeah. £1,850, okay. please, Ben Tom. I like that ingot at the bottom there. That gives it a lovely bit of weight, doesn't it? Mm. Here we go. People in already. Twelve ninety nine. That's amazing. I don't mean to laugh. It's ninety five sterling silver. Now the picture's slightly different to mine. Yeah, Kinger. 
like that. Yeah, that's how it goes. That's what I thought. There you go. But you could wear it the other way. Oh, you could. You I quite liked it. it like that as well. Well, now that way it looks like it's really a lariat when it yeah. looks like that way, doesn't it? Yours is fixed here, so it's not going to be moving up and down. I think that's the what that's the length it's going to be. What I do is just, you know, if you want to personalise it, put a date or a heart or a name, and you do stamping. You can stamp. Oh it. wow! Personalize. It's also got what it doesn't mention here. Isn't that an extender bit at the back there? Yeah, extender. It's got the extender at the back as well. Twelve ninety nine. Twelve ninety nine. That's an amazing piece. That's fantastic. A lovely it? piece of jewellery. Well, uh, sometimes less is more, isn't it? Just sophistication, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Yeah. I like the idea that you can personalise it if you want to, though. So if you had ten of these, and then you took your st your metal stamps to a craft fair, and you said, "What name do you want? What date do you want?" Maybe you've got like a little number that you want on the yeah. back. It's just your personal, oh. you know, or a word, hope, yeah. love. Th then you can really take it a step further. Oh, twelve ninety nine. Keep going through for that though. Keep going through. <coughs> Flying, ready for that gold version. Five minutes away from a masterclass. Dun, dun, dun. It's tube setting. It is I've never tube heard setting. of tube set. There it is. You see, to me, that I just call that bezel, but it's a different type of bezel, it's, is it? No, it is bezel setting. It's what? It's bezel setting, but you do it when you're on the tube. That's what All it right. is. <laughs> First time I've ever had the rose gold on the gold before. And I've not seen these mounts before. They're really lovely. Right, gold version. Now, is this gold-plated 95 sterling silver? It is. Now, how she sent this one to us? I love the gold. No. <laughs> <laughs> we'll have to give her some lessons, won't we, in jewellery. There you go. Okay, yeah. Kinga. Hinger. <laughs> yeah, Ben Tom knows this, you see. If I don't mention your name at all, right? <laughs> if, if, you don't, if you're not mentioned at all, it means I don't like you. If, you, if I throw insults at you, it means I love you and I love you. I think you're brilliant. Twelve ninety nine. <laughs> Twelve ninety nine. Anyway, people coming in already. I'm not surprised at twelve ninety nine. Um, does gold plating not cost a bit more then? Should you not pay more because it's got gold plating? You would on? usually. <laughs> yes. Is it eighteen carat plated? How do you know, Ben Tom? I never knew that. No, I didn't. And how long have you been working here? Years. Yeah. <laughs> twelve ninety nine. Margaret's there. Rachel's there. Oh, now, Margaret, I hope you don't go out the same place as that lady in Cheshire. <laughs> Bump into each other in Headswall or somewhere like that. <coughs> 12 99 It's lovely, isn't it? Right. Right. Before... Well, OK. The kit team was so excited about this yesterday. Now, let me just say that the oh. strands that I've put them on are not in the kits. Right. Um, that's just to give you inspiration. Right, OK. So uh, I've got earrings, mm -hmm. I've got pendants, mm -hmm. and I've got studs. Mm -hmm. And we're going to show you how to do... But do you know what? Can I be really naughty and do something before we go for a break? Yeah. <gasps> because these... The round cut ones of these would be perfect, wouldn't they, for doing that? If you give me a four mil, I'll see if I can get it in the mount. Uh, I'll do it in the break, shall I? Right. No, oh, didn't go to that price. Can you remember the price that we took? 19 carats of peridotia. It was a long time ago. It was 8 o'clock this morning. You can have the whole box in a minute. All right. Ready? If you weren't here at 8 o'clock this morning... First of all, it was half past eight. They're half probably past eight. in bed. Look at the price, nine ninety nine. You get, I know. Okay. You get all of those. You get all of those. Hang on, let me just do this. Wee. Look, 
Look at them, look at them, look at them. Yeah, all of these. Oh, I say, what's that? It's a little scoop. Yeah, all of these. Whoops. Beautiful, look at those. Oh, oh, what are you doing here? Get out. <laughs> it's a nice car, Dee. Oh, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> it's Ben. Oh, it's Ben. <laughs> Everyone's Ben, by the way. This afternoon. Not, not Tom Ben, no. Ben, ben, I normally describe him as Ben with the pink hair, but he's had all the pink cut out. He's got like a gingery, mousy colour now. <laughs> Anyway, aren't they gorgeous for 9 9 tonight? <laughs> right, we're going for a break now. I was too busy. I was watching them on the screen go round and round there. Right, after break, it's about, I'm going to go and have some cough mixture. And tell <laughs> Angeline to not stop making so much noise. Right. We'll see you and you and me after this break, and we're going to be doing some tube setting. We are. We'll see you then. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call centre with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. This coming Monday looks absolutely incredible. Why? Because it's Nugget Day. Join Monica for her nine o'clock kits where it's buy three, get one free. And your deal of the day, oh my word, a strand of Moldavite nuggets. And another huge thing that's happening that day, we are going to be giving away a thousand inches. That's right, a thousand inches of nuggets. You need to head to our Facebook page from eight o'clock on Monday to find out how to enter. But take a look at these. We've got turquoise, we've got carnelian. Oh, so many inches. Look at all of these. There's some Larimar in here. Literally inches for miles. It's gonna be absolutely superb. Nuggets, nuggets, nuggets. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Interactive with Jewelry Maker by texting the studio during our live hours of 8 till 5. Start your message with JM Studio and send it to 78070. Jewelry Maker, create, wear, share. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. 
Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street, and Yarn Lane. Well, I can only say, honestly say I've never seen one of these before, right? Um, so this is for sale. <laughs> and you get these with it. And I've got and his you brother get this. here. Yeah. You get this and you get one of, one of these and you get one of these. And you get these, four of these. And you get some of those and some of those and some of those. Can I ask what it's called? It's a pin vice. A pin vice. That's what I call it. It's... Oh, here you go. It's more than that. Look, watch. Are we bringing the graphics in? Yeah, go on then. Let's just see what they called it. Stone setting engraving engra work holding vice. An engraving block chromed with rotary. It turns. Rotary turntable and peg clamp attachment. So you get all of this, all of this. You're going to see how it works in a minute because obviously I have no idea in the slightest. <gasps> They, they intrigue me though. They, you need this. If you are metal working. Yeah, like you are in your garage. All the time. Yeah. You need this because it keeps your hands free. It holds on to your piece. I'll show you why. Yeah, 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 yeah. I can't work without mine now. So if you, if, if JM didn't sell it, I'd be like, oh, well, how am I supposed to do this? All right. Because if you watch any YouTube metal work video, any professional jeweler, and they'll have a version of this. Oh, wow. Usually more expensive. I'm not sure what this is going to, but no. then, you know. You um, also, to. well, I can show, can we show that? Um, Okay, this is the one that's most similar to ours. Mm -hmm. Three hundred and ninety-six pounds. It's got a, a, a few. It's got a few bits and bobs like ours has. Um, anyway, can I just warn you? When yours arrives, it will come. Uh, what's this? It's like a vase. It has oil on it. Oh, oil. Because any metal tool's worst enemy is rust. Right. So in, we ship this, obviously, because it's, it's cheaper than, than air freight. Oh, I see. You know, yeah, to yeah, keep yeah. the prices yeah, yeah, down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, and, and everywhere it does. I've never, I would expect a good metal work tool to come covered in oil. So all you need to do is take some kitchen roll and wipe it off. If you leave a bit on, that's actually quite good because you need to oil the tool yeah, yeah, here yeah. and there every yeah. six months. Just because rust is the enemy. Never keep your metal working tools in anywhere that's damp. Right. Okay, then. So that that ring comes for it to sit on. Yeah. Well, actually, should we just see how it... Oh, no, we, what we can do first, see how it works or see a price. Bring the price in. How much was that one? £396, right? Not now. Here we go. The suspense is killing me. <laughs> I know. The, the drop here takes forever, doesn't we? had our short next door. Oh, £249.99, that's good. This tool is worth every penny if you've got arthritis. Love yes. mine, says Marco. Yes. There you go. Right, 249 dollars on split pay, four-way split pay. Let's see how it works. This then. is a buy once tool. Right. So you buy it once, you look after it, you won't have to buy it again, in my opinion. Now, what you've got, now this is my one and it's slightly different. This, the one that JM have got today is a more modern and a better version than mine. Well, it's more glossy than it's, yours. Yeah, well, it? this has been well loved. Yeah. This is Peter the Pin Vice. I had oh, Derek no. the Dapping Block, right. sorry. Peter the pin vice, I'm very attached to it. So what you have is the jaws on the top that open and close so that you can hold things in the centre here right. or you can add pins in with difficult setting for support, which I'll show you in a minute with the pendant. It moves around oh. like this so that you can have it facing. But it's heavy, it. isn't it? But it's heavy. So once I move it this way and start doing things here, it's not going to slip. Right. And also you've got your attachment on the side, which mine looks slightly different to the JM one, which opens... Well, only because ours looks posher. I know, yours is posher. Right, so hang on, where Don't are you putting that in, in there? <laughs> That going in you there. put that in there and it opens the vice. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So then you can get your ring, your earrings, which I'll right show there. you in depth in a minute, and then it closes it. So both your hands are now free. Now, oh. if you're using your burr tool to burr out um, 
to set or you're using your tool your handpiece to sand if you're using your handpiece to polish especially gem setting watchmakers use this a lot uh, right. this is absolutely perfect for that um, and as Margot I think it was said if you struggle with any dexterity issues and you're holding things very tightly this saves your hands and if you're a working jeweler like I tend to find if I've been working for a long time my hands start aching so anything oh, yeah. that's gonna set and I broke my finger a couple of years ago as well so anything that saves my hands is invaluable to me yeah okay so let me show you how with this pendant this would be invaluable right so first of all just let me say that it comes with various attachments so that you can add things in lots of different ways what I do is this is just a piece of bead foundation you could get a piece of leather a piece of suede you could get um, felt and I pop that in the middle so that anything that I put in the jaws are not going to get marked by the jaws. So that, uh, that's just a little tip. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, if it doesn't matter and you're going to polish something afterwards, and it doesn't matter about putting that in yeah. there. So what on this particular one, I'm going to close these all the way and I'll tell you why. Because this, and I've already put the gemstone in here, so I need to be careful. When you're setting this, if you're going to start pushing this metal over the gemstone and you haven't got anything to support it, a couple of things could happen. Yeah. You could bend this um, setting. Uh -huh. You could bend the actual pendant itself. You could snap off the setting. So I've popped a pin in here so that when I apply the pressure to this side, I've got the pin in the other side, which is actually supporting it. Whereas if I was trying to do this, say in my ring vise, oh, yes. I'd have to put my hand on that side yes. and support it with my hand. So if I just show you how I would go about setting this particular one, and then you'll see how invaluable it is when we come to the earrings, okay. because how would you do it otherwise? Exactly. And also don't forget, you paid to 3 five post and packaging so if you bought this is heavy this is heavy if you went to the post office with this Vicky the postman just wouldn't say oh yeah that'll be 3.95 John I bought a tool um a couple of weeks ago a heavy duty metal smithing tool that I've been saving up for and it cost me 12 pounds in postage yeah oh yeah it, it's heavy. So you've already paid your PMP haven't you right so I'm there's various ways that you could set this I'm going to use the pusher that we have here um, at JM so it's just the tool with the little square end um, you can have some that are slightly more rounded off or one that's completely flat I like the completely so that's not part of this kit that's a separate tool. this is yeah, a separate tool it. so this is your your pusher now we are going to go around this mount yeah. and we're going to do opposites. So if I start applying pressure here, right. say three o'clock, then I would then have to apply pressure at nine o'clock rather than just going around. Because if I just went around in a circle, I have a risk there of popping the stone out. Mm. Now, we want the reason we want even pressure on this is because if I start pushing on this side and I've got nothing to support this side, then I'm either going to damage my stone and slip, I might bend this, or I might actually weaken this solder joint. So I've popped my pin in there so that when I add pressure across, it's stopped by this pin. And that, <coughs> excuse me, that leaves my finger here to just hold that stone in the top until I've got it in there a little bit. So I've got my pusher here yeah. and I'm just starting gently to just rock um, the metal yes. against the stone like that okay and then I need to go and do just let me get my pliers the opposite side so I'm going to need to move this here take it out and just support it there so once again I've got support holding the stone to just rock my pusher and if I need if I can't see so I'm showing the camera but if I want to see that a little clearer then all I do is move this towards yeah, 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 yeah. me so now it's fa yeah, facing which you would me. do in real life it's just you do in real life yeah. exactly so then what I would do is just continue doing three o'clock nine o'clock and you, you can actually see that the lip of the bezel here is starting to hug that stone now this uh -huh. isn't a process that you want to hurry 
it's a process that you want to take slowly with patience. You might have your stone pop out. It just takes patience. And when you have got something holding your bezel or whatever you're working on in place, it takes away half of the anxiety. So if you didn't have this, how, if today you were at home and you hadn't bought one of these, how would you be, do, how would you be doing it at home? The other way that you could do this is, um, you know, a ring vise, the wooden ring vise. Yeah, 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 yeah. Put it in the wooden ring vise. But then you need this hand to hold the stone. So you'd probably need a vice on your desk. Oh, yeah. Put the ring vice, and then you'd have to hold something on this side of the stone, just in the case of this pen. Oh, so it's really, really... So really difficult. Yeah. Whereas with this, I can just work around my pendant, um, changing my pins out. So this is just one sort of pin oh, that I've got. Yeah. But you can also get... Oh, that's what all these different that's varieties what for. are for. This then. one has got sort of um, a rubber coating on it. Right. So depending on what you're using and what space you need to fill and where, what angle you need it to be right. on what peg you would use. But you need to also remember that you can turn this. So you can turn it and set it. We only got three of these tools left. Oh, she jumped in, yeah. Three oh, sorry. Left, no, I was that's, surprised. That's perfectly right. Three of these left, right? But there is set one, two. Oh, now, Janice, I think you might have. Uh, Janice, I think you might have ordered a few too many there. Oh, that's no, gone down now. Um, please be careful. Please be careful, because only three left. I can see one, two, three, four, five, six, seven people have now got it in their basket. Take advantage of the split pay as well. Now, but there's only three left. There's only three left. If you're Think if you're on the fence about this, yeah, let me show you something. Can we go close up on that? Oh, you on, tell me God. how you think you would set that without bending. How would you set that without bending the post? B what, bending the shepherd's hook? Um, yeah, and how you would set that without putting pressure on the solder joint without this tool. Put it in the post and I'd send it to you. Would <laughs> you put this gemstone in here for me? And I'd say, of course I yeah. would. So let me show you, shall I okay. show you? <laughs> I'm a bit passionate about this tool because I, can I, could, tell. I couldn't live without it. Yeah. Um, but I bet it was one of those, when, you've, when you saw it first, you went, oh, I don't need one of those. And then as soon as you got it, you're like, oh, how have well, I done all these years You think it? to yourself sometimes, especially when you've got a family, oh, that's a considered purchase. Yeah. But when it's your work, there's mm -hmm. 11 in baskets. If you want it, we've got two and left. Two if left. you want it, get it now or you're going to be disappointed. Well, I'm going to quickly show you in case yeah. um, how important this is, in my opinion. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm getting stressed now. <laughs> I don't want you to miss out. OK, right. So in the case of an earring, this is why I have put this in. Right. And what now, did you say that was called? This is just beading foundation. Okay. So a bit like suede. Yeah. Because I'm going to put... Why am I taking my glasses off? Don't know. Um, so I can see you. I need different glasses. Oh, no. I'm going to pop in my earring finding. Now I need it to be protected here. Now usually I'd have my head over the top, so bear with me. Yeah. And then I'm going to close, close the jaws, it. right? Now it's going to take a little bit of maneuvering because what I want is for my earring, and I'll tell you after I've done it. Sorry for my fingers. No, 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 that's fine to be sitting, I don't know if you can go any closer on that, Ollie, for me. Oh, here, I'll take it. Oh. Let me take it right for, right. What I want it to be doing is to be sitting half on here and half on here, because when I start to set this, I don't want to disturb my wire and I don't want to disturb this solder joint. Right. Okay. And if you you might be thinking, oh, well, I'll just set the gemstone before I solder on the ear wire. But you, a lot of gemstones can't have heat added to them. Right. So I would always, if I can, set the gemstone. Oh, have we got any left? <laughs> set the set the gemstone after you've soldered. Okay. So <clears throat> take a moment to just make sure, and I'm gonna. Take a minute now, pretend that I'm in my studio at home and I'm not on telly. Right. To get this exactly where I want it. So I'm pressing this down and then I'm going to tighten that up. Now I've got this in here so that however tight I go, I'm not going to mark my wire because it's protected. 
once you get this tool, yeah. if they're all the, the little accessories that you get with it, if you want something different, you can buy them separately. Yeah, but you get loads of accessories here. I, I was just thinking you get triangular ones, you get ones that are like hammerheads, you look at ones that have got ridges on them. So sort of anything, if you were making um, a metal box and you wanted to hold while you're making hinges, you've got ones with little indentations to make yeah. hinges. Um, anything that you can think of, any join that you can think of um, in metal that you might need to hold, you can hold with this. Yeah. Now, I'll show you how this is important. Like one of the ones in mine... Only, can, can, sorry to interrupt, there's only one left okay. and there's 12 in baskets. Oh. <laughs> okay, one left and 12 in baskets. So, yeah. right. So this is a pin that you can pop in here, but I'm going to use it for a different purpose because... I've got these in the, this in the vise, so I can't move it around like I did with the pendant so that I've got support on each side. I can't do that. And if I put a pin in there, well, that's fine for if I want to do it that way, but what about when I want to push it that way? Yeah. So I came up with this idea of holding with my hand this pin instead of popping it in. Right. And then pushing against that it. way against it so that I've actually got the support here so that I can push, obviously there's not a gemstone in here, and push against it. And then when I need to, I don't have to turn my position. I turn my vice yeah. and then I hold again and push against it. So that what I'm doing is supporting this side whilst I'm applying pressure on this side. And if you've set a gemstone before, you know that you really do have to apply quite a bit of pressure at the end when you mm -hmm. start to push over the top <coughs> of the gemstone. And if I didn't have that, and I just pushed here, I'm either gonna completely bend this ear wire out oh, yeah, of shape, definitely. aren't I? Or I'm gonna just knock that over there. And you don't want to be doing that. Also, if you notice, I've got both of my hands free here to yes. fiddle about. Mm. And that is invaluable for stone setting. Now, I first saw this tool um, with a watchmaker that I follow on YouTube. So I know this sounds weird, but I kind of like watching things like that. I find them relaxing. <laughs> Dealing with tiny, small parts. And I saw this vice and I thought, I need one of those because there's so many things that I could do. Yeah. So, shall we pop a gemstone in here? Did you, did you want to bring any of the kits or do you want me to carry on? What do you want to do? Right. Okay, so I tell you what I'm going to do. Yeah. I'm going to pop in a gemstone, mm -hmm. and the way that I do this usually is my good old friend, uh, the, the blue tack. Uh, what shall I put in? Let's put a green one. Oh, sorry, I didn't say anything. You could see me. I'm busy cleaning the table there. Oh, don't make me laugh. I'm like carrying on, like I'm listening, but I was thinking, I'll just get this off because I want this. Let's do it. Anyway, there you go. Oh, you can come to my house anytime oh, you I want love if clean. you like that. Oh, okay. Right. So I'm popping that in there. <laughs> right, there are 13 in baskets and one left. What did you put it in with? Oh, that's the blue, blue tack. tack. The blue tack, yeah. So there, I've got my lovely Peridot set in there. Oh, where oh, did by you get the that way, from? <laughs> oh, they're here. <laughs> if, funnily enough, they're over here. Yeah. Um, I, I checked for you, and the four mil Peridots fit in these because I know that we've got some studs coming yeah. that you can choose your gemstones for. Oh. So if you've already got, have you got any of the Peridot left? Because Yeah, there's a few Peridot Oh, okay. Left. So yeah. yeah, look at those. Sorry, exciting. Right. right. So um, am I on fire? It's because I'm excited about this tool. I really need to get out more, don't I? Right. Oh, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Keep going. <laughs> okay, get this. They've gone. <laughs> 20 people have got them in the baskets. So what I'm going to do is push. So I'm pushing. Right, those. right. Can I just say, right, Ben Tom is on the phone now to the, bu is it the buying team you're on the phone to? On the phone to the buying team. It's difficult because it's the weekend. They know, we know we've got this machine for the birthday, or they've got this machine for the birthday right. show. Right. So we're going to try and extract some from the birthday show to bring them onto this show. We'll carry on with the demo. No, no, no there's 12 people still got it in their and baskets, you see. I, I mean, I don't know if... So, I'm sure somebody else suggested this as well, but a while ago they asked us for tool suggestions and I suggested this tool. Oh, there I'm you that, go. I'm that passionate about it. And also, selfishly, I wanted to use it when I had shows because I was like, how am I going to demo it without, my, without Peter? Oh, yes, of course. <laughs> 
I need to bring Peter with me. While we're just trying to get the uh, more of those, I'll just put the peridots back in here. And take a look at them. Look at the price. So I did. Oh, oh, okay. Georgia's going to give Yay, us Yay, thank you, Georgia. Oh, it might take a while, but we're going to try... Did you say she's going to give us five from the birthday? She's only going to give us five from the birthday and 13 people got it in their baskets. Not this, not this, but the tool. But while, you, while you're waiting, buy these, because these are gorgeous. So I did put one to see if it went. Hold on, it won't have stayed in. Okay, one thing at a time. I'm going to put a peridot into the earring so you can see what the peridot looks like. Right. Um, so let me just... I did pop it in earlier because I wanted are you to be doing the, to... Are you doing the um, stud or the shepherd's hook? I'm one? doing the shepherd's hook one just so that you guys who've got the peridot can see. Yeah. So let me hold it on the overhead. Yeah. This oh, is yeah. the kit we're going to bring shortly. You just, you just saw Deb's using. So it's a shepherd's hook crook. Rose gold, gold and silver. Right, ignore those for a minute because you get all of those. No, that, ignore that graphic at the moment. Ignore that graphic. So you get the rose gold and the golden you. We've always had them in silver. But you also get these as well. Amethyst, petalite, peridot and rose de France amethyst. The in rose there. de France is beautiful. They're gorgeous. Three or four minutes with that. We'll carry on with the carry on with the demo so, till we till we till Georgia's um, got the five into the system. For so us. this is the peridot that came in with the kit, and just to prove that I'm not just saying that, this is a peridot that came out of that amazing bundle. Oh right, the nine ninety nine one. The nine ninety nine. That fits in there, and it fits in the stud one, and it will fit in the pendant one as <clears> well. So um, yeah, I just wanted you to know that. Yeah, 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 brilliant. Because I think sometimes I, I need to make sure that. I'm saying the right thing to you. And it, yeah, you know. yeah, yeah. Okay, so you can, you know, so I think everyone understands what I'm trying to say here, that how would you set that yeah, otherwise? Yeah, without it. Now, yes. you have got lots of other... Can I have a look at what accessories your one has got? Yeah, of course you can. Do you want them over there? Oh, yours is better than mine. <laughs> <laughs> Are we sorted? Oh, we've got more. Them. We've got them, guys. There's five more. Quickly. There we go. Brilliant. Thank you, Thank Georgia. You, Georgia. Right, there's still 13 people got them in baskets. I don't like it when people, you know, I've told people that's something and then they can't get it. Yeah, no, no, no. There's so many of you got in your basket. Please make sure you go through. There's only five more, though, and there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen in baskets. Thirteen in baskets. <coughs> there's five more. Use the, yeah. use the split peg. Use the split peg. Right. Right, so I just want to talk about some of the actual pegs that come with your yeah, one. Yeah. Um, your one is better and yeah, than mine. <laughs> but it does the same job. Yeah. So this one here, if you have a look, it's got the groove. So if you had the tube and um, you wanted to set it in there, you've got this recess. Um, let me see all oh, yours. You've but got... you don't just get one of those. Oh, no, no. You get and several you get, of them. So sort of anything that you need to hold that you think, how am I going to work that? There'll be a peg that will hold it. I'm sure it comes with the instructions manual as well. And lots and lots of videos yeah. um, online about... You know, but what, it's, it's trial and error. Like, I know that I need something to support my earring here. So I put a peg in and I think, oh, no, that one's too large. Or, like, these that have the covers on, the sort of plastic cover. Yeah. Again, this is protecting your work. If you push this against your metal block, you're going to mark your metal. Yeah, that's not always the end of the world because you can take it out with your polishing mops. But do you really want to spend extra time cleaning your jewelry yeah, up if yeah. you can possibly avoid it so i'm that pink one is is the version of my black one here right. that fits in so again i can't use that one because it's too large on this particular piece of jewelry but there will be something i've got a smaller one here that i can pop in now that's perfect yeah so now i can take my pusher which i've lost now in my excitement oh there it is um i'm going to turn it around to a comfortable place for me and i can comfortably push my push at all. So I'm just gently rocking. There's, I know you've seen lots and lots of, um, of setting videos and we've got lots on our YouTube as well. But the thing is, if I didn't have this here and I push that, look at that move, I'll do it gently. That's just going to move. Oh yeah, oh, you're going to wreck the whole thing, aren't you? If you put your finger there, again, that's Ooh. not doing it, is it? No, I mean, and also you could hurt your finger. You could hurt your finger and you haven't got that support. And I'm not moving my, my making position now. I'm moving this and a 360, and I can turn it 
towards me, yeah. away from me. And then if I need to set something else, I can, I can do that. So this was the shepherd hook earring, and yeah. this is how I would set the shepherd hook. And then I'll show you in the next demo how I would work with it with the studs. Right. So do you want to bring a kit? Can yeah, you use you can. the pegs as a wire shape? Of course you can. This is a tool that you can do so many things with. Mm -hmm. So you can pop your pegs in any configuration that you wish. And then, of course, you could. And because you've got this hard surface as well, you could even sort of bash them down. All right, what's that? That is, um, I've no idea. <laughs> Because um, your tool's different to mine. Oh, OK. Yours does more things than mine. Oh, all right. What's that, then? Is it the side? Well, you said there's goes... four of them, Ollie. Look, this yeah. goes in here, look, like yeah. this. Oh, yeah. And then there's another, yeah, there's another yeah. one. So that you might want to hold um, metal in there to do oh, something. Yeah. You might want to hold, you know, any shape of metal that you can think of there'll be something that will help you to hold it to work on it so your hands are free these were originally uh, manufactured for watchmakers and you think right. how tiny those oh yes and yes, yeah. stone professional stone setters you know that have the microscope over the yeah top. yeah i was gonna say because you have to keep those so still so still um it just takes the struggle. So many people say to me about soldering, oh, I'm scared of the torch. And a lot of people won't gem set because they are just like, oh, I don't, what, how do you hold it? I'm going to yeah, lose yeah, yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. This takes the stress out of it. It makes your life easier. If you're planning on setting a lot of stones, even just for your own enjoyment, you need this. Buy it once, look after it. Yeah. It's a one time purchase. Definitely. And then tell us what these are for. Mm, I'll tell you if I have a look. No, 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 no. That's the thing that winds it up and down, Ben Tom. Look, this, that's this. Mm. So, obviously, the JM one is a step up from mine. Yeah, it's got loads. You've got four of these. And do you know what else you get in the JM one? Is yeah. this to hold all of your little mandrels. So you can have them, uh, you know, they go in here. So all the desk. little bits you get, they all store So there. you're not going to lose. Hang on, just show they don't know. And afraid. you're going to be able to see. So you might think, well, what's going to help me to do this? <laughs> They look nice in there, though, don't they? That, they must oh. be so that you can... Oh, actually, they don't fit into mine, but I bet I know what they do. What, 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 what? Are they so that you can hold things on them and move it around? On where? On the top. Does it fit in? Oh, uh, what, into the side? Does look... this come off? Because they do. I don't know. Is no, well, if you've got one of these, can you let us know what these are for? Because that opens Because I might need it? this one instead of mine. <laughs> So you've got, yeah, message. Uh, the spindles can make a trivet. Oh, right. Oh. So the spindles can make a trivet, which means a trivet is this. Oh, trivet is something you put your saucepans on, isn't it? Yeah, so that you can hold things. Oh, so again, okay. um, I've got a trivet, but my trivet is actually... Slightly different. ...is soldered together. I thought right. it was something to do that. So oh, funny. Oh. Yeah. So it'll be in your instructions book. It'll sorry, be I'm some. Sorry. Oh, hold on a minute though. Is oh. it to just hold this on the top of there? Oh, is it? Possibly. It's just to hold something. This tool is all about holding things yeah. while you work on them. Are you with me? Yeah, I'm intrigued. John looks perplexed. No, I'm not perplexed. I'm okay. I, I always learn something new every time I come here. Um, Peter. I just think it's brilliant. I just think they're fantastic. What are they? Are they just little? What are those for? Well, there, the then? little pegs. Little pegs. These oh, you got pegs. lots of those actually. Yeah, these are the little pegs that I was using with the pendant. Oh, okay. To support because sometimes, you know, when you're soldering, and sometimes if you need to hold things together, you might use um, steel wire. Yeah. Or you might, if you're using a honeycomb soldering block, you might use pins. Yeah. Think of it that way, but you're not soldering. So you're holding. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Sorry, I'm going on. Bring no, no, you're not going on at all. It's fascinating. <laughs> it's absolutely fascinating. And also, it is a masterclass. That's what we're here to find out. I'm very it? passionate about my tools. So if someone tells me I can bring a tool, and because I know that you're going to get this tool and go, Deb, how did I live without it? Yeah. Um, because I can't live without mine. And maybe I'm just sad, but... No, 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 <laughs> not at all. I can understand, though. And also, I don't want to be rude, but the older we get, I'm not calling you no. old, but like... <laughs> I get a little I know, bit I'm laughing because my son said to me yesterday, Mum, at your time of life, 
Oh, did you just slap him? I'm not being funny, Mum. I'm not like, being funny, Mum, but at your time of life. Yeah, thanks. So, you know, I need it to be easier. I set a lot of stones, and since I've been privileged enough to do the metal, some of the metal shows here at JM, I'm constantly at my bench. Yeah. And I use Peter every single day. I think they're brilliant. 214. Oh, now, now, now. <gasps> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Still 13 in baskets. How many have we got? How many are left, Ben Tom? Oh, we've got two. Okay, we've only got two left of the ones that Georgia gave to us. Well done. Well done. Let's do the kit. Let okay, me move that We'll always come back to that in a minute. <laughs> okay. Oh, hang on. I'm, I'm just stuck to you. Is that magnet? No, there you go. There we go. Right, kits. Shall we do the Shepherd's Up Crook kit first? Yeah, I've shown you. I've already one. shown you that one, haven't we? I'll show you the so, other one. So, what you get in here is you get two silver, which you might have seen before, two yellow gold and two rose gold plated, which you've never seen before, and then eight gemstones in there. Amethyst, you've got Rose de France, Amethyst, you've got Peridot, and you've got... What was the, what the clear... Petalite, 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 that was it. Have them all, it is called. Have them all. They're four mil rounds. We've only ever been able to do this in silver before. Now I've got it in rose gold and yellow gold and the gemstones. Um, sorry, I just wanted to no, say... No, <laughs> um, I looked into buying these mounts on their own because I had a design idea. And for usually what it costs to buy the mounts, um, I can't make it for that. So it's why I sometimes buy my, my mounts rather than make them. And do you know how much more expensive gold-plated and rose gold-plated mounts are? Yeah. So for us to be able to, I mean, I don't know what this kit's going to, but for us to be able to bring them in a kit is amazing. I mean, I hope I'm not saying this and then they're going to be really expensive. No, I've got like, but jewelry, I don't, maker, jewelry maker price. Yeah. Yeah. Have them all, gold, rose gold and silver. Uh, eight, one, two, three, four, five, eight gemstones. Forty-nine ninety-nine. Forty-nine ninety-nine. Well, you make three pairs of earrings. Out. Well, actually, you've got too many gemstones. Yeah, you get two extra. Yes, yeah, so you've got two extra gemstones. So you make three pairs of earrings. How much can you sell those for? Forty-nine ninety-nine each. Don't you think? Well, oh look. What? 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 Oh well, yeah, exactly. These are rings, not earrings. Yes, they are. Seventy pounds. Also, they've not got on those machines. Look, that green one's a bit wobbly. That one in the middle's not very neat. No. Oh. <laughs> well, sorry, whoever you are that made those. Fair play. £70. Oh! What, you mean that's just the mount? Oh, what? So that's just the mount. Then, right, OK, then. So, hang on. Have they got peridot? Have they got peridot there? No. Amethyst, there's amethyst. And you look, but the, the aquamine's 52. So you add 52 pounds for the gemstone. I can't see peridot. Well, he says he can see peridot. Look at that aquamine. Oh, there it is. The aquamine's 52. The Swiss blue topaz is 23. This is for one gemstone. One gemstone. That's ridiculous. Okay. This is. Oh, here is we this, go. Okay. <sighs> no, it is that. Well, no, it isn't, because that's if you don't know about this. If you don't know about this, then you'd paint that, wouldn't you? And these gemstones fit really beautifully into the mounts. Um, sometimes you've got to do a bit of work on, because, you know, pre-made settings have their own challenges, but these went in a dream. Oh. Well, my ones did. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, there's a fingerprint on there, sorry. <laughs> oh, I've ruined. ruined it. Ruined. Uh, 30 seconds, we are going to go and make yourself, get yourself on the phone line. That's the Rose de France, aren't they lovely? Gorgeous colour for Rose de France, because normally you think of Rose de France a bit washed out, but, but then the amethysts are beautiful as well, aren't they? And the peridots in there again are gorgeous. Look at that, I thought I'd pretend they were diamonds. <laughs> <laughs> uh, some people prefer a better light. Also, the other thing is, if they were diamonds, the whole time you were out partying, you'd be like, there's my earrings still in, there's my exactly. earrings still in. Where's who knows? No yeah. one knows, do no. they? Message, the earrings can be made into a ring. I'm sure there is enough silver. Oh. Yeah, they can be. Hmm? Uh, it would be one of those skinny stacking rings that I love. Look. 24 .99. Yeah. 
So you get rose gold, which we've never had before, gold plated, yellow gold plated, which we've never had before, silver that we have had before, and your eight gemstones. That is amazing. You could sell one pair of earrings for that and it would be cheap. Yeah. And then you've got all the rest is profit. I just stamped my foot on live television in excitement. Did you? Stamped it? Good job I've got trainers on. Yeah, she's got a trainer, so she's not going to open I did so not know that was going to be... I thought you were going to say maybe thirty-four ninety-nine. No, loads you there on the brilliant. phone lines. <clears throat> Keep going through. Gorgeous. He can make three pairs of shepherd's hook crook mm -hmm. dangly earrings with the gemstones, mm -hmm. with the 95 sterling silver tube set drops. So you get two peridot, two petalite, two amethyst and two rose de France. Keep going through. Well done. Lots of you joining the queue now. Oh. How much is it a pair? Eight pounds. 33. That includes the gemstone. You could hardly buy a gemstone on that last website we saw for that much anyway, could you? So that's £8.33 for a pair of, of earrings. And those Rose de France are such a beautiful lilac mm. colour. That's why I put them in the silver, because I wanted you to be able to see... Pop, that, yeah. Yeah, that lovely pop. So, but if you, if you make, so how much are they to make each day? £8 something, right? £8 um. to... <laughs> They're winding me up now because he's going, Debbie, Debbie, look, there's a clock. Are you really going to go cheaper than that? Oh, that's amazing. I'm lost. He's going cheaper. It's ridiculous. I might stamp the other foot. What? <laughs> I might stamp the other foot. Yeah, yeah. Or you might get your phone out. <laughs> oh, my God. It is. That's a really good point. Ollie just said it's the difference between a jewellery maker and a jeweller. And these are the tools that jewellers have. £20! Six sixty-six each now. That is amazing. I can't even. I mean, wow. I know. Well done, everyone. Don't leave it in your basket. You could miss out. Oh, loads of you. Oh, it's gone crazy. Have loads of you coming through now. Congratulations. The app is very, the app and the website are very, very busy today. Oh, you're going to love these when you get them home. You really are. I'm so excited. Just, and they're going to look so expensive when you're wearing them as well, aren't they? I'm going to need to lie down after this. <laughs> <laughs> We'll be all right. You've only got 20 minutes to go. Look at everyone coming in. Pamela, Lisa, Debbie, Karen. 19.99. I mean, just for these, like forget about the, the gold plated, you know, mounts. Just for these gemstones, four mil gemstones. And you get eight of them. Like They'll if you bought those overs. separately somewhere else. Yeah. And I know, I've been looking lately and I know. So that's... No, oh. oh, trying to escape. You've never seen the rose gold ones before. You've never seen the yellow gold plated ones before. We've only had them in silver. So the two are brand new today. $19.99. I know, the queue on the phone lines. Lucy, Noala, Elaine, Lisa, Rachel. Well, that one wants to go, Look, doesn't it? Behave now. There you go. Guys, you I'm talking to the findings. In the 80s. It's all like, whoa. They're lovely, aren't they? I mean, they, they're very elegant. Like, yeah. Some people don't like a drop, but these are like an elegant drop. Yeah, definitely. You've just got that piece of metal and then the lovely gemstone at the end. Also, a lot of people don't like a, a butterfly on the back of their ear, do they? We don't no. need that with this. 19.99. Whoa, look at you all. Well, there's how many left, did you say? 30 left. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, but there's loads of people on the queue. And if you bought the tool, I don't know if we've got any of those left. We've got two left. If you bought the tool, then now you know how to set the gemstone. Yeah. And if you need any more help, just find me, guest designer Debbie Kershaw, on um, Facebook, and I'll help you. People message me all the time. Always answer. How do people get in touch with you? Just, just Facebook message me. Yeah. Um, and I'm, people do all the time and say, oh, I saw you make this, and what show was that on, or how did you do that? And I'm more than happy to help you. That's what I'm here for. Is it just your name on Facebook? Or? It's um, JM Guest Designer, um, Debbie Kershaw. But I've also got a private page that I let everyone on. As yeah, well. I, I did that. I set yeah. up a business one and they've just merged. Because I like to one. chat to everyone. Yeah. So, yeah. Right. Oh, this is the pendant. pendant that I one now. now, again, this might seem daunting if you didn't have the tool. Yeah, definitely. I'll recap how to set these very quickly in a minute. A sphere. Oh, I wonder what that was. A garnet. And what was the other one? Hang on. Emerald. Emerald. So a uh, garnet January's birthstone. Sphine. <laughs> <laughs> that 
that's not me. No, it isn't. Oh, no, don't row. I posted yesterday. I've got a few, you see. I had one that I had a long time ago. He's looking on the wrong one. He said I haven't posted since 2020. I posted yesterday. Here we go. This is the Ambilobi Sphine. is Ambibili. Oh, they had Toby on air a few weeks ago. Did he shout at you a lot? <laughs> Did he stamp up and down and shout a lot? Okay, question. Are you going to put it up or is it any? Sorry, say that again. Here you go. Uh, can you use the vice to hold the wire when wire wrapping, please? I need to know before buying. Ooh, it depends what you mean by hold the wire. It doesn't have tweezers on it. Um, it would hold your cabochon, say, while you were wrapping your wire around. It would hold your wire, you know, like the pegs, the old uh, jigs. It would hold your wire like that. So just if you wrap it around the peg, it will hold it. Um, do you remember the wire jigs? You could use it like that, where, you know, you can make a shape out of the wire. If you wanted to have something that you were wire wrapping, like when I'm uh, bezel setting a cabochon, sometimes I will press the cabochon down on here with a bit of blue tack or double-sided sticky tape, and then both of my hands are free to take my bezel wire around the outside. So it's really um, a have a play. It, as I said, it doesn't have tweezers that will grab onto it, but you can wrap it around like a wire jig. Yeah, you could do that. I why that choose, it says, why choose gold, Rose gold and sterling silver circle pendant with a four millimetre setting and three gemstones, a garnet, a sphene and an emerald. Now, this could definitely be made into a ring. I don't know if you remembered a few weeks ago, I actually made a ring similar to this from scratch. Oh, did you? If you nip off that jump ring yeah. and then add a bezel, that's a ring. Ah. So, you know, it can be, maybe if you get it, one can be a pendant and you can make the other one into <coughs> a ring if you're a, if you're a metal worker. Yeah. Now, if you're not a metal worker at all, you can still buy these because you just glue the stones in. Oh, OK. Where are we going on a price on this one, then? Oh. It's gone straight down on that one. 19.99. Sveen. Look how sparkly that Sveen is. I think, you know, if you went and had a quick price comparison for any gold-plated... Uh, findings of this nature you'd be surprised at how much you pay for each one yeah definitely especially the gold plated ones and the rose gold plated look at that with pearls i just i love a gemstone and a lovely simplicity um metal statement pendant with pearls or you know you can just put it on a chain obviously so what's that holding is that a jump ring holding the just a jump ring round thing onto the pearls yeah so you haven't got to re-thread the pearls you could you could put it onto an existing pearl necklace. Absolutely, that you've got. yeah. Also, they'd look lovely as a charm on a charm bracelet as well, wouldn't they? They wouldn't, they be, yeah. Oh, we go. Look at these charms. Who's this from? Monica Veneda. I love her stuff. She does lovely things. Oh yeah, beautiful. But you pay for it. Yeah, you do. <laughs> look at those. I'm sorry, I'm in vision. I'm too busy looking at all those gemstones. There. Lovely. Anyway, nineteen ninety nine. Oh no! Oh, is he going again? Yeah. I'm going to be dreaming about this clock tonight. The... Oh yeah, really? good idea. Oh, Ollie's full of ideas today. Isn't Ollie's he? good, you know. Is he yeah, like he this? gives me some good ideas. Mm. When he was on Stone Street, he didn't say a word. <laughs> Ollie's saying because we're going again. Multi buy, then you get two yellow gold, two rose gold, two silver, two garnets, two sphenes, and two emeralds. Okay, is it going to be? Ben Tom switches off again. Whoa! I've never had these in yellow gold or rose gold before. Fourteen ninety nine. Keep going through. Oh. Gorgeous. Oh, they're beautiful. They are. Oh, look at that garnet, January's birthstone. At $14.99. People are buying twos. I'm not surprised. Because, you know, you can use them all as pendants. You can use them as bracelet charms. They're very designer. Earrings, like you just said. Yeah. Um, or, as I said, snip off the jump ring. Don't. 
don't get rid of it, keep, keep it because you use it for something else. Right. And make a bezel and you can make a ring. Gorgeous. $14.95. I've got, still got another kit to do. We've only got 10 minutes left. Sorry. Why are you apologising Well, because I, I hope I haven't taken up too much time. I just get really excited. It's your hour, this one. <laughs> okay. Just be quiet, woman. <laughs> I need a sip of water. It's too exciting. Yes. Are, oh, the question is, are the gems easy to glue in? They are easy to glue in because what I did before I set them was I put the gems inside to make sure, because I always know I'm going to be asked that question. And also, when I used to work on another channel, we had a whole range of jewellery that was made to be glued in. So um, I know that people do that. So yes, very easy to glue in. You just need some um, hyper cement or something like that, um, or even some epoxy, you know, something really, really strong. Jeweler's glue, don't use super glue. Um, pop, pop it in with um, a cocktail stick or a piece of wire um, as to the manufacturer's guidelines. Pop your stone in and then just leave it. Leave it um, to set before you do anything else with it. They do fit. Mine did. Obviously, I can't speak for every single one we sell, but I had a good few, as you can see, and all of my stones fitted in lovely, really lovely, without me having to get my rotary tool out. So I was really impressed. Look at those studs. Yeah, we're coming up to the studs now. Now, the studs, there are no gemstones with the studs. They're just, well, I say just, that's what you need for them. It's the settings. So you can either use the peridot yep. from the kit, four or you might have the four millimetre on yep. them, round cut. Uh, rose gold, gold, and silver. Now, again, are these new in the rose gold and the gold today? They are. Also, sorry, if you want rose gold or gold little um, tube bezels for your other projects, we haven't had them. So just clip this um, ear wire off and solder them down onto your rings and things. Like, because we've got another way of getting them at the moment. 11 99 What? 11 99 It's four, four pounds each, that oh, makes that's sense. that's so it? good. Four pounds a set. Four pounds a set, so two pounds each or you four see, pounds I'd a set. You see, I'd buy multiples of these and use them for my rings as well and my pendants. If you bought the peridot, you know, yeah. the 9 99 peridot, the four mil rounds fit in this. Right. Because I've just tried it. Yeah, 11 99 They're gorgeous stud earrings, very classy. Just the right size as well, you're going to get that little circle of oh, gold. Beautiful. And then the gemstone in the middle, aren't you? Just shining. Yeah. Eleven ninety nine. Keep going through, keep That's going through. That's such a good price. Are oh, they no. supposed to be that? Yeah. Oh, I've got too excited. Yeah, have a sit down. <laughs> 11 pounds and 99 pence. Keep going through, lots of you there. Okay, there's a pack of three. What have I got in here then? What have I got? A peridot. And a kyanite. Yeah, two peridot and a kyanite. So what we're going to do is we're going to take it to a price, right, where you're just buying the two peridots and you get the kyanite for free. Isn't that what we're saying? So you can make your earrings as your four millimetre rounds. Yeah. Buy two packs. Yeah, buy two packs, definitely. Because look at the price for three gemstones when it gets there. 9 99 <gasps> £9 and 99 pence. I know. So you can, do, you can easily set those into these mounts because I've done it. I got these to check. Yeah, yeah. And you can glue them in as well if you want to. So you, oh. win, win. <laughs> <laughs> Lucky you're on the ball today. Very I thought nine, you told us 9 99 I was the happy. Price, yeah. Well done, everyone who's checked out so far. People are multi-bought already. You're going to pay the final new price. What are you going to do, Tom? Oh. He's asking advice now from Ollie. <laughs> no. Let me see. I don't know yet. Well done, everyone who's already bought them. Loads of you coming oh, in through for that. It's too exciting. I can't cope with the pressure. <laughs> four ninety nine for three gemstones. That is what can you get for four ninety nine? A coffee. Well, two peridots. <laughs> You can't get coffee and a cake these days, can you? Gorgeous. Okay. It's a what? Yeah, it, yeah. If you if you've already opened, sorry, I'm going no? just interrupted. No, go if on. you've already opened your order with the tool or with the kits, 
for 4 99 if you can, obviously, I'm not assuming everyone can afford everything, um, get this for 4 99 because these stones fit in all the mounts. Yeah, but buy two. Buy two. So, oh, yeah. Pamela's bought loads. Yeah, where, 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 where? Pamela, lovely strong name. Oh, right? yeah. Carol's there, Tracy's there, another Pamela's there, Karen's there, maker in North Yorkshire, Tracy, Eva, Linda, Wendy. And please remember to support those bezels when you are setting the stone. Don't just go in there. <laughs> Could you please support us all here at Jewel? <laughs> yeah. Because that's what she's about to say. For there. just £4.99 a month. <laughs> <laughs> um, buy two, buy two, buy two. Lots of you have. So support that little that little bezel there, like the way that I showed you with the pins, with anything that comes with the tool. If you haven't got the tool, you're going to find have to find another way. Right, we're going to check on the tool. We think there might be two left. I've got a pair, I've got another pair of earrings here, Ben Tom. This is a heavy piece of. It's kit. heavy, <laughs> and you're only paying your three ninety five post of packaging. Right, two hundred forty nine ninety nine, sixty two forty nine on split pay. You get that, but you get all of these as well. Oh, oh no! How many are left? Couple left. Couple left. Ooh, okay, so we've got two of these left. Um, okay, there's lots. Still of eleven baskets. in baskets, though. Mm. Still eleven in baskets. Janice was talking about doing four one mil wires. Oh, I don't know where they go. So I'm, I'm wondering, Janice, if if you're meaning, t could it could I clamp four pieces of wire in here? Into the yeah, 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 of course you could. Yeah, yeah you could. could do that. You'd open this out, wouldn't you? You'd put the wire in. I don't have. Do I have any? No, no, sorry. So you could open the wire here like that. You open this out, and yeah. then you put your piece of wire in there. Put your what's that called? Beading thingy. Yeah, just well, with this. Yeah. Just put any sort of material yeah. in there just to protect it. Felt, this is just bead foundation that I had yeah. in my studio. Um, pop them in and this will close and clamp anything you want in there. So I'm not really sure what design you're going for, but if you're talking about whether you can hold wire in there, in that middle part, yes, of course. Oh yeah, because it clamps it clamps completely it. That, yes, together. It will. There's no gap there or anything. Sorry, yeah. if, if that's what you meant, then yes. Well, I wonder if it's that, was it Janice that asked the question? Yes. Because there's a Janice there, look. Oh, no, there's also Janice over there as oh, well. Oh, there's, there's other Janice. There's two Janices. But, yeah, you could clamp it. We, I hope I've answered the question. I'm not 100% sure what you mean, but I've, I've told you to the best. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. What? Uh, you won't... Well, no, I'm not in again the building till the 1st of May. I'm back on Sound Street on the 1st of May. Uh, if you want me back on here, you'll have to get on with Wayne because he only, he only invites me on when absolutely everybody else has said no. I'm the only one... Oh, there. he does No, Surely. He does, but I've had a lovely time. I always do. I uh, don't forget, stay where you are, because Hobby Makers up straight after the break. Thank you so much. Been it's lovely, lovely to, to work you. with yeah. you. And um, well, Dave's up in a minute with lots of goodies. They've set them all out. So it's going to be fantastic. Are we going to go now? Then we'll go. Say goodbye. Bye. Bye. <laughs>